Good morning, jewellery makers, and good morning, Monica. Good morning. Hello. She's over there. Monica, I reckon this must be the first time in... Oh, two, three months we've worked this... It's not the first yeah. time, no. Have we worked Maybe this the year? first time this year. Could oh, be. Oh, gosh. Could be. <laughs> it's been anyway, a while. How are you? I'm very good, thank ah. you. <laughs> good to see you. Oh, Monica has been given the most amazing lucite flowers today. Oh. oh they're so much fun to work with. I love You've them. You've been let loose them. with them again. <laughs> they are so cute, aren't they? They are. I, and there's so many things you can do with them. Um, yeah. They're great fun. And, and it almost makes you feel like it's spring. Oh, almost. <laughs> almost. Don't get ahead of yourself, Monica. Uh, almost. <laughs> Honestly, we kind of be lulled into this lovely uh, sunshine and then it just rains. It's going to rain all day today, I think. So just stay inside. What's Jewelry Maker? Have you been noticing over the last uh, week or so little bluebells? Kind of little, yeah. We've got a couple of rogue bluebells that yes. have just kind of grown in our garden. They're adorable. Sort of odd ones in my yes, garden. Little yeah. odd ones. They're so sweet, aren't they? Um, and hopefully, yeah, these lucite flowers are going to really make you feel like it's springtime. We've gone for really, really big kits of lucite flowers coming up in the uh, 12 o'clock hour today. Nine o'clock, we've got these beautiful sliding class bracelets and you're going to be getting crystals with them and gemstones as well. The sliding class bracelets are absolutely good. They're proper gemstone ones, aren't they? They are. I mean, if you've never had slider bracelets before, these are the ones to get. These are like the, the ultimate slider bracelets. Well, you've got a tanzanite one, we've got a tiger's eye, um, sorry, a, a tanzanite one, we've got a topaz one, we've got a t uh, turquoise one and a garnet one. Oh, brilliant. They're gorgeous. They're so lovely. Um, and you get beautiful crystals with them as well, which is really exciting. Um, we're going to be joined by Dave at 10 o'clock because uh, your deal of the day today, finally, we get the chance to launch the Highlight Opal. So... This is a really, really unusual gemstone. It is an opal. Uh, when you get this in the ultraviolet light, it fluoresces. It's beautiful. It's got this amazing kind of silvery clarity to it. It's beautiful stuff. We've got them in cabochons. We've got them in a couple of strands. That's going to be coming your way at 10 o'clock. And we've also got brand new... Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? We've also got Paraba Quartz coming your way on the show today as well. Beautiful colours. Look at this. This is really, really beautiful. Ooh. Gorgeous, gorgeous colours. You can see why it's called Paraba Quartz. Totally natural, by the way. 100% natural. Really excited about that. Um, <clears throat> we've also got, in this hour, by the way, the most amazing, amazing, amazing um, toggle clasp necklace. This is all one necklace. All sterling silver. I love this. Isn't that toggle beautiful? So, so, so cute. Also got a gorgeous half-drilled um, peach-coloured pearl as well. Loads of findings and components coming up in this hour as well. In fact, do you know what? Go to our website, jewelrymaker.com. Um, you can see all the items we've got scheduled in this hour. Got a really interesting green adventuring and soda light bundle as well. That is going to go super low. That's going to be a brilliant deal. Um, nice big gems there. I've got the massive big spools of the uh, fire line as well. Ooh. Did you manage to get that when that was on, uh, Monica? I, I didn't, I missed it. <laughs> Honestly, it, was, it caused absolute pandemonium. It was yeah. like the M25 on a Friday afternoon. It was crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, we've got loads on the website. All of it's going to disappear at 9am though, so please get them ahead of time. Look at all the head pins uh, we've got there as well. Head pins and eye pins in this hour as well. Get them as quickly as you can. Uh, very, very, very excited about the eye pin bundle we've got there for eight ninety nine, eye to eye. Oh, exciting storage box. Oh, that's brilliant. Got a gorgeous star connector, tiger's eye hay goose. All of it coming your way. Fancy shape white freshwater culture pearls on a chain. I've got that right here. Results well. a fifty centimeter chain. Loads. It's all going to disappear at nine a.m. So please get it ahead of time. Um, before we do anything, should we go to the um, should we go to the Wall of Fame and see some of your incredible pieces? Let's go. We'll see you there. Do you know what? This is gorgeous. We're starting off with two nine two. Monica, you're going to love this. Look at this. Ah, oh, isn't that pretty? Isn't that beautiful? Oh. This is from lovely Sharon Staunton. Good morning, crew. I haven't entered for a long time. Here's my uh, Wall of Fame entry. Daffodils and a Kingfisher, made from my Yuki Delicas and bought from JM. I hope you like them. Love the inspiration from designers and fellow JM viewers. 
Good luck with the draw. Thank you for all your shows. Looking forward to the birthday week. Love to you all, says Sharon. Sharon, that is an absolute work of art. You've done beautifully there. We're really excited about our birthday. We were talking about it yesterday. It kicks off on Monday uh, with myself and Natalie. Really exciting. Um, it's going to be really, really, really exciting. Um, Ollie's been recording things this morning. All I'm going to say is Tahitian pearls. I know, amazing. Julia Tinsley, you're number 293. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous oh, necklace. Wow. Twisted necklace using green quartzite, 10 mil rounds. And teal seed bead spacers. I hope you like it. That looks really nice. So fresh and springy, that one, Julia. Gorgeous. Number 294, this is from Michelle Reed. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous necklace there. This is, oh gosh, they're 10 mil round pearls. Uh, I've done a fair uh, bit of knotting, but on other projects, uh, sorry, on other projects, but nothing as expensive as these. I've used a three mil black diamond gold plated box clasp to finish the look. I'm so pleased with the result. Thank you for enabling me to produce such high quality professional jewellery at such good prices. Everything is from JM. Michelle, that's what we're here for. We're here to give you access and to give you that kind of confidence. Well done. That's gorgeous. Who's your entry from uh, Monica? Mine is number 295 from Linda. Oh! <laughs> Oh. oh, the lovely elephants. Good morning, everyone. Here is a necklace I have made. It is blue magnesite and clear quartz. I made the wrapped findings and finished with some chain. I hope you like it. Oh, it's gorgeous. I love the different shapes of the gemstones. They're lovely, and I love those elephants. They're so cute. Yeah. <laughs> okay, then I've got number 296. Ooh, I recognize that. <laughs> um, Isabel Morgan. Hello, lovely friends. I've got crisscross crazy. I just can't stop. Thanks for this fabulous skill, Mark. Thank you so much, Isabel. That's gorgeous. Thank you so much. Yeah. Then I've got 297 from Kate. Oh, pretty. Hi, all. Here's a simple mukite and pearl stretchy bracelet, all from JM. Thanks for the daily inspiration and entertainment. Oh, Kate, that's gorgeous. Thank you so much for that. Is that the last one? That's the last one, yeah. Oh, gorgeous. Thank you so much. You're all so talented. We've got loads coming up. Go and have a look on the website. Just add, just add whatever you can onto your order. Good morning, JM team from a very cloudy poolside in Rhodes. Oh, oh there she, she's showing off. I know it's cloudy, but you're still by a pool in Rhodes. Um, so she's not in Yorkshire today. Unless there's a Rhodes in Yorkshire. I don't, I don't think there is. Uh, have a wonderful time, Mary. I hope the sun shines in you, my darling. I'm guessing it's Gorgeous. warmer there than it is here, even if it's cloudy. I think anywhere is warmer than here <laughs> yeah. at the minute, Monica. I don't think that's, I don't think that's particularly challenging. freezing this challenge. morning. <laughs> Gorgeous. Right, should we get going? Yellow Tigers, eh? Hi, Goose. These are just gorgeous. Starting off with this absolutely beautiful strand. Beautiful, hey, Goose. Aren't they gorgeous? Yellow Tigers, eye. 14 mil in size. Aren't they beautiful? Oh. Gorgeous colours. We do love this donut shape. It's really lovely, isn't it? It's got that gorgeous connection to kind of your uh, high goo jewellery, your kind of connection between heaven and earth, but a really useful shape to use as well, isn't it? It is, and it's nice when they're drilled as well, because then you've got a lot more options. You can put something in the middle of it. You can attach it almost as if it's a, a link as well. Yeah. So, yeah. Absolutely. Do you know what we've also that. got as well coming up in this out? And I know people ask these kind of things a lot. You could literally get... I don't know whether to take these off or not. Oh no, no, oh, no. I know, somebody stop me. <laughs> somebody stop me. You literally get your head pin, pop it through one of these. Oh, here we go. This is, this is where it all starts to fall apart. Don't stop it. They're being very cruel to me in here. Maybe with the... <laughs> oh, all right. Gosh, they are being so cruel to me this morning. They're saying, oh, here she goes, here she goes, making jewelry again. Here we go, look, I'm just, oh. Trying to get this through. There we go. Get your head back. All right. Oh my gosh. I'm getting all sorts of. What, what price are we at? 19.99. Okay. I reckon we can do better than that, Neri. There's no issue. There's a head pin. I'm popping it through into the. <laughs> I messed it up. Here we go. There we go. This is what I was trying to show. So you get your. You get. Your, I know. Leave the jewelry to the professionals. Put your head pin through there. Put your head pin through the other drill hole as well, and you've got a lovely kind of floating like thing. A connector, yeah, exactly. Are you smiling because you like it? Are you smiling because I did uh, such a bad job at doing that, Monica? <laughs> Keep your thoughts to yourself, love. All right. For <laughs> it doesn't seem to take a long time. Fourteen ninety nine. I'm smiling because you managed to get there in the end. <laughs> <laughs> And she's so proud. Fourteen ninety nine for your gorgeous tiger's eye. Don't be nasty. Oh, they're being so horrible to me. 
Uh, well done. There's only two. Okay, I'm never going to get that out. That's never coming out, by the way. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, no. <laughs> you got to straighten oh, that before Oh, Michael. Oh, no. I've got tweezers stuck in it now. Oh, no. <laughs> Do you know what? Just just get them. Full just help me out. I need to go in A&E. Let's go to A&E. There we go. 14.99. There you are, Michael. Have fun with that. There we go. Uh, Denise, well done to you in, Shef in uh, Sheffield. Well done to Mayor. Well done to Jill in Manchester. has got two. Please don't follow my uh, tutorials. <laughs> uh, yeah, gorgeous. Well done, everyone. 14 99 for you today. Well done. We've got the head pins coming up. I can do the head pins. Come on, if you want to do my design, I call it... Have you done it? Oh, there we go. Michael's oh, made himself an earring. Here. Perfect. Oh, gorgeous. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> head to head. Silver plated. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, all of them. Rose gold plated... Um, oh. Base metal, gold plated base metal, silver plated base metal head pins. There you go, you get a hundred of each, bring you a total of 300. Come and make something on air now, says Neary, um, says uh, Angela. What do you mean you got nothing in the locker? You would be amazing. Come on, come on, Neary. Neary's going to make something in the gallery a mess. I think he's going to make a mess in there. Uh, 19 99 for you today. That's for 300 of your head pins. You can never have enough um, uh, findings like this. And, and, and also, we were talking about this yesterday. Eye pins, you can kind of make yourself, not necessarily consistently like we've got here, head pins. Unless you've got a soldering, uh, a soldering to a blowtorch, you can't make them yourself, can you? Absolutely. And especially the plated ones. Even if you have a blowtorch, the plated ones you wouldn't be able to do. So, yeah. Yeah, good call, good call. Yeah, so if they are plated, plated base metal. Neri, are you making something in there? I don't know what he's doing in there. <laughs> We've asked him to make some jewelry. I don't know what he's doing. Well done, Catherine, well done, Pamela. Gorgeous, 19.99. Well done, everybody. Go, go, go. 0800 644 655. No, don't give them to me, give them to... <laughs> oh, so sorry, so it's, more, it's all happening this morning. <laughs> Oh, I had to hold on very tightly then um, during that sneeze. Thank you for that. Well, no, I was just a bit worried something else was going to happen as well. Anyway, 300 head pins. We're all friends. We're all friends. Gosh, I'm so sorry, everyone. For my unprofessionalism. I don't know why you've given these seed beads to me. I'm not going to be able to make anything with them. Monica could literally make a, I don't know, a nuclear reactor using uh, using um, um, uh, seed beads. There's nothing she can't do with seed beads. They are pretty amazing. Well done. Sherbet rainbow. Sherbet. <laughs> Sherbet lemon. Oh, if we had any shell pearls, you were going to challenge Monica to make a backpack. <laughs> yes, make something with that, love. Uh, she did, and she'd probably just go, okay. <laughs> Do you want it with a zip or without a zip? As long as you don't want me to make it out of 15 O's, that's fine. <laughs> Imagine that, we'd be here till next year. Oh yes, look at these. Aren't they gorgeous colours? You know, I just bought this bundle. Hey? I just bought this bundle, I got it home the other day. Oh, did you? Because you so very rarely get 15 O's uh, in the colours. Uh, we have them in gold and silver usually, but 15 O's in the colours are amazing. And one of those little tubes is going to go such a long way in the 15 O's. I think as well they're going to look amazing with the lucite flowers you've oh, got coming absolutely. up in the 12, yes. don't you think? Yes, it's perfect colours for that. Similar kind of florally tones that you're going to be getting in those gorgeous lucite flowers. These are aqua green, aqua sky blue, duracoat pink neon, opaque red and purple ceylon. They've all got that lovely kind of pearlized finish on them. You've got some seed beads and you've also got... Oh, no, they're all seed beads, aren't they? Yeah, they're all 15 O's. Yeah, they're all 15 O's. Yeah. They're gorgeous. Good morning. Could you show 39, please, says Donna. Yes, of course. Joyce, Michaela, Makel, Makel, Maker, Gerati, Linda, Maker, Jacqueline, Amanda. Oh, heck, Carol. Understand the hidden effects of a powerful sneeze. I know. I know. I, I connect with her audience, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, even looking at a trampoline just makes me, woo, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Donna, you've got amazing taste. Oh. You have got amazing taste. <gasps> yes, yes, yes. <gasps> oh. Magok Jedi Red Spinel Smooth Rondelles. Oh, my gosh. Wow. And look how neon these are. 
Oh my gosh. Uh, do you know what I'm gonna do? I don't know whether we've got it. Oh, we've got it, honey. We got it. Let's have a look. Oh my gosh. Look at that. That is so fluorescent, isn't it? My gosh, that's like a strand of jelly. You are looking here at some of the rarest spinel in the world, all the way from Burma. The most beautiful color, $29.99. That is absolutely your price point today. Well done. We're going to give you um, uh, just literally 30 seconds and then we're taking those details away. Well done, everybody. 0800 644 655. Can you believe that? Just $29.99. If you're Magok Jedi Red Spinel Smooth Rondells, they are gorgeous. Yeah, now I know a lot of people are kind of uh, kind of uh, using these um, and have been using these fairly recently with things like Gorgeous um, uh, Jade. Just have a look at it with this. If you wanted to use it as spaces in between your Gorgeous Burmese Jade, uh, then that would be absolutely wonderful. It's got such a lovely, lovely kind of pop of colour to it, which goes beautifully with your Jade Greens, doesn't it? Just twenty nine ninety nine. Well done, gorgeous. Now I want to show you very quickly. King has just passed it over. Bad boy, bad boy, what are you going to do? What are you going to do when they come for you? My gosh. Wow. Oh. My gosh. You probably can't tell how big that is there. If I put it in my hand. Wow. Look at the size of that. I was just gonna say from all the way across the studio here, it's massive. <laughs> this is a huge 12 and a half to 13 and a half half drilled pearl. Wow. Comes to you in a box, amazing. That is a star by coming up in this hour. Absolutely gorgeous, can't wait to bring you that, that's gonna be amazing. Is this the early bird or a star buy? What do you reckon, Neri? Starry, starry buy. 10 minutes away, gorgeous. Right, where are we going now? Pearls on a chain. <gasps> I love this. This reminds me of the necklace that Mark made on Sunday, which was so, so, so lovely. Gorgeous pearls, which have been electroplated kind of around the edge and then popped onto a chain. This is so lovely. I'm a big fan of these big kind of marquise kind of overly linked um, links that you get here. Don't you love that electroplating? Isn't that beautiful? Just gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Just hugs that pearl, just kind of drapes over that pearl so beautifully. Yeah, melts over the pearl, if you like. Gorgeous quality. Um, and then you get this really stunning, <clears throat> that's a good idea actually, popping red spinel kind of inside the marquee shape if you wanted to. So lovely. Just by popping a clasp on that, that could be a beautiful bracelet. Uh, Jill, Pat, Maker, well done. There's loads of you there. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's take a little bit of money off the price point for you. Taking it a little bit lower for you today. Oh, I absolutely love that. £24.99. pence. Yeah, if you want to separate it out or maybe make it into gorgeous earrings, you could. Um, but that is a bracelet or is a lovely anklet maybe. Oh, lovely wedding jewellery. And those are huge pearls. I mean, if you think about it, I mean, if, you, if you're going to a shop, you'd, you'd buy a piece of plastic finished necklace for that sort of price. This is genuine pearls. I mean, just look at them. They're so gorgeous, aren't they? They really are. And I think that electroplating really frames them nicely, doesn't it? Absolutely, yes. yes. It really frames them so beautifully. June, well done to you. Geraldine, we've got you there as well. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. 0800 644 655. Look, we've got a maker in Devon coming to join us as well. So nice to see you all this morning. This is just gorgeous. And they're all unique individual pieces you're going to be getting here because they're all genuine freshwater culture pearls. It's not something which is, um, it's not something which is um, uh, kind of, um, uh, you know, mass produced. Look, look at the quality of these pearls as well. There's Mickey Mouse. Oh, I'm Mickey. Gorgeous. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Beautiful. Okay, let's do these eye pins now. Now, if you're going to be making... If you're going to be making a, um, an articulated chain, an articulated necklace, anything where it's going to swing or move or kind of hinge, then uh, these are absolutely perfect. Carol, I bought two strands. Oh. Hello. 
I bought two strands of the fancy shaped pearls on a chain. Both were so different and both amazingly beautiful, says Vera. See? Oh. See? Vera knows. Vera knows. Gorgeous. Here we go. Love, love, love these eye pins. Um, what's so great about these is, is that they are, you know, the, the eyes are all the same size. The wire's been slightly work hardened as well, so it's nice and strong, isn't it? It is, yes, but it's, it's still soft enough, obviously, that you can still work with it. Of course. And also, I mean, eye pins, you think an eye pin is an eye pin and you can get one anyway, but actually that's not true because a lot of eye pins that you buy from other places, when you start turning the wire, the, the plating comes off. Ah. I've never had that with a jewellery maker eye pin. They're, they're always perfect. That's um, it. So it's the only place I would get my eye pins and, and my head pins as well. That's a really good point, actually. Yeah, if you grab hold of it with a pair of uh, pliers and you start kind of, you know, making a loop on the other end yeah. or doing whatever it is or twisting it to work hard and even more, um, I can imagine, yeah, the yeah. plating coming off plating on some of them. comes off from other... Gosh, other that's interesting, yeah. you see. And also, just to say as well, that the yellow gold plating, the rose gold plating, the silver plating you're going to be getting here will be the same across all of our findings, which is great. So it's not going to be kind of slightly different yeah. in colour to um, other plated findings and components that we might have. Uh, they'll all be the same, uh, which is just amazing. It's that lovely kind of gold standard that we work to all the time. Jane's bought three loads of these. Michaela's got two loads. These are absolute essentials. They really genuinely are. Like the head pins are essentials for things like your bubble style bracelets. There is, th these are essentials for your uh, long line necklaces, for your bracelets. Um, 8 99 is your deal today. Norman, Shirley, Ivy, Sharon, well done to you, my lovelies. And you're getting in total 300 of your eye pins, which is absolutely brilliant. Well done. 300. Yeah, three pence an eye pin. Wow. That's ridiculous, isn't it? Absolutely brilliant. Well done. Three pence an eye pin. Valerie, Elaine, well done to you as well. Lots and lots of people getting involved this morning. So good to see you all with us. Gorgeous. We've got so much... Oh, Barbara, well done to you, my lovely. Gorgeous. Oh, it's just so lovely. It's great to have you all with us today. Well done, everyone. Oh, my word, they're going everywhere. 300. 300 eye pins sounds like a lot, doesn't it? But And it is a lot, but you will end up using them. You're, yeah. you're using them very quickly. Yeah, you can never um, have enough eye pins and head pins, to be honest. That's exactly it. If you're making things like bubble-style necklaces, bracelets, Absolutely. you know, you're going to need hundreds of those. Um, exactly, Neary. You're going to need loads of them, aren't you? See, there we go. You need all... Oh, gosh, I'm making a right mess over here today. I'm so sorry, everyone. <laughs> Terribly unprofessional. Oh, my... There we go. Sorry. Oh, gosh, it's gone on my lap. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, that one's come out. Sorry, everyone. There we go. Forgive me, Peppa Pig. Right, here we go. Where are we going now, Neary? Lots of... Lots of screaming this morning. I can't actually focus. Lots of quietness now. Right. Okay. Where are we going now, love? I've got loads. Mm, I've got some chain. Ooh. Ooh. A meter. Is that a meter? It's a little bit more than a metre, I reckon. But anyway, this is a gorgeous Kerbling chain. Oh, it's a weighty chain, this is. Mm. This is nice. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. Look at the lustre on that. That's absolutely amazing. We said this the other day when we bought this to air. Yes. Uh, silver plated base metal chain. <laughs> We said that this, because it's so, it's so, I mean, this is so robust, this chain. Make a great strap for one of your... One of the purses, yeah. Purses. Absolutely, absolutely. Because it really is really, really strong chain. It's not a fine chain, so it would absolutely And you do sometimes find with those lovely kind of clutch bags that you buy, that there is a chain that comes with them and it's just, it, it doesn't take up too much room. It just literally pulls in yeah. the bottom of the bag. It's exactly. just, it's just great. It just exactly. folds away really nicely. Yeah. But isn't, it was really interesting. Yeah, the first thing we said was, oh, gosh, we go with one of Monica's um, shell pearl bags. Um, gorgeous. I'm waiting for Monica to make a shell pearl suitcase, actually. <laughs> I think uh, we need to set her a challenge. <laughs> Imagine that. Mm. Mm. No, I can't, Carol. And I'm not. <laughs> 4 99 for you today. Well done, everyone. Sally and Cornwall, well done to you, my darling. Oh, big long head pins. These are lovely. 
Lovely big long head. Why am I going to need slightly longer head pins, Monica? Well, I for one, I really like long earrings. So the easiest thing to do is just Yay. put a, a, um, a gemstone on the end of it and then a loop at the top and you've got a nice long drop. That's exactly it, yeah. Um, but also, it also leaves you lots of extra um, wire to work with. So if you want to do a wrapped loop, uh, if, you, if you want to put, because with a normal head pin, if you put one gemstone on there, you still have enough to make a wrapped loop on the end. Uh, but if you want to put more than one gemstone on, then obviously you run out of wire to do a wrap loop. So the extra long ones are really good for that. Yeah, so for more gemstones, for larger gemstones, also, do, please don't forget, these are sterling silver, by the way. So well, let's say you put a, I don't know, an eight mil gemstone on there. You've got enough there to make a loop and to, and to do whatever with. You're going to have all of this left over. This is sterling silver wire. Please, 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 please. Just don't, don't throw it away. Don't discard it. Put it in a little box. Make sure you keep it with all the other sterling silver pieces. There's enough there to make a little mini eye pin. There's enough there maybe to make an earring finding. Yeah. There's enough there to make a, maybe a really basic clasp. You've got, you've got loads and loads and loads left over. It's, it's kind of your, it's your 20 sterling silver 75 mil head pins and so much more. You know, if your head pins are normally about 40 mil, so that's about that, isn't it? You've got all of that and, and what's under my finger left over. It's just incredible. Jill, Jacqueline, why don't you Pearl make a Diane, Emma, 12.99 and it's all sterling silver. You know, although, you know, we do, um, you know, bring you lots and lots of sterling silver, it is a precious commodity. It is something which um, we struggle to get and we have to buy it whatever the price is, um, consistently uh, we can't uh, we don't have the luxury of buying sterling silver at the lowest price point and then stockpiling it we can't do that because we produce so many sterling silver items every single day every single month here on jewelry maker so because of that it means that it means that you know we have to buy sterling silver whatever price it is and those prices especially over the COVID-19 pandemic, rose by kind of 30 to 40%. It's crazy. It's absolutely bonkers. It's had, a, it's had an effect around the world on jewellery prices. Um, bonkers. Right, where are we going now, lovely? Oh, yeah, brilliant. We've got an awesome star by now. This is an Aventurine and Sodalite strand. It's a bundle. It is so inexpensive. How many do we have, Neri? Oh, ooh. that's not the price he just said. <laughs> Ten pounds a strand. You've got your sodalite. You've got your aventurine. Beautiful. That's natural Indian aventurine, by the way. Gorgeous. Love that sagey colour. Don't you love that so light? It's beautiful, like a gorgeous icy planet. Oh, it's beautiful. We have not done a bundle like this for what feels like an absolute eternity. This is definitely old school. It really feels like something which uh, we would have maybe bought to wear, I don't know, nine years ago. Yes. Uh, just two strands. Do they go together? Of course they do. You've got your gorgeous kind of earth, um, your beautiful green, uh, lush, grassy tones there. You've got your sky blues. You've got your white. Of course, it's going to go together. Springtime. It's uh, summer. It's going to be big jewellery. Lots of people try and do pearl knotting. And actually, one of our Wall of Fame entries this morning was from a lady who... Uh, it was Michelle Reed who knotted that gorgeous 10 mil pearl necklace... It was number 294. There we go. This is from lovely Michelle. And Michelle said, I finally plucked up the courage to finally knot these pearls. If you find yourself in a situation like Michelle where you've got these gorgeous pearls and you think, gosh, you know, I, you know, I don't want to, my very first knotting to be with this strand of pearls. I want to try it with something else first. Try it with this. Yeah. Try it with this because they're big, they're beautiful, they've got big drill holes, they're very forgiving. And um, if you do it with something like an Eslon, you'll make a really awesome necklace. This, by the way, is, is every, single, every single summer, you can guarantee there's going to be nautical colour themes. There's going to be blues and whites every single summer. These kind of greens will go with absolutely every colour. They'll suit every skin tone, hair colour, eye colour, absolutely 100%. Why? Because it's a colour found in nature. We're at 14 .99. Denise in Sheffield, well done, you've got two. Tina, Maker, Maker in Bedfordshire, well done to you. Now... If I'm going to be using this as kind of almost a practice bundle to do pearl knotting with, to do uh, my beaded jewellery with, 
maybe to make my very first stretchy bracelets. Really easy gems to use, really kind of instantly kind of, you know, the gratification you get making that first piece of jewelry is just amazing. So there's your gorgeous, there's your gorgeous green. I love this, naturally this color, naturally this color, isn't that beautiful? It's like Imperial Jade, isn't it? But without the kind of, the kind of glowing clarity, it's got that gorgeous color though, hasn't it? And then look at this so light, it's probably not gonna go with this top, but if I put it around my wrist, Loving, loving, loving the range of colour. I love so light. Oh, it's got lovely wispy whites in there. It's a really beautiful. Just like a whimsical lapis lazuli, yeah, isn't it? Really nice. We're well. now at eleven pounds ninety nine pence. Oh, that, should, that should be for one strand. Absolutely. So we're looking at around about six pounds a strand. Yeah. So yesterday we had mystery strands. There were four ninety nine the mystery strands. Would you be happy if you bought two of those mystery strands and these two strands turned up? Absolutely. I said, Coco, here's your deal. We're taking the mystery out of the mystery strand. These are the two strands you're going to be getting. Five pounds a strand. Here we go. Oh, wow. 9.99. Oh my gosh. Just go. Get them. Go, 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 go. Well done. Wow. Just get them. Go. This, this I think is for every single jewelry maker out there who's maybe brand new, never made anything before. Get this, get, get the findings pack, um, uh, we, uh, which we've got available on our website. Um, get your elastic, get your fire line, and just have fun. Just have fun. That's what jewelry making should be. It should be fun, it should be relaxing, it should be gratifying, it should be mindful, it should be relaxing. Um, 500 carats of green adventurine and your sewed light there for 9.99. 45 seconds, hang on, Ollie, you got the wrong clock in. Wrong clock. Or is it not? Oh. 9.99. Not your price. 9.99, not your price. Enjoy everyone. 20 seconds, we're taking the price point down. This is a, this is an old school bundle for an old school price at 9.99. How about a new, a new school, old school? Oh, I, don't, I don't even know what I'm saying. How about we take it even lower? There we go. I think that's it. Yeah. Here we go. All the way down. Enjoy. Here's your deal. 9 is not your price. Oh. £7.99. Wow. How brilliant is that? And as you say, if somebody's just starting out, I mean, that's quick jewellery to make a necklace and a, a pair of earrings from just one of those strands. Yeah. Thank you. 15 minutes, even if you're a beginner. Absolutely. Add some spaces in there and you could easily make a bracelet as well and kind of eke those sizes out, eke those gems out even more if you really want to. Well done. Penny's got two of these. Wow. Susan's got four of them. Jennifer's got two of them. Over the kind of, over May half term, over the coronation festivities, you might be doing little make and takes at your local village yeah. hall. You know, if there's a cake sale on or something or if there's garden parties, you might want to do a little make and take. I can't think of better gemstones to work with. They're big, they're bold, they're beautiful. Uh, they're not tiny little things which you, you know, you need a certain amount of kind of eyesight for. Um, <clears throat> these are just going to be absolutely wonderful to use for kind of make and take things. And look at the price point as well. Four pounds a strand. It's absolutely brilliant. Well done, everybody. Loads of people coming through. Julie, Susan, Maker, Anne, Christine, Jennifer, Ken, Diane, Margaret, Carolyn, Maker, Maker. You've got all these in your baskets. Check out lots of multi bidders. Vera, Tina's got two. Christine's got two. Ollie, well, Ollie's just not listening to me at all. Clock in, we're going lower. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, we're going lower, we're going lower. Stupid, 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 stupidy, stupidy, stupidy. But do you know what? I think things like this deserve to get a home. They deserve to be in your home. When we first started Jewelry Maker, these are exactly the kind of gemstones and shapes that we, um, that we were bringing to air. And I'll tell you something we did the other day. We did a... Um, we did, a, we did a showcase of a gemstone. I can't remember what the gemstone was. And as soon as we bought the rounds to wear, they really started to fly. And it's, people love rounds. Yes. They're easy to work easy. with, aren't they? They're easy to wear as well. Yes. Yeah. Classic shape, classic bead, classic shape, easy to hold, easy to see the drill hole, and just loads of fun. Enjoy. This is what jewellery making should be. Easy, fun, and just gratifying and then you can move on to the kind of more challenging wow. stuff then you can move on to stuff which is a little bit more challenging 677 that is absolutely as low as we're going today amazing well done everybody you've got such a great such a great deal here today well done Michaela's got two of these well done Penny's got three of these 
Carolyn's got two, Surrey's got two, Meryl's got two, well done to you. Uh, well done to you. Lo Susan's bought four. Well done to you. Jennifer's got two. If you run brownies or guides or a troop of cubs or scouts or beavers, whoever it is, and you want to kind of do something a little bit fun with them, a little fun activity. This is great because if you give kids beads which are too little to use and sometimes they struggle to hold them, struggle to thread them, or this is great for developing fine motor skills as well. Just brilliant. Susan's bought five now. Well done to you, my lovely. 677. Well done, everyone. George has got two. Oh, you can really increase your stash here. Also, if you're going to be making pieces for maybe um, earth or, or environmental charities, um, uh, then these are great gemstones to use because you've got the gorgeous greens, you've got the beautiful blues. It's gorgeous. And we've got school fates coming up as well. So this would be totally. a great strength. Turn them into, into just earrings and donate them to your school to sell at a school fate. I'd make a load of money from those. Absolutely. Yeah. And especially during one of the three bank holidays we've got uh, coming up. <laughs> yes. The first being Monday. We're, we'll still be here, don't worry. It's our first day of our birthday celebrations on Monday. Please, please, please do not do anything on Monday other than be here on Jewelry Maker. It's the first day of our birthday celebrations. We've got Natalie with us. We've got... I don't want to give too much away. Am I okay? To, yeah. Amazing pearl deals. Ridiculous sterling silver deals. Um, it's going to... Mm, Natural blue pearls. Mm -hmm. That sounds exciting. Honestly, it is a birthday to end all birthdays. It's absolutely crazy. Look at everyone who's got these in their baskets. Please check out. These are just the baskets. Look at that. Sophie's got three in her basket. Suits, uh, Chris has got two in her basket. Um, Gloria, Maker, Linda, Maker, Dorothy, Maker, Dawn, Rosmond. Check out your baskets. Well done, everyone. Loads and loads and loads of you there. Well done. Okay. Shall we do a star buy? This. This is high fashion. I love it. The price is amazing. And honestly, this is completely unique, I think, to Jewelry Maker. I absolutely love this. I believe this was a deal of the day the other week. I just think this is so cool. That's it, that's how it should be. Just look at the quality you are getting here. Isn't that gorgeous? Such a well-made piece of jewellery right there, isn't it? So well-made. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that gorgeous? I have not seen another toggle class like this where the toggle has got yeah. pearls on either end. It's just so, it's so different. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Don't you love that slightly beaded, twisted yeah. toggle you've got there as well? And then the ultra shiny, ultra smooth loop for this to go through. Such a lovely, lovely piece. Graphics alive in nine seconds. I just love it. I think it's so beautiful. It's so high fashion. It's got such gorgeous quality to it. And there's nothing else like it out there. Nothing else like it at all. Lots of toggle class. You can get toggle class from various different places. But this is completely and utterly unique, as far as I'm concerned, to Jewelry Maker. Now, this comes to you as a ready-made piece with the sterling silver paper clip chain. Now, the paper clip chain is, is well, it is, a, it is a lovely, lovely chain. Um, I've got, um, Neary, have you got the slide I sent to you, lovely, today? With the, um, it's, just, it's just got a chain on there. The paperclip chain is, is, is used a lot by different designers, um, but one of the main designers that use the paperclip chain in their pieces is, um, is um, 
Monica Veneda, have a look at this. Mini paperclip chain, adjustable necklace, 18 inches in length. It's, it, it's 80 quid. Really, I'm showing it to you just to kind of highlight that, you know, it is big designers like Monica Veneda who do chains like this. Really, really lovely. And it is, I think, a bit like the Figaro chain, which was very, very popular a few years ago. I think this has kind of taken over that kind of, taken over the gambit, if you like. It's got that really gorgeous, sleek, stylish quality to it. You've got that really unusual toggle class, something which you just don't find anywhere else of that kind of toggle class, do you? Um, and it's nice how different it is to that loop there. That kind of contrast is really lovely. Obviously, as a necklace, it's absolutely perfect. 18 inches in length, but as a bracelet, this is going to look gorgeous. Can I take it off there? Is that all right? This has got a lovely look as a bracelet. Um, the, the great thing about this moniker is that, of course, because it's got that lovely paper clip kind of edge to it, you can add on to it. You can. See, my first thought was to get two of them, mm. take one and turn it into kind of like a bubble style necklace. So yeah. add some pearls or whatever onto the middle of it. Then you can wear that with the clasp at the back as a bubble style necklace. Yeah. Or you can attach the other chain and have the two clasps on either side of your neck. So I think when we bought these two air, when I bought these to air before or something similar to this, we said exactly the same. Yeah. You've ostensibly got a big long length of chain there. Yeah. You could attach the other loop of the other chain onto here, the other toggle onto here yeah. and have the two toggles there and you've got a lovely long line necklace. Exactly. exactly. I mean, it's such a, it's a complete no brainer. And you might be thinking to yourself, hang on a minute. This is, you know, at, at 29, there's no way I'm going to be able to afford to do that. Carol. You can wear it in so many different ways. I love, I, I love it this way around as well. That's nice. It's a little lariat, isn't yeah. it? So, so, so pretty. 29.99 is not your deal though. We are going to take this even lower. Now this is a deal of the day, just the other day. And I have to say, uh, we don't have, we don't have hundreds available. So you want to get it, get it now. Can I just say to you, um, please do order. For me, I I'd be ordering at least three. I'd be getting two to wear as necklaces, kind of one long line necklace. That's going to look so designer. And then the other one I'd probably wear as a little bracelet. It's so lovely. If you want to add on birthstones, other pearls, if you want to add on, um, uh, if you want to weave onto it, um, you absolutely can do. That toggle there should never be at the back of the necklace though. Let me tell you, there's very few other places that will offer you toggles like that. I haven't found a single other toggle clasp anywhere um, with, with, with those pearls on the toggle. It's so, it, it's, it's a unique proposition that we're offering you here today. And 29.99 is not your deal. Just look at the quality of those pearls as well. Aren't they gorgeous? Here we go, enjoy. This is crazy, 19.99. Nineteen pounds ninety nine pence is your deal. Maker in Demingshire, why don't you? Jeanette's got two. Beverly's got three. Ruth, Margaret, Margaret, uh, Catherine, Maker, Toyin, Carola, Catherine. Well done. Lots of you there. Lots of people checking out as well. It's so good to see Dorothy and Joanne. Well done to you. Please don't leave this in your basket. This was a deal of the day the other day. It was very very popular indeed. I don't have hundreds available. And if and and, and if everybody is going to be multi buying. Oh, someone else has multi got Toyin's got three now. Well done to you, Jennifer. Well done to you, Margaret and Catherine. Well done. It's, it's that, it's that, it's that, you know, you, you can have pieces on your stand which are very niche or very you or for somebody in particular. Yeah. But you also need these kind of pieces, absolutely. which is for, which is going to appeal to absolutely everyone, don't you, absolutely. Monica? Absolutely. And fifty centimeters is quite long, so if you if you are yeah. selling or giving it as a gift, you can always shorten it if somebody wants it shorter. Of course. Or if if as you were saying, if you want to wear one as a bracelet, uh, yeah. fifty centimeters is long enough to make a two-strand bracelet and to still take a little bit out for a pair of earrings. Or yeah, precisely. Yeah, yeah, that's a good that's a good point actually. If you do want to take any of that chain out, you absolutely can do. Uh, well done to you. Loads in baskets. Dorothy, if you want to, check out now. We haven't got loads of these um, uh, left. Well done. A gorgeous, gorgeous opportunity for you today. Well done. Check out as soon as you can. Love it. Absolutely love it. Well done. Gorgeous. Okay. Now, we have got... An amazing early bird here. I honestly don't know how we've managed to secure this. This is one of the largest pearls, I think, the largest freshwater pearls we have ever had on the show. It's half drilled and we're bringing it to you today, not in a kit, not even as a deal of the day, but as the early bird. It's available until 9am and then it's going to disappear. So this is your only chance to get it.
just looking at that pearl. That really does. That really does strike home, doesn't it? The uh, quality you are getting here. My gosh. That quality. The size. The shape. The nacre. We were talking about pearls yesterday, weren't we? We were talking about the things that give pearl value. And those things are size, anything over seven mil, very rare, over 10 mil, even rarer. Shape, they need to be as close to perfect round as possible, unless they're a Baroque, Biwa or Keshi. <laughs> um, we talk about the Orient, the fact they should look like they're glowing from within. And that's because the outside of the pearl is slightly translucent. Not transparent, but slightly translucent. So little bits of light can permeate into the pearl, uh, in, in, into the pearl slightly, not, not right into the middle. We're talking like the outside kind of layers. The skin on this pearl is pretty much blemish free. You might find the odd anomaly. I'm not being funny, but with a pearl that's 12 and a half to 13 and a half millimeters, you'd be, you'd be going some to get a pearl which had no anomalies whatsoever. It's just incredible. And the color, this is a naturally colored, it says peach. It's, for me, it's more of a, yeah, more of a gold, more of like a buttermilk color. It's got that really beautiful golden color which I attribute, I don't know about you, but I attribute with um, gold South Sea pearls. It's that, it's that kind of color. It's not, it's not orange enough to be peach. It's not pinky enough to be kind of peachy pink. It, for me, it's more of a goldy color. Now this is half drilled. Why is it half drilled? So it's half drilled so you can do things like this. So this isn't specifically made for this pearl, but it's half drilled. So you can basically get a little peg setting I wouldn't use this peg setting. For me, I'd want something a little bit more ornate, I think. But you could if you wanted to. We've got a peg setting in, in a jade thing um, over here. You literally just pop a little bit of glue. Your hypo cement, would you use? Um, I would use a hypo cement, yes, yeah. because it's got a really fine nozzle as well. By the way, we've got an amazing deal on hypo cement coming up over our birthday event. I know I shouldn't be telling you really what's coming up, but, 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 uh, we bought the hypo cement uh, a couple of months ago, I think it was. And I think 500 sold in about three minutes. Absolutely. We've got we've got another kind of five, 600 available yeah, no, to sell. Yeah, my favourite glue to use, yeah. It's, because it's got a bit of flexibility, which I know sounds like a weird thing to say, but it doesn't yeah. dry like super glue, which is brittle when it dries. Exactly, exactly. So it's wonderful to use with organic things like your pearls. Absolutely. That, with a little, with a little peg in the top, as a pendant, let's take that out, because otherwise we're all going to get a bit confused. But that pearl on its own there, as a pendant, that's 150 pounds worth. I mean, already you're getting it 100 pounds lower than than where I would than where I would expect to see this on the high street. Now, the most wonderful thing about making jewellery with this is if you do decide to make a make use of a lovely pin setting, a peg setting, and, and and to glue it into the top of the half drilled pearl, it's going to take you about five minutes to do that. The only bit of waiting is leaving the the glue to cure for 24 hours. Don't touch it, don't move it, don't wiggle it, don't test it. Leave it. Leave it for 24 hours. And then just and then just and then go back to it. If you can, um, I've I've done it before where I've glued something at work and, and then I can't touch it for 24 hours at least, and then I come back to work and then it's fine. Of course it's fixed. And it'll fit like concrete, it's wonderful. You're making something of real inherent quality, estate jewellery, an instant heirloom, and it's cost you twenty nine ninety nine. Wow. By the way, can't believe I'm saying this. We are nowhere near your price. Now, wow. we love pearls here on Jewelry Maker, and I know that we, you know, we, you, you know, we do bring you half drilled pearls every so often. Not very often that we get to bring you. These kind of sizes, these, this magnitude of size, pretty much a perfect round, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. It's beautiful. I want to see you there now. I want to see you there right now. 
get involved. Just put it in your baskets. You don't have to check out till you're happy with the price point. I am pretty, I'm pretty certain you could not even make this into anything, but you could just sell this pearl on yeah. for a hundred pounds more than where we are now. And that would still be a great deal. And there'd still be room for the next person to make something with it and make a bit of a profit. Just amazing, isn't it? We're at 29 99. There's a load of people coming through. There's a load of you waiting. There's a load of people saying yes. I'm so excited. Well done. But please, please, please just trust us. We are going to be taking this low, low, low. I've got a load of people. Just look. It's a perfect pearl you're getting there. The quality is absolutely perfect. The shape, the orient, the nacre, everything about it. It is all perfect. There's loads of you there. Lots of people joining us. And the price point is going to be going down in eight seconds. Oh my gosh, look at everyone with this in baskets. How low would you like to see this go today? It comes to you in a beautiful little presentation box as well. Uh, whether or not you choose to keep it in there is entirely up to you. 19.99. 99 pounds for something of this size. This is not a tiny little, a tiny little um, uh, seed pearl. This is a big 12 and a half to 13 and a half pendant uh, uh, pearl. It's absolutely gorgeous. Wake up to jewellery maker, early bird special, close out deal. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 19 I, mean, I think this is definitely one of those that you just need to get home to see it in person to appreciate the size of it and the, and the quality of it. I think you're right, Monica. And I think you get that home, you put that in your hand and you think to yourself, how on earth did I manage to get a pearl of this magnitude for 19.99? But today, and in 30 seconds, we are taking the price even lower. I know this is crazy. I know this seems too low. Please, please, please don't think this is the price point this should be selling it, it, it should be sold on for. This is nothing to do with the value of what you're getting. This is everything to do with our ability to buy very, very, very well here on Gemporia, on Jewelry Maker. This is your deal. $14.99 for a 12 and a half to 13 and a half genuine freshwater culture pearl. Wow. This is a natural color. It has not been dyed. It has not been bleached. Get your authenticity certificate for an extra 25p and it will say on it, pearl, not enhanced, naturally colored, naturally colored pearl. You've literally got a, just a few more minutes and then this is going to be taken away. Get it? Go, 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 go. Kent's got three. SJ's got two. Well done to you. Linda's got two. Kate's got two. Maker's got two. Richard in Nottingham. Do you know, I got my mum a gorgeous pearl for Christmas a few years ago. It must be two, 2018, 2018, 2019. And I, and I, and I, and I um, spent a bit of money on the clasp. It, sorry, on the uh, bale. It was a, it was a nine carat yellow gold bale. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And I bought this through jewel, and I bought the pearl through Jewelry Maker as an employee here. You know, we get a bit of a discount, which is great. I paid more than this for the pearl that I bought for my mum. I pay, and, and it was smaller, smaller than this, smaller than this. What you are getting today is a genuine closeout deal, is a genuine, unrepeatable deal. It is irreplaceable at $14.99. Well done. Kent's got four. Well done to you. I've got so many in basket. How many do we have in baskets, Neary? Okay, we've got over 20 in baskets. Check out as soon as you can. So Jacqueline, Maker in Worcestershire, Tracy in Lancashire, Maker in Cambridgeshire, Elizabeth's got two in her basket, Maeve, wow. Isabel, Jackie, Helen, Catherine, Hazel, Maker, Maker in Worcestershire, Maker in Cambridgeshire. Loads in baskets. You've literally got 20 odd seconds and then we're going to be taking those details away. These are everyone who's got this in baskets. This is absolutely crazy. Please, please, please check out as soon as you can. Well done, everybody. 0800 644 655. Go, 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 go. What a treat. Jacqueline's just taken two. London's got three. Kent's got four. Leicestershire's got two. Surrey's got two. Channel Islands, two. Dorset, two. Well done. Amazing. Essex, two. Well done. Gorgeous. That's amazing. Well done. 
Okay. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Right. Really? What this? I have got a beautiful thing coming up next. This is gorgeous. We're going to do it as a star buy. Honestly, this is antiques roadshow level carving. This is utterly brilliant star buy. So we've got the most insane carving now. Um, I don't even, I'm not even sure how to describe this. The, one of the only, um, the only way I can think of, I mean, there's a couple of things which come to mind. Firstly, the beautiful Liberty William Morris prints, which are, so detailed they're so intricate there's tendrils ooh, there's tendrils there's flowers there's all sorts kind of weaving in and out of each other that that this reminds me of that but also I don't know whether you've ever seen a really intricate um if you've ever seen the workings of a really intricate lock on a door or on a box <coughs> and you open it and everything goes, tick, 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 tick. do you know what I mean? That kind of intricacy. Because the intricacy you are getting with this carving is literally, it is beyond belief. My gosh. Now, when we first bought the Soriel, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to show the translucency of this material because it is off the scale. Wow. So I'm going to show you this side. And then I'm going to show you that side. I don't even know how to describe this. It's like, it's double-sided carving. It's like lace. If you've ever used the little, um, when you go to a, um, some kind of uh, Chinese restaurants and you get the beautiful little cups that you drink of out, um, at, at the end of the meal and you have lovely Chinese tea. And if you hold those cups up to the light, quite often they've got rice embedded into the pottery, which you can see through. Do you know what I mean? No, maybe not. Anyway, and they're absolutely beautiful. This is what this reminds me of. That translucency is just, it's, it's like paper. It's like, um, I, I, it's just, it's so beautiful. So beautiful. If you've ever seen um, uh, puppet theatre, uh, puppetry theatre is really popular over in the Far East, um, where you get, um, where you, and there are festivals in Thailand uh, where you have uh, puppetry and they, and they tell old, old tales of unrequented love or whatever it might be. It's like the reverse of that. It's like paper, paper thin. It's and the, the most impressive thing about this is it's not paper, it's not icing, it's not bone it, or ivory, it's not pottery, it's not wood. It's a material that's harder than steel. I mean, just as a forget about the carving, forget about what it is. Just from a how on earth did they do this point of view? Yes, it is absolutely. so impressive, isn't it, Monica? Absolutely, yes. And do you know what I like about this piece as Go well? Go on. Obviously, um, jade has got a lot of symbolism, and, and especially in the Chinese culture, and we often have a lot of pieces with dragons on and, yeah. and that sort of symbolism. But if you're not a fan, because let's say some people are not. Absolutely. Um, if you just want a piece that is just beautiful in its own right, yes. I mean... This is it, I would say. You're absolutely right. I mean, it does have the symbology there. You've got the lotus flower. You've got the lucky coins. You can choose to ignore all absolutely. of that. Exactly. It's because it yeah. is, as Monica quite rightly says, it is beautiful in its own right. I wonder how easy it would be to take an impression from this using silicone compounds. Oh. Pressing it, 
into this and then maybe using maybe using it oh, to create oh your own mold i don't i don't know it might work it might it might look terrible i've got no idea but have a go or push your um you know uh, put some kind of vaseline some kind of um lubricant on there and then push your um uh, polymer clay onto it and create that lovely impression a bit like the um, a bit like the stamps that we used to do do you remember those because it's got that kind of definition to it don't you love the way the light rolls over it I don't care how much this is I really I, I couldn't I couldn't care less I don't care what the price is don't you love the way that the 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 light rolls yes it is like um, a, a brass rubbing, uh, Margot. I don't know if you've ever did brass rubbing as a child, but you literally um, uh, get these brass plates with all sorts of different kind of patterns on. Get a piece of paper and you rub a pastel over the top or charcoal over the top, like a, yeah, um, um, something like that. And, and it just, and it just, it creates that lovely, um, creates that lovely kind of impression on the paper. You're absolutely right. It is like brass rubbing or, or, um, or whatever you described it as, wax rubbing, I think you described it as. It's glass-like. It's like the like Lalique glasswork from Paris. It's it's so beautiful. You could put something in the middle. You could put a crystal or a gemstone in the middle if you wanted to. Use it with um, strands. Use it with faceted jade. I mean, that would be really lovely. Or yeah, just pop it in a box frame. Pop it in a box frame. It's so lovely. It's so, so, so lovely. And I think the light rolls over it because it's, it's not flat. It's not carved into a flat piece. Mm. It's, still, it's still domed around the edges. It's, oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. That's a good point, actually, Ollie. Ollie's Olli, saying the nice thing is there's no straight lines with this, and yeah. he's absolutely right. But you're right, Monica. It's got that lovely little dome and then it, that divot in the middle. That, that kind of, that is such a difficult thing to achieve. And it's, is it carved on both sides? But wow. Both sides. Oh, wow. Carved on both sides. £99. What is going on? Individual split payments of £24.99. Oh, my gosh. Has anyone got a pencil? I don't know. Has anyone got a pencil? I don't know. I, this is just gorgeous. Hmm. It needs to be a pencil rather than a pen. Is that a pencil? I don't, this might not work. I mean, if it doesn't, please don't get cross with me. It, it probably won't because I've got the paper's going to be a bit thick. Uh, yeah, here we go. This is this is so cool. I'm just going to do like a little portion of it. Here we go. Look at that. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that gorgeous? I mean, I'd be doing that with tracing paper or something, or, or, or you know, something like that. I'm, I'm really proud of that. I think that's going to look like that. But isn't that lovely? But it's just got something. It's just got something so decadent about it. Carola, Mary, well done to you. This is this is this is such. This is more than a carving. This is a. This is a piece. This is a piece of art. This is a piece of engineering. I don't like using that word around this because it's so it's so arty. But it is a piece of engineering. Hazel, well done to you as well. We're at ninety nine ninety nine. I think that's absolutely gorgeous. Well done, Hazel. Uh, well done to you, Devon, Oxfordshire, Sheffield. Well done to you as well. Isn't that just gorgeous? I just love that. Look at that. L that lovely impression you get from there. Just gorgeous, isn't it? Well done, everybody. <laughs> Sorry, M Michael making him show that, show it. Um, but it's, it's so beautiful. Well done to Valerie in Somerset as well. But I think it just highlights just how, how gorgeous these carvings are. How That's all done by hand and it's harder than steel. I mean, it's just, it, it, it's absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Well done everyone, just gorgeous. 99, 99 and your split payments are under 25 quid. That's just brilliant, well done. Gorgeous, 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 absolutely beautiful, well done. Right, we've got another star bite. Now we didn't get the chance to play this <laughs> we didn't get a chance to play this yesterday. Um, it is one of my all-time favourite gems. It's the rarest variety of sapphire. It's a strand of genuine Paparadasha sapphire. Let's go. You have got here... The most ridiculous variety of 
sapphire. It is the rarest variety of sapphire in the world. Paparasha sapphire. This is utterly phenomenal. The name Paparasha is said to be inspired by the Hindu word for lotus. And it's meant to be similar to the colours of the lotus flower with the oranges with the flashes of pink and the pinks with the flashes of orange. Um, this is pretty much the finest strand of Paparasha sapphire we have ever had on Jewelry Maker. We are so fortunate to have this. Yesterday I was talking about Zavarite Garnet and I was talking about this particular area of Africa where you've got Kenya, you've got Tanzania and this area of land, the gemstones are older than the hills, they're older than Mount Kilimanjaro, they're older than, you know, they were in the ground before the dinosaurs walked across planet Earth. And this incredible gemstone right here is one of those gems from that same location that we bought you the Zavarite garnet from, from that same location that Tanzanite comes from, from that same location that some of the rarest spinel, zircon, comes from. No trickery there. That is the colour of the strand. My gosh. 10 carats of Paparasha Sapphire. Orange, pinks, reds, you're getting the lot here. And I have bought you Sri Lankan Paparasha before. It is beautiful. It's gorgeous. This is all the way from Tanzania. Now there are <coughs> certain treatments which you can get for your Paparasha Sapphire, which will uh, do a, a, a number of different things. The first one is heating. This has been heated. And it's really important that I disclose that because it's important that I can justify the price that we're going to. Basically, the rule of thumb is, if your Paparasha Sapphire looks like this and it's not heated and it's got no treatment, no heat, it's going to be worth thousands of pounds, probably maybe even high, high thousands, hundreds of thousands of pounds. Yeah. There is another form of treatment which we would not touch with a barge pole and it's called beryllium treating. I've got a slide just explaining it very, very briefly. We don't beryllium treat any of our sapphire. Um, there are other gemstones which will be beryllium treated. We, we don't uh, treat, uh, we don't use beryllium treatment unless we absolutely have to. Beryllium treatment is what uh, needed to be avoided. Most resellers have no idea what it is and the market is flooded with these stones. Beryllium alters the colour and is used to make the paparasha colour. So basically you get a sapphire which is, I don't know, green, you beryllium treat it and it comes out this colour. Basically it's fake. What you've got here is heat only. And I do have to disclose that it is heated. Princess Eugenie, she, um, she, got, she, she got engaged a few years ago. They, um, they look very happy in this photo, very shiny, <laughs> very shiny, very happy. And she's got um, a gemstone of royalty, basically. What most of the British royal family and royals around the world will go for rather than diamonds is sapphire. Um, uh, normally kind of a blue sapphire, a salon sapphire. She went for a uh, Paparasha sapphire. That is a natural sapphire. And that will be worth millions. That will be worth millions of pounds. That's gorgeous. The only thing that you can really compare it to, and because there is such a leap in price, if you've got natural Paparasha sapphire, no heat, it's going to be millions. It's going to be high thousands expect, expect to get, expect to get Paparasha, which is heated from Jewelry Maker. The prices, this is not, it, it's basically heat treated just for clarity, not for colour, doesn't alter the colour at all. This is the colour it came out of the ground. We're at 199. The ultimate, the ultimate sapphire. The 
rarest sapphire on planet Earth. Whether it's heated or whether it's natural, it is the rarest sapphire on planet Earth. That's it. Nothing rarer. This is rarer than your salon. This is rarer even, arguably, than your cashmere. This is the rarest variety of sapphire the world bestows. One, nine, nine on individual split payments of £99.50 and it's not your deal today. All the way down, enjoy. This is your opportunity today. The most incredible quality, the most incredible rarity, insurpassable rarity. It's £99 and 99 pence and your split payments are under £50 today. Absolutely ridiculous, I know. Maker in Hertfordshire, we've got you there. Well done to you. Check out as soon as you can. Oh gosh, loads of you coming through, well done. 0800 644 655 9999 is brilliant and it's not your price today. Oh my gosh. This is not only one of the most popular strands of Papadasha Sapphire we've ever had, but it is also um, one of the best and I have to say one of the most affordable as well. It is absolutely incredible. Have a look at it with the incredible uh, faceted jade that I've got here. Isn't that just gorgeous? Oh, that's Isn't that just beautiful? Isn't that gorgeous? We've also got this incredible strand of pearls coming up today. Look at it with those bad boys. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Trudy, well done to you. Antoinette in Belfast, well done to you as well. Oh my gosh. I want to show you this as well with the gorgeous Paparazzi, uh, I beg your pardon, with the Pareva Quartz as well. It's going to go really, really nicely together. Woo! Gorgeous, absolutely beautiful, well done. Hartford is through, well done to you, lovely maker, well done to you. We're not done, we're taking the price point down even lower. This is your opportunity, go, 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 here we go. 49.99, what a whopping great big saving you are making there. That is absolutely your deal today, unbelievable. For genuine Paparasha Sapphire, it's unbelievable. George in South Yorkshire, well done to you. I know this is heated, if this was natural, you can move that decimal point two places easily, easily. I mean, this is a five grand strand, if not even more, you know, edging towards those kind of eight to 10,000 pound strands. It's amazing, isn't it? Well done, Yorkshire. We've got 49.99. That is absolutely your deal today. Well done. Go, go, go. It is a complete and utter steal of a deal as well. Diana in Lanarkshire, well done to you as well. More bidders coming through. This is a chance to own something which is so rare, almost unsurpassable rarity, the rarest variety of sapphire. That colour shifts as well, doesn't it, from orange to pink? It does. It's, it's, it's pretty amazing, isn't it? It is. And do you know what? I think the orange and pink are such lovely colours together. They really, it's exotic. It's that kind of Bollywood. It's that Indian summer kind of colour. It's, it's, it's warm. It's beautiful. It's bright. It's vibrant. And it's exactly what you're going to be getting today for $49.99. Darren, Eileen, well done to you. Diana in Lanarkshire as well. Well done to you. Go, 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 go at $49.99. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. Check your baskets out as soon as you can. That's gorgeous. Well done. Let's do <coughs> another star buy. Let's do another star buy. Let's do your purple metallic pearls. These are going to go nuts. It's a star buy. This is absolutely, I mean, this is, talk about rarity of colour with pearls. Um, the rarest colours that you can get in pearls are blue. We've got those coming. And uh, your purples. Do I even need to ask you, Monica, whether you like this strand? Well, I think you probably know what I'm going to say. <laughs> this is literally Monica in a strand. <laughs> Uh, that, that purple colour is just so, it's so um, present. Wow. Um, there's no other kind of secondary notes in there. I'm not saying, oh, it's got a hint of, a hint of lilac, a hint of purple. It is purple. The size of some of these pearls are monumental. Yes. 
They really are, aren't they? They are. I mean, just going back to the colour for a second, looking at it from here, from across the studio, just looking at the colour, it almost looks like shell pearl because they're all that purple. Totally. Yes, absolutely. And I think it's because it doesn't have that secondary note going through it. Um, so the metallic pearls we bought you yesterday, they were beautiful. We were pointing out the greens, the blues, the bronzes, the pinks, the purples, all of those different colours. I'm not saying that this has only got one colour because it's obviously got different colours there, a veil of different colours. But I wouldn't say it's like that metallic colour that you get where it's like oil on water. You've just got other colours which are just part of the nacre. This, as Monica quite rightly says, is most definitely just purple. So much so it does look like shell pearl. They are so big. These pearls, would you believe it, are 10 and a half to 13 mil. That, wow. that's a decent sized grape. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it really is, isn't it? That's huge. It's absolutely gigantic. These, look at this one here, it's so adorable. Oh, what an adorable earring. little pearl. I'm loving that shape. Yeah, I know. It's not, it's not little, is it? Compared to the other one, it's little. It's still going to be ten and a half mil. I know, it's huge, isn't it? But this one here, if you wanted to make earrings, you know, that one kind of kind of, kind of of matches. You've got the two good, lovely drop shapes there. How oh. lovely would that be? Look at the size of that. That's like an onion. They're huge pieces. On the strand, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, four, fourteen, sixteen. Was I counting then? I was, wasn't I? Yeah. I, I? Sorry, I totally lost where I was then. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32. Wow. That was slightly worrying, wasn't it? Was I counting then? 32. We've got six opportunities available. I honestly think this price here... Look at this, 999. I can imagine that every day with a clasp on, maybe with a couple of spacers. Really lovely clasp. We've got some beautiful clasps coming up over birthday, by the way. 32. 32 feature pendants. Yeah? You could use 30 for a necklace and two and a pair of earrings. Yep. But also I would take off that really big one and put it as a pendant on a, on a, a strand of smaller white pearls. Now, we are going to be dropping the price point. But as it stands at the minute, they're about £31 each. Not being funny, how much would you, how much would you charge for one of these in a pendant? Minimum price, £100, £129, yeah? Yeah. So already you're making, I mean, we are taking the price significantly lower than where we are now. These are already starting to go, just so you're aware. Five left. Yeah, there's one there. It's just uh, this, uh, probably Yoko pearls, I think. This looks like it might be a Yoko design. Beautiful. £2,300. Uh, white gold, yeah, and the freshwater pearl. That's been photoshopped to death, hasn't it? Gee whiz. <laughs> Filter. Um, anyway. <coughs> Have a look at this. Two... Nine, nine, five available. We're not done. That already takes it down to under 10 pounds a pearl. Under 10 pounds. See, Monica's good at maths. She's, <laughs> she's I'm so glad when we have Monica on the show. She's really good at maths. Um, under 10 pounds a pearl. That is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Now, Neri, let's see those names. We've got a number of these sitting in baskets at the minute. We've got a number of these uh, which, you know, I've got vested interest there. London, Oxfordshire, Cheshire. I mean, we've got people who've already got two bidders in London who've already checked out. That's great to see. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Look at that. With my very busy top. It, 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 you, you can still see those colours, can't you? That's beautiful. Mrs. Wenda, Vanessa, well done to you, my lovelies. Check out. They do look antique, don't they? Yeah. It's, it's estate jewellery. Rita. Is it, are you going to make it three bidders in London who come through to get this? I don't know, darling. Price point going down. Not by £10 or by even £20 or £30. We're just going to do this. Here we go. Take the four. Take them. Go, go, go. Ready? Steady. 249. £249 individual split payments of 62.25. That is absolutely obscene. Maker in the West Midlands, you could take it down to the last three. Oh, you have. Well done. Loads of people there. 
That's great to see. Well done. More in baskets than we've got strands available. That is utterly, utterly brilliant. What a deal. Enjoy. Three chances left. You're loving it. Aren't they just gorgeous? Aren't they beautiful? Moy in Essex, well done to you. Morning, all at Joe. I'm looking forward to treating myself today as it's my birthday. What a fab show lineup. Oh, Amanda, happy birthday, darling. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. What's she going to get? Highlight Opal, which we're finally launching. Two chances left. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six in baskets for the last two. Oh my gosh, go, 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 go. Well done, check out. What a show lineup. I know, it's great, isn't it? We've got loads of Vanessa. Check out, my love. Well done. Well done, everyone. It's a go, go, go. Two opportunities remaining for the absolute. And this isn't kind of a strand of pearls that we get. Oh, look, and there's some purple there as well. Look, there's one purple <laughs> one, or there's a flash of purple. This is purple. It's proper purple, isn't it? Oh. Literally one of the rarest colours of pearls in the world. Seven pounds what a pearl? Seven seventy a pearl. <laughs> oh, Monica. What, 15 pounds for a pair of earrings? 15 <laughs> pounds size. for a pair of earrings. That makes me feel really. Goodness yeah, that's a 200 pound pair of earrings. Let's face it. Well done, everyone. Two, four, nine for the lot. Absolutely gorgeous. You've only got to make, you've only got to make, you know, a pair of earrings and a pendant. You've made, literally made your money back. Oh, yeah. Gorgeous. Well done, everyone. So happy for you all getting that. Well done. Still got two left. Right. Please don't go anywhere. Gorgeous kits. Very affordable. Loads of colour. Loads you can do with them. Monica broke the rules. <laughs> They're coming up next. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. I would love uh, for each of you to be able to join me this weekend for an unprecedented collection. And I don't just mean unprecedented here at Jewelry Maker. Um, after speaking with many of uh, fellow collectors and people who are interested in Jadeite in the Far East, we genuinely believe this might be the first time ever a gallery exhibition like this has ever been offered firsthand in the Western world. Pieces like this do occasionally make their way into the hands of Western collectors, but it will come from possibly an auction house in Hong Kong. To have the access to a master's studio, to be able to offer his unique artworks to our collectors, that each one has possibly been worked on for six months or longer, is a real privilege for me. And for those of you that are gonna be joining in, I've got some very special news to share with you. I want everyone to have the chance to be able to own something, something like this. I think it's very important and I'd love for you to come and view these incredible pieces of art with me. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. 
And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. these kits are gorgeous they're full of color full of kind of lots of interesting things aren't they Absolutely. very very exciting i'm really excited about these good 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 we've got four kits um they all come with sliding class bracelets the sliding class bracelets have all got gemstones in and i have to say they are gorgeous so we've got a topaz one we've got a turquoise one a garnet one and we've got a gorgeous tanzanite one as well they are all so cute and these are more than just your ordinary slider class bracelets why I, I will explain more later in my demo oh i see <laughs> monica's using them not as bracelets i see i see i see which kit are we going to start with the turquoise one this one's going to go nuts i think so this yeah. one is going to go absolutely bonkers um all of these kits come with crystals in some way, shape or form. So with this particular kit, you get these uh, crystals here, which is like this lovely salon royal blue almost. I love that isn't colour. It? It's a beautiful colour. It's a nice colour, isn't it? Um, giving you that lovely kind of look of Swarovski, but without the price point attached to it. And unbelievable size as well. These bicones are great. Love them, love them, love them. Love what you've done with them actually in the kit um, and use them alongside the turquoise because they've got this um, the turquoise is just the right shape, isn't it, to just nestle around yeah, that's what I thought. those bicones. It kind of fits around it really nicely, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? Let's talk about this turquoise because I have to say, I think this is one of the nicest strands we've ever done. It is, it's beautiful. It's, it, and the shape as well. I don't think I've ever seen turquoise in that shape. I, I don't think I've seen any of the gemstones in this shape before. It's, it's a really, I mean, rice beads, <coughs> excuse me, rice beads, yes. But this particular size of rice bead is very, very unusual. Totally unisex. Yeah. It looks ancient, doesn't it? It looks like a, an old, an old style cut. It does very um, Egyptian, doesn't it? Yeah, and the and the range of colour is really impressive, isn't it? It is, and, and the patterns in there. I love turquoise when it has patterns, and I, I much prefer that than the, than the uh, turquoise without the matrix, which Me is a too. bit controversial. But yeah, no, no, I don't think it's controversial at all. I love the <laughs> matrix as well. I think the matrix running through it is gorgeous. Um, you also get this bracelet now. Yes, it's sterling silver. It's a sterling silver sliding class bracelet with a turquoise heart in the middle. Oh. It moves up and down like this, so you can literally, it's just, it's just gorgeous. It's so pretty. This kit is already flying out the door at $49.99. Now, here's the thing. I genuinely have no idea how we can do the price point that we're doing on these kits today, because knowing that that's sterling silver, Knowing that that's gemstone, knowing you're getting another strand of, sorry, you're going to be getting that amazing strand of turquoise with it as well. It's just one of the most beautiful strands we've ever done, I think. I can't believe. No. 
Are you serious? This doesn't even cover the cost of the kit. The, the price point we're about to go to does not cover the cost of the kit. It is absolutely ridiculous. It does not cover the cost of the kit. We cannot buy this kit back. We cannot make this kit for this price. Wow. It's 29.99. Oh my gosh. To be honest, I think that would be a good price either for the bracelet on its own, sterling silver with a genuine turquoise, or for the strand on its own as well. So imagine, imagine this, Monica. I got about 50 in baskets straight away. Imagine this is deal of the day. This strand is deal of the day, and we've got a thousand of them. And we start off at 129 pounds, and we work our way down to 29.99. You're gonna sell all thousand, aren't you? You really genuinely are. Yeah. It is such a good deal for the strand alone let alone the sterling silver sliding class bracelet with the, tan yes. with the turquoise in as well. And of course, the incredible, uh, uh, beautiful bright crystals as well. Yes. I think a lot of people as well, Monica, and feel free, to, feel free to do this. Obviously, Monica's been given these kits, so she has to use kind of as much, as much in these kits as possible. But if you want it personally, I would look at this kit and go, right, I'm going to use the turquoises together. I'm going to use the crystals for something else. Yeah. I'm going to use the crystals to make Christmas baubles or I'm going to use the crystals with the loose light flowers we've got coming up I mean, later easily on. Easily, you can look at the crystals as a, as a freebie on the side. Total like, freebie. <laughs> yeah. to total freebie. These sliders are fabulous. Um, so easy to use. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. They're so easy to use. Um, and they are a real best, uh, oh, bestseller. There we go. Yeah, yeah. real bestsellers. It's one size fits all. They're just yeah. gorgeous. They're so, uh, they're so decadent, the fact they've got gemstones in and the fact it's sterling silver. 30 seconds, we're taking the details away. Honestly, that is amazing. I personally would use the turquoises together. I'd use the crystals in something else. Yeah. Um, I'd probably give my uh, kids the crystals to work with or I'd make Christmas decks out of them or I'd use them with the lucite flowers we've oh, got yeah. coming up in the uh, 12 o'clock hour maybe. Yeah. Um, gorgeous. Well done. It's going to sell out. Well done. Gorgeous. Five left and it's about to sell out. Well done. The stupid price, isn't it? Really stupid. Now, we're now going to move on to another kit. Have we peaked, do we think, with the uh, turquoise? Well, the next kit, you, you, you definitely think so. Yeah. Next kit, bright pink crystals. Okay, think of a bright pink stone. This is Again, for the lucite flowers, those would be oh, perfect for the lucite flowers. Which ones? Would you go Ooh, with the kind one. of pink or would you go maybe kind like of opposites? Yellow. Yeah, yellow, maybe orange. Yes. Yeah, so these lucite flowers coming up later on, these are the ones which look great with little fairy lights, little yes. LED fairy lights. <laughs> so cute. I love these. Um, the gem. Tanzanite. The sliding, the sliding class bracelet you're going to be getting here. Sterling silver. What's the gem? Tanzanite. Oh. And I'll tell you what, that is really good Tanzanite. That is not rubbish that is. Tanzanite. That's not like silvery, gravelly. Is it Tanzanite? Is it mud? It, what is it? <laughs> it is definitely <laughs> Tanzanite. Now, I know putting the bright pink crystals with it is a little bit controversial, but I understand the thinking. Because in, Turk in Tanzanite, you do sometimes get flashes of yes, pink and red, don't absolutely, you? absolutely, absolutely. So it totally goes, doesn't it? And it's that lovely pop of colour. I love it. I love these earrings that you've made, Monica. I think well, they're utterly adorable. That's what I thought as well. It's a really nice pop of colour to have those crystals in there. So that's why I've kind of turned it into little flowers. Almost. Yeah, they're so cute. And look, the little tassels on the end of the a bracelet you've made as well. They're so cute, little kind of ends. Yeah. They're, they're just adorable. Graphics alive. This kit's flying as well. Well done to you. Go, 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 go. So a strand of really good tanzanite. A sterling silver sliding class bracelet with a really good tanzanite in. Your bright pink crystals. No one's going to be able to believe this, Neri, are they? Hmm? No one's going to be able to believe the price point we're going to be doing on this kit. Mm -hmm. This is just ridiculous. <laughs> Great code for this, 60, 67. Okay, <laughs> right. <laughs> Don't even know what that means. No idea. Neary just said it. I thought it sounded funny. Okay, here we go. Price points. Neary, come on. Be brave. Be brave. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. How many of this kit do we have? First kit's pretty much sold out, by the way. This kit's about to sell out. Ready, steady, go. 24 dollars 
45 chances, one left of the turquoise kit. It's amazing. Again, does not cover the cost of that. Certainly doesn't cover the cost of that. And I mean, if you think about it, you don't need a lot of uh, gemstones to make one of those bracelets or even the earring. No. So, I mean, I've made the bracelet and the earrings, which would easily be worth the $24.99. And I've still got almost all my crystals left. I've got half a strand of my tanzanite left. Uh, you know, so I can easily make a whole load of other jewellery with what's left after making a whole set there. Precisely. So, you know, it, you, 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 you can be really frugal with the amount of gemstones that you use. It doesn't cover the cost of the strand. It doesn't cover the cost of the uh, bracelet. It's $24.99. Just take it away. Take it. Honestly, it is. these kits are genuinely such good deals. Yes. And this isn't, you know, just a good deal, you know, somebody else. This is jewellery maker. We are known for our low prices. That's why we're still going after 13 years. Because with your support, we are, you know, we are so, com we are beyond competitive. Yeah, that's a really good point, actually, Ollie. A $24.99 is a price point we launched Tanzanite at, and it wasn't a strand that looked like that. It was well, a strand basically of Tanzanite that's chip that's what I was soil, oh my God. basically. There's a clock. <laughs> Ollie, I think it's the wrong colored clock. He's saying no, it's the right colored clock. It's a, it's a, it's a purple clock. <laughs> it's a purple clock and he's not afraid to, he's not afraid to use it. He's gonna go, he's, he's gonna take the price point down. Well done, everybody. Gorgeous. <laughs> £21.99. You can tell we are very close to that, to, to kind of uh, what we can do, because he's literally just wow. shaved another kind of £3 off the price point there. Corolla, Jennifer, Valerie, Hazel, Claire, Maker, Maker, Jill, Anne, oh, Sandra. There's so many people there. This is great to see. I mean, well honestly, done. just for that strand. Yeah. You know? Twenty-one ninety-nine. That's an early bird. It is, yeah. That's an early bird. That's a star buy. It's absolutely brilliant. Well done, Valerie. Well done to you. You've got two. Well done to you, my lovely. Loads. But Jennifer wants three. Maker wants four. Anne wants two. <laughs> wasn't meant to be purchasing anything today. Oops. Thanks, Lucy. Do you know what? And the people always say, "Oh, I wasn't meant to be buying today," but you've tempted me. I, I just couldn't watch. If I wasn't meant to be buying, I just wouldn't watch because. I can resist everything apart from temptation. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> my, my daughter gave me an Easter egg. Well, no, she didn't. She had an Easter egg and she didn't particularly like the flavour. So she said, Mummy, would you like it? I said, for you, I'll do it. <laughs> for you, because I'm such a martyr. I literally ate the whole thing, almost, well, almost the whole thing in a day. I had to throw the rest of it away. Aww. Blue Tiger's Eye. This is such a lovely kit. I love Blue Tiger's oh, Eye. I love, I love Blue Tiger's Eye when you get the blondes coming out yes. as well, don't you? Yes. It's such a cool, cool stone. Um, where's that from? Rogue crystal, it must be from there. there oh, we go. yes. Um, so, blue tiger's eye with a blonde in, blue and blonde. You then get these really awesome crystals here, which uh, I love the way you've used them, Monica. These are like Bristol glass, they're so cool. This is how Monica's, there we go. Look how Monica's used them there. Just a little bralette wrap. Very cool, very, very cool indeed. The light loves those. And then you get a sliding class bracelet. Isn't that lovely? With a beautiful blue topaz in. And that is a lovely, that's like a London blue. It is, yes. That is just, is it, a, is it blue? Or am I just seeing blue? And what color is that? Oh. I'm seeing blue, but I'm also seeing silver. Oh, it's got kind of like a goldy color. Oh, do you know what? I don't know. It is topaz. Oof. It is a topaz that, that you're going to be in there. Lovely blue topaz. That is just gorgeous. 19.99. Oh my gosh, that's absolutely brilliant. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. We've got one final kit to do, and it's the garnet. Now, we've had some brilliant garnet over the last few weeks on Jewelry Maker. This is nice. Gorgeous, um, deep, rich red tiger's eye strand. Gorgeous, bright red. Okay. And then look at this garnet. Oh my gosh, look at that garnet. Oh, Isn't that. that gorgeous? That is so gemmy. Wow. Look at the price. 
15 quid. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Neary, I love that. I love you. Wow. Oh, thank you. I was waiting for that. Gee, that took a while, didn't it? I love you too. Uh, well done. The most amazing garnet. I love, 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 love that. That is absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous quality. Oh my gosh, that's so good. So good. Well done. 14 99 Jennifer Jacks, Mary, Sandra. Well done to you, my lovelies. Loads of you there. Well done. Okay. We've got some... Oh, gosh, we've got these base metal sliders coming up now. Right, these are stupid. Stupid. Right, just come through and get them as quickly as you can. We're going to start off with the green. Now, you don't need me to tell you this. These are not gemstones in here, <laughs> just to let you know. Um, it is a green crystal. They're so cool, aren't they? Love them. Love them. Loving the little um, crystals you get at the bottom of these. Super cool. Love them. There's your little slider. Pulley, pulley, pulley. Pulley, pulley, pulley. Put whatever you like in the middle of Italy. Make a bracelet tea, bracelet tea. Yeah, gorgeous. Fourteen ninety nine. That's great, isn't it? Brilliant. It's not. It's not your deal. Surely we can't be going under a tenner. Nine ninety nine for this one. You ready? It's not your price. No, thirty second clock. Here we go. We're going to do all of these. They are ridiculous. They're stupid. They are. They are stupidly priced. They're gorgeous. Love them. That is a statement. It is. And as I was saying earlier, you get so much in the kits, so that if you if you got one of the kits, then I'd definitely get a few of these to add. Very much so, yeah. So you could, if you wanted to, give yourself a sapphire and ruby look, an emerald look, couldn't oh, you? Yes. You really could. I love that. Give yourself a sapphire, ruby, and emerald look. Oh my gosh, that would look amazing. Go, 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 go. Well done. Ready? Here we go. Bracelet. Oh. <laughs> 4.99. Woo, baby! Four pounds and 99 pence. Well done. Absolutely incredible. Well done. I love the height of these. I love the, um, the stature of these. I love the quality. 4.99. Pat, Maker, Nicola, Emma. Well done to Mary as well. Here's your little stoppers on the bottom as well with the crystal as well, which is just gorgeous. Well done. Oh my gosh, she's going even lower. What are you doing there? That was meant to be your lowest price. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh. 3 99 Oh, gosh, wow. Neary. That's, that's low enough. Tina, make a pert. Well done to you, my lovely. Loads of you coming through. Absolutely brilliant. Shirley, well done to you, Helen. Don't just buy one. Get more than one. Come on. Yeah, that price there. Take them apart. Take them apart. Use them for whatever you like. Yeah, two earring chains. Oh, they make lovely earrings. You could take the, you could take the crystals off the end and put something else on the end as well. You could. Absolutely. Why not? Nothing to stop you do that, doing that at all. Well done. That's just stupidly, stupidly priced. Okay, demo coming up. And we will bring the rest of the sliders on. Just, I, I will show you the rest very quickly. We've got red. Oh, right on the end, sorry. Red, <laughs> yellow. Gosh, that's gorgeous, that one. Blue, white. And you get this gorgeous kind of orangey color as well, which is different to the other red. You see how that's different? See, it's more orangey. Yeah, perfect. So we'll bring those to air as we go through the demo, just to let you know, okay? Brilliant. Right, Monica, here we go. Okay, I'm just gonna borrow one of these to talk about it. I'll give it back to you in a second. So what I want to explain is why I said earlier that these are extra special, um, oh, yes. extra special slider bracelets. Now, um, so what's special about these? First of all, is that they don't have a stopper bead on the end over there, okay? Which straight away, it gives you opportunity to personalize them because you can put whatever you like on the ends of them. But also, um, if you, well, if you want to look back, uh, Mark had these bracelets on the 26th of March on his mm. show. And he showed a very clever way where you can actually, I'm not going to do it now because um, I'm not gonna show anything with that, but you can pull the chain right out of your, of your slider bracelet and then you can actually thread your bees directly onto the chain. Oh. Because the chain is fine enough to go right through a bead. Nice one. Okay, so that's why these are different to your normal slider bracelets. So you don't even have to cut it at the top, at the top there. You can just slide it out, thread your bees directly onto the chain, and then thread. Um, that's again, Mark showed how you can thread the chain right back into your into your slide. Oh, I love it. So I don't want to repeat what he did. So I just I just mentioned that. 
So, but then there are other ways that you can, you can use it as well. So, for example, I've taken one. I can give you this one back now. So I've taken this one because they're really pretty with the, with the gemstone uh, in the slider as well. So I like to use these as, as part of a necklace. So I've taken this one and I've turned it into a necklace. So in this case, I did cut the chain in the middle. I didn't pull it out of my, um, out of my, stop, uh, out of my slider clasp. Um, I just cut it in the middle and then I've attached the whole strand of the tiger's eye with some of the crystals in between and uh -huh. the two space beads. And it's long enough to go over your head uh, without having to put a cl another clasp on oh, the back. Oh, fantastic. So that works out really well. And then what I do want to show you is the different ways that you can attach things to the chain because obviously it's quite a fine chain. Um, so you haven't got a big, a big loop on it like mm. you would uh, in some of, on some of your chains. Um, so there are different ways you can do that. So one of them, which I thought was really clever, what Mark showed as well um, on his show, is if you thread on your beads, like I've done here, okay, then you can finish the end in two different ways. Oh, let me move it over a bit. You can finish the end in two different ways. One of them is you can just take your pliers and squish the last link of the chain, mm. okay, which is going to flatten the chain and that's going to stop your chain from coming out of your Brilliant, beads. yeah. Okay, so that's also really clever. And you would do the same uh, if you just threaded your beads onto the chain. Just um, squish the ends where you want the, the beads to stay in the middle. And even though you, you haven't cut it and extended it, it's still long enough, plenty long enough to go over your wrist um, as it is. Okay, the other way, the way I've done it here, which I'll quickly show you, is basically you use it as if you were crimping your beading, um, your beading wire. So I've just threaded on my bead just like that, okay? And then I've taken a crimp bead. So I've got gold crimps here, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to put a crimp cover on the top so you won't see it anyway. And just put the crimp onto the end of your end of your chain. Of course, I would do this normally closer to my face, but pull it, pull it right down at the end. Squish it on there. If you've got mm -hmm. crimping plies, you can crimp them a little bit to make them, the crimp a little bit smaller just like that, okay? So you can crimp them. So you can use that in the middle of your bracelet as well, the crimping, uh, or you can just use it on the end like that to stop your, um, your beads from falling off. And then you just crimp it on the end like you would if you were using your beading wire. Okay? Nice. So take your time with the crimp cover. I'm just gonna do it quickly here, so it may not be perfect. Oh, it's actually good enough. <laughs> well done, Monica. There you go. Right, so then you've got your two end, end beads on there. So that's nice if you want to have a little silver accent on the end, then you can use your crimp covers for that. Then, of course, um, on one of the, if you could pass me the flowers with the Tanzanite earrings, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, I haven't got the chain in the earrings, but it's the same sort of principle anyway. Mm -hmm. Sorry, the bracelet would be better, yeah. There you are, Lavey. So all I did in the bracelet, or in this bracelet here, on the end is I've made the flowers using 0.25 millimeter wire. So your 0.25 millimeter wire will go through the links in the chain as well. Uh, and I've done the same with the briolette wraps as well. So that your 0.25 millimeter wire can go through so you can attach things to it using uh, that wire as well. And then the other way you can attach things, which is what I've done on the necklace, is to get your beading wire through it because your beading wire will go through. I've already threaded it through here because you do need to get it really close to your face to do that. So I've pre-done it. <laughs> so all you would do then is you thread on your beads to make your necklace. Then you thread on your crimp. Okay, so there's my crimp. And then you would put your beading wire through the last link of your chain, like that. Bring it close, go back through your crimp, just as if you were adding on any other chain, really. Go back through your crimp, and I like to go through at least one of my larger beads, maybe even two. Pull it close. Okay, and then just use your pliers to pull it as tight as you want. You want to, if you're going to put a crimp cover on, you want to leave a little bit of space. So just grab your wire and pull it in quite close. You don't want it to be Tight, tight. Whenever you're doing, uh, whenever you're using beading wire, make sure that your necklace or your bracelet is bent. Don't have it straight on the table because when you're wearing it, it's going to bend. And if you crimp it too tight when it's straight, when it bends, it's going to it's going to need more of the wire. So it's going to put a strain on your 
on your uh, ending and it might break. So you want to have your jewelry um, sort of not straight on the table when, you, when you're crimping it. Yeah, good call. And then also you want to leave a little bit of space for your crimp cover. It's a nice neat finish though, isn't it? It is, yes. Lovely. And then you just crimp. Closure. As before. And then put your crimp cover on there. Um, which is the same as I did on the end. So I'm not going to bore you with that again. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. I think that's a lovely way to finish off that chain. Yes, I've got that's it. going to be the first question that we get asked about, isn't I've it? I've got it all tangled up now. Give oh, me a second. Monica. Oh, maybe if I just look. Let me just cut off the um, the excess here uh, first. Uh, and then... Cut it away. It, it will untangle. You just need to hang it up, basically. But then that makes a really nice necklace. There we go. If I, if you, if I quickly put it on the bust, you can see it's going to look really really pretty as a necklace. It basically turns your, your bracelet into a pendant because I think they're so pretty with that um, slider clasp. Oh, that's so nice, Mike, oh, around the that. front. Oh, that's beautiful. I like that. And I've purposely made it different lengths, the chain, yeah. so that it, it doesn't hang. Um, and then, as I say, you don't need another clasp and you can change the, you can pull it right up if you want to, like that. Or if you pull it lower, then it's long enough to go over your head. So you can change how you wear it as well. So. I think that's a really nice way to use these as well. It is. I think make the most of it because it's got such a lovely, it's such a lovely feature with the gemstone in there it as well. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, gorgeous. Yeah. Well done. Thank you so much, Monica. <laughs> Beautiful. Well done. Right. Okay. Um, so these uh, plated base metal bracelets are absolutely flying with the crystals in, which is absolutely brill. Um, phenomenal. What are we doing now, lovely? Is it red or orange? Let's have a look. Oh, it is the red. It is the red, red. Red, red. Oh. Red, red. That red is the most difficult colour to achieve in anything, pretty much. Yes. In seed beads, in polymer clay, it, it's just, that is really, really lovely. I was thinking as well with these, um, because they're so inexpensive, just using all of these, um, you know, kind of sacrificing the end kind of little tags here. I'm just feeding a load of them on there. That make a lovely bracelet or a lovely kind of pendant. Oh yes. Just adding a really nice feature to your jewelry. So, you know, costume jewelry does have its place in jewelry making. It absolutely does. Monica's obviously shown us, you know, precious metal with gemstones. But you know, if you want to make the costume version, you know, costume jewelry version of it, you know, go for it. Why absolutely. not? Absolutely. Gorgeous. Space beads. Let's go. Star by. Bye -bye. <laughs> Are they then? Oh gosh, it's right in front of me. Sorry, <laughs> right in front of me. Sorry. It's, oh, steady on. He said it's all right, King. A Carol's just being stupid. That's not very nice, is it? <laughs> this is what I have to work with, Monica, every single day. <laughs> so. This, no, I love you, Neary. This is described. This is described as a heart-shaped spacer. Now, just, just bear with, bear with. Right, so. Bear with me. The top of the bead is slightly, you've got a slight cleavage there. Yes. A suggestion that. of a cleavage. And the bottom part is beautifully rounded. I think that is where that kind of Do you know, this was, this was really shape. nice as, as a centre point of, a, of a, a simple stranded necklace because it always gives you that V point at the bottom, doesn't it? Yeah, it, precisely. Don't you love that sparkle? This is so... Pandora, this is so, uh, this, is, this is absolutely beautiful. It's got a huge aperture, but you'll notice there's a white, there's something white in there. This is a silicon compound. This is what's inside your sliding clasps. Um, so that's what enables you to use your chain through this. I put both ends of the um, sterling silver chain through this and, and there was room for it to literally slip through. So if you've got some really thick chain, I'm thinking some of the cauliflower chain 
or even some of the gorgeous paper uh, clip chain that we've done before. The really kind of big, kind of quite chunky chains. It's going to go through there. It's going to look absolutely gorgeous. It's kind of a make your own slider bracelet, isn't it? Absolutely. Oh. Do you know what? Even some of your, maybe some of your gemstones as well. Yes. So if you've got a couple of maybe micro faceted strands, oh, they might go through there as might, well. Yeah. Create that lovely lariat style. Oh, good idea. I've never tried that. Well, why not? Or lovely, I mean, the tube beads would be would be probably the one to go for, wouldn't it? Because they're so smooth. But we had some yesterday in, what was the gemstone we had those tubes? Oh, it's a goldstone, wasn't it? So you've got those goldstone tubes from yesterday. Why not? You know, give it a go. Um, this is a really, really lovely bead. And you don't have to use it as a slider. You can use it just as a spacer bead um, if you want to. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Slightly unusual shape. I think that's okay. I think, you know, we're, we're dealing with that okay. It's a really, really lovely quality that you're going to be getting now. Yeah, and if you put loads of these together, it's not going to give you that straight edge. It's going to give you a lovely kind of scalloped finish on it, which is really lovely. You know, something you might want to go for. 40 odd seconds, we're going to be taking that price point down. Come on, Neri. Super sparkly, isn't it? It is, isn't it? It's so nice to get something so sparkly. And it's sterling silver as well, which is really wow. lovely. So all 925 sterling silver, uh, which is absolutely gorgeous. I take it it's Cabic Ciconia in there, Neri. Do you know, darling? I assume it's going to be Cabic Ciconia. What price point are we doing for this today? Yeah, well, it's going to be Cabic Ciconia at the price point we're going to go to. It's just stupid. It's just crazy. But I just, I, I, the first thing I saw... Was, Sorry, the first thing I thought when I saw this was Pandora. It's very, very Pandora. Absolutely gorgeous quality. Yeah, the fact you can use it as a slider is just even better. You don't have to, but you can, and that's the great thing. Here we go. <laughs> great price for you today. Here we go, everyone. 0800 644 655 Mary's got three. Well done to you, Cheryl, Maker, Irene, Diana. Linda's got two. Tracy's got two. Julie, Maker, Vanessa. Lynn's got two. Essex has got two. Well done to you. Absolutely gorgeous. So lovely. So often with these sliding clasps that we do, they tend to be quite delicate with kind of quite small apertures. Yes. So, so the chain, so, so the slider doesn't slip. Um, but what's so nice about this is you can use it with the bigger chains, maybe even with gemstones, thicker chains. Just use it as a space but You don't have to use it as a slider. It's just, it's just so lovely. You can see it in there, can't you? This is a silicon compound. It looks a little bit like, um, oh, what does it look like? It looks a bit like a, an earplug or, or, or even a PVA glue almost when it solidifies. It's got that lovely kind of silicon quality. And that's there so you can use it again and again and again. It's not going to shred. It's not going to break. And it's there so you can, um, to make that action nice and smooth. It's not going to damage anything that runs through the aperture. You know, it's just really, really lovely. Gorgeous. Well done, everyone. Does it actually have gems in there or is it just the way the silver's polished? I think it's Cabixiconia. Oh, maybe it's, oh, do you know what? Because it almost looks like it's, it's. No, around the really bottom, that looks like it's got. Does no, it is. It is. Oh, maybe it's diamond cut. I don't know. You look really close. You do. I know. If I look that close, I'm literally going to go across that. I can't actually bring it any closer than that. <laughs> I need to be about there to see it properly. What about you, Monica? Have you got decent eyesight? I used to. I was going downhill, but... Do you think that's gemstones in there, or do you reckon it's silver? I think it's just the way the silver... I think it's diamond cutting. Textured, yeah. So maybe there's no gemstones in it. Maybe it's, it's just... Because those are like flat... Yes. facets of silver well, don't they maybe what, it's just diamond cut on the on the uh close-up on the camera it, it looks like it's just really detailed and really silver that luster is yes. really silver i think that's um diamond cut i think you're right gorgeous beautiful who cares no one's eyesight is good enough to be able to see it anyway <laughs> so who cares you can say it's covered in diamonds oh my gosh yes <laughs> Yes, I mean, don't lie, but uh, <laughs> don't take her advice. Well done, six ninety nine for you today. That's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous feature bead there. And use it as a slider if you want to, or just use it as a spacer. It's just so cute. 30 odd seconds, and we're going to be taking the details away. Well done. Loads of you there. Very, very popular. Now, coming up next, we have got the most amazing highlight opal, which we are finally launching um, after we were meant to launch it back in, I believe it was March or maybe even Feb. And we didn't get a chance to launch it. We've had loads of people messaging us about it. It's launching today after the break. We also have Paraba Quartz, which is a natural variety of quartz. It is utterly brilliant. And it's got that gorgeous Paraba colour as well. 
that's going to be coming up as well, which we're really excited about. So yeah, lots and lots and lots to look forward to, uh, which is brilliant. Well done. Taking those details away. Well done. Judy's just literally in the nick of time bought four of those. Well done. Beautiful. Well done. Okay. Yeah, that will definitely sell out. Loads of you there. Well done. Okay. Don't go anywhere. Coming up next, launch of two brand new gemstones on Jewelry Maker. We'll see you in a sec. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. I would love uh, for each of you to be able to join me this weekend for an unprecedented collection. And I don't just mean unprecedented here at Jewelry Maker. Um, after speaking with many of uh, fellow collectors, and people who are interested in jadeite in the Far East, we genuinely believe this might be the first time ever a gallery exhibition like this has ever been offered firsthand in the Western world. Pieces like this do occasionally make their way into the hands of Western collectors, but it will come from possibly an auction house in Hong Kong. To have the access to a master's studio, to be able to offer his unique artworks to our collectors, that each one has possibly been worked on for six months or longer is a real privilege for me. And for those of you that are gonna be joining in, I've got some very special news to share with you. I want everyone to have the chance to be able to own something, something like this. I think it's very important. And I'd love for you to come and view these incredible pieces of art with me. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
I would love uh, for each of you to be able to join me this weekend for an unprecedented collection. And I don't just mean unprecedented here at Jewelry Maker. Um, after speaking with many of uh, fellow collectors and people who are interested in Jadeite in the Far East, we genuinely believe this might be the first time ever a gallery exhibition like this has ever been offered firsthand in the Western world. Pieces like this do occasionally make their way into the hands of Western collectors, but it will come from possibly an auction house in Hong Kong. To have the access to a master's studio, to be able to offer his unique artworks to our collectors, that each one has possibly been worked on for six months or longer, is a real privilege for me. And for those of you that are gonna be joining in, I've got some very special news to share with you. I want everyone to have the chance to be able to own something, something like this. I think it's very important and I'd love for you to come and view these incredible pieces of art with me. Finally. Oh, absolutely. I mean, this is something that <laughs> I remember seeing last year, fell in love with it. Um, we actually bought it as something else. So we got an incredible deal when we had it certified. And this is what we have everything certified. It turned out to be something even far rarer. Oh, wow. Um, which is unbelievable. So we have an incredible showcase right now of two brand new gemstones. We are, of course, going to start with what many call the world's rarest opal. Oh. And it is actually a, an opal in the truest sense, but un, unlike any other opal, it showcases many, many different qualities. For one, it is transparent. We are dealing with faceted grades this morning, which are the most valuable. And we have never launched this next door on Gemporia. Um, you guys will know because many of you will have migrated across and we've certainly never launched it here as well. It is Highlight Opal. Now, the reason we haven't been able to launch it is because of the way that we work across both of, uh, or all of our channels, we work on a volume basis. And by its very definition, this gemstone is a collector's gem. So it's like a ultra rare specimen, single stone sold. And the reality is most of the material is sold rough, um, not to be faceted, because it's just as stunning when it is rough. It still showcases the same unbelievable uh, um, miraculous kind of phenomenon that you're going to see today and when you cut it you lose about 80 percent so no one cuts this material and you have to have like the real top transparent material not all highlight opal looks like this they form in uh, pegmatites uh, deep in the earth and you've got like the top one percent right now so these are usually sold even at, at the smallest smallest uh, sizes as single gems i don't know if anyone's ever done a strand before like the fact we've done it because we're a jewelry maker and that's, we want you to be able to create jewelry. But I generally, even when we bought this, we didn't think you could do strands. When we acquired the rough, we didn't think that would be possible. Um, and you have the opportunity today. Now they are extremely limited, even, even by like our standards of the rare stones that we bring to you. This is really, really limited. And I want to give you a bit of background about the highlight opal before we even show it to you. Many of you may have already done your own research. But Highlight Opal's uh, properties and fluorescence. So it is the world's rarest opal. Um, highlight Opal share the, mostly the same composition as other opals, specifically in their bodies. It's a mixture of water and silicon dioxide. However, Highlight Opals differ in a few ways. For one, they don't have the same internal mineral structure as the average opal, which are usually opaque. The mini spheres that cause the play of color in precious opals are absent in Highlight. But what it does, does give us is something really, really special. So those silica spheres that we always talk about in Australian yeah. or Ethiopian opals are replaced in this instance with something far rarer. Gosh. It's like a uranium gel, which gets into the mix, which as we know how rare that is, that is what gives you this, it's like the kryptonite. Yes. It is genuinely amazing. one of the most exquisite opals. And I'm not saying it's the most expensive opal in the world that goes to the Lightning Ridge black opal, mm. but in terms of rarity, there is not an opal out there that is rarer than what we're about to bring you. 
So they say, however, highlight opal fluorescence is something of a dream. Do opals fluoresce? Highlight opals do. Displaying a dramatic change in color if placed under shortwave UV light. That's where you'll see the glows of the rarer green and blue highlight opals. Yeah. So throughout its formation, water, those kind of silica spheres, dehydrate. And the highlight opal silica leaves a gel that hardens over many years. And other elements enter into the stone in those formative years, like aluminium, iron, and even uranium. In fact, it is the presence of uranium that gives some highlight opals their fluorescence. Wow. So there are highlight opals, of course, that don't fluoresce. You know, when they just have the iron, when they just have the aluminium, they don't give you that fluorescence. And they're still stunning. They're still, be still beautiful. They'll still be called highlight opals. When I said to you we have the 1% today, I'm talking about those that have one of the rarest earth elements in the world enter into the body of this gem. So a lot of other highlight opals, and you can get them from uh, Brazil, you can get them from Madagascar. Today, we're, we're bringing the, the, from uh, another location. Many others will just form without the presence of fluorescence, which is exceptional, which is still great. Today, you get every single one, and we've been looking at them uh, all morning behind the scenes, has this epic, incredible fluorescence that means you're dealing with the highest grade and the best clarity. So a raw highlight opal, and this is what I was talking to you about, is so striking that its organic shape is enough to command attention. That's why many highlight opals are left uncut in their original literal geode form. So you might see these large geodes in occult shops or in modern artsy living rooms. But in terms of clarity for highlight opals, the clearer or the cleaner, the better. You can expect the more transparent specimens to be cut into soft cabochons. Now, if a highlight opal displays that ethereal fluorescence we mentioned, because they don't all, as we spoke about, but if it does, that's when a lapidrist, you know, as they're saying here, a gem cutter comes mm. out to play. And if a lapidrist gets their hands on a large, transparent and fluorescent highlight opal, they'll cut them into a, a, a glorious faceted gemstone. The facets will accentuate the stone's fluorescence. Now, keep in mind, a faceted highlight opal is rare and expensive. Yes. Super rare. So that's why they say, look, in these artsy living rooms, in the occult shops, you can get like a large geo. Yeah, yeah. It won't fluoresce, which it will very rarely will fluoresce because if it fluoresces, it'll be cut. Um, so it won't fluoresce, but it'll still be highlight opal. It's still exquisite. It's still beautiful. Uh, and then, you know, if, if, if other cutters get hold of it, maybe they'll do cabochons. But it's when you get the fluorescence and the transparency that they are cut. But when, when they're cut, you could have a huge rough. It's still going to yield a very small gemstone. And that's why they say, um, keep in mind a faceted highlight opal is rare and expensive. So most highlight opals don't weigh more than one carat in the market. They just don't. So faceting the stone weighs 60 to 80% of its material. So this is the cut that is only reserved for the largest and rarest specimens. So essentially, everything you're seeing today, although it might not be huge, you think about it was once 80% larger. That's the, for anything here, even the strands, the individual pieces on the strand, they were once you know, eight times or 10 times larger in many cases. Mm. And it's just because of how clean these are, and they're not always this clean, and of how much fluorescence they have that they're cut down to produce something really epic. And, you, and like I said, you'll find single, they don't often get over a carrot. You'll find just stones like this. This was last year. Um, from the same location in Mexico, which Wowzers. is where there is a presence or has been a presence over millennia of uranium in the, in the geology that allows it to do what this is doing. And that, that's, that's $765. And they're saying it's a fascinating oval cut opal that reveals its fluorescent green glow in shortwave ultraviolet light. Highlight opal is formed uh, by hot spring geyser deposits and does not have color play like other opal. Instead, the light rolls off the internal bubble structure uh, and flashes back at the onlooker. So even without the fluorescence, it behaves very differently with light. It, it, it performs with the light. It's, it's like a diamond, essentially. Yeah. And you have the opportunity right now, very limited as it is, and we, we won't be able to do it again, I don't believe, to bring you faceted, transparent, almost loop clean, mm. Mexican natural highlight opal with the ultra rare, miraculous geological occurrences that took place over millions of years to give you the 1%. And I want to share with you, um, what, what's the biggest quantity we've got in this show? Just want to manage kind of everyone's expectations. Not often we get to launch a brand new gemstone um, that is this you. rare. S say again, Neri, we've got what? Of the cut stones, we've got a hundred a couple of them. Okay, so with the cut stones, which are the ones that are usually sold at places like Bonhams if they fluoresce, and these do. The strands, maximum quantity we've got is 40. Okay, so I just wanted to let you know how quick you have to be when you do eventually 
get involved when, when the phone lines are open. But first of all, we're going to show you the legendary Highlight Opal from Mexico. Take a look oh. at this. This is the strand. This Unbelievable is, oh. twinkling color. And in a moment, you'll see that fluorescence for which it is. There you go. Look at that. My yeah. gosh. This is it. Collector's dream. It is a collector's dream. What strikes me about this is, yes, it's colourless. It's an opal as well. And clear, but it's an opal. So it's That's a crystal why I can't opal. Quite get my it's head a crystal right. opal, which is absolutely exquisite. You don't find these in Ethiopia. You don't find them in obviously Australia, and and it has this unbelievable fluorescence. And only about 1% of them do. When you find these in Madagascar, they don't do it. When you find them in Brazil, they don't do it. They're still yeah, special. They're still referred to as highlight opals. They are still gemologically highlight opals. But it is the presence of the uranium that gives you this epic fluorescence. Don't, I mean, it's not radioactive. It's, um, it's contained within the crystal and it's in the smallest trace just, amounts. It just, just gives you that incredible it, color. Yeah, I can see what you're doing, uh, Carol. Look at it, it sings. Yeah. It does. Literally sings. It's kryptonite. I, I, it's I, like such a unique fluorescence, such a unique colour. The blues and the greens that they talk about are so coveted within this collection. I'm a huge fan of Cullen and Topaz, clear quartz, um, crystal quartz, clean, crisp gems. Yeah. And this is this clean, crisp gem, but it, there's something different about, not just the fluorescence, there's something, di when you look at it, there is yeah. something different about the re refraction that you get. Absolutely, but they say it's, it's the way the light interacts with those bubble-like spheres, those yeah. kind of silica spheres. Remember, in this case, they've turned to like a gel. Yes. Um, and it interacts with the light very differently yeah. from any other gemstone that might look like it on first instance, like you said, the quartz, like you said, um, uh, the other gemstones that are clean, like zircon, like diamond. Yes. Like, like um, a colorless sapphire, yeah. it behaves very, very differently. And I know we get caught up in, in the, um, the fluorescence, fluorescence, but the reality is Hylar opals, when they're fasted, even without the fluorescence, yeah. whether they're from Madagascar or Brazil, are extremely expensive. And the reason for that is because they behave like no other gemstone on earth. It's a transparent opal. Yes, that's, that's the reality. Crazy. And we know opals behave with the light very differently, you know, down to their crystal structure, down to the fact that they are yes. contained of you know, millions of silica spheres that behave with the light very differently. You've got the opportunity right now, oh, as wow. limited as it may be, to get some of the largest carat weights ever put together, that's ever. So like I've spoke with this person um, who is you know, going to Mexico and acquiring this material as part of our coveted collection for you today, yeah. a brand new launch. You know, the, the, it takes them a long, long time to acquire this material, oh to cut gosh. this material. And you very rarely ever get anything over a carat. And you've got a massive strand right now. Just look at that. Yeah, it's ethereal. D Dave's absolutely right there. You imagine a diamond and the crystalline structure of a diamond, the structure, the way the light is going to interact with that, the way a petalite brings yeah. you in a brilliance. Absolutely. It's all completely different. This, even without the fluorescence, it just, there is something about yeah. it. It just looks different. It's so beautiful. And it's because of those, those silica yeah, balls, Yeah, which those is molecules. like turned to gel, yes. which is unique to any other opal. Love this. So it just behaves very, very differently. It's an extremely rare occurrence. Extremely rare. And you can see it on the hand there, the way that it interacts with the light very differently. Yeah. This that... is the first one we're going to do, right? Yes. Neary, what's so, the carrot yeah. weight on this? 10 carats. Okay, could well, be, could well be the biggest carat weight uh, collector's piece out there. Yeah. I'm going to give you a 30 second oh. clock and open this one up. How many of these, nearly 40? No, 20. Oh, okay, all right. Oh, yeah, so it is, it is genuinely probably the biggest carat weight put together. It's crazy to put this many t together to create a 10 carat strand. 20 of these in the world, and I wish you the best of luck. 10 carats of higher light Mexican fluorescent opal. I think of all of the super rare gems that we've done, I'm thinking of the, um, the, the gem that we did, oh gosh, um, oh, completely, a, a trifolite that we did the other week. Yeah, trifolite, yeah. We had bigger quantities of trifolite yeah, than we of do course. with this. 20. Absolutely. So this is, you know, th this morning is about offering you those oh, rare wow. occurrences. You know, this is the higher light opal, which is available right now, 10 carats. You know, faceted, twinkling, giving you that incredible, beautiful glow. And of course, we have the Paraba Quartz coming up as well, but it's very different to any Paraba yeah. Quartz you may have encountered before. So we're just waiting for our screen to catch up, but Neri's saying that there are There's so only 20. many in baskets, absolutely loads sitting in baskets as it stands at the minute. 
Um, I, this is very difficult to be able to quantify. There will be people that multiply. They get yes. like the 20 carat strand. They're going to create something out of this. There's nothing else like this in the show. Wow, that's just, just we haven't even look. dimmed the lights. We Maker and Kent, you're there. Cheshire, Somerset, yes. Gloucestershire, you're all there. Congratulations. My gosh, well done. We've already got multi bidders through. This is absolutely fantastic. Well done. We have 20, we had 20 strands available. No way near that now. Lorna Maker, Maker, Jackie, Claire, Valerie, Maker, Tracy, Maker, Maker. Oh my gosh, absolutely brilliant. The quality you're getting here, the the fact that it's the, the round silica balls that the light is refracting off and reflecting, re refracting through and reflecting off gives you a different style of luster to any other clear gemstone. And then you've got that fluorescence. Okay, we've got way oh, more people on the phone lines. 40 than we have in baskets, my um, gosh. We, we only had 20. I'm going to encourage you to be as quick as you can on the phone lines. I'm going to start at a crazy deal right now. I'm going to start at 500 pounds. I'm going to start there. I could start thousands and wow. thousands, but I want you to know yeah. how great the deals are going to be today. And we're going, to, we're going to finish nowhere near this, just so you know. This is already fantastic. Look at all these in baskets. Your names are going off the screens in baskets, by the way, yeah. just, just to make you aware. Lots and lots and lots of interest from all over the country. This is so good to see. Okay. Um, I'm going to ask for a minute clock. This one's going to disappear. We do have another strand, but it's not faceted in the same way. It's tumbled. You know, we talk about it, even in those organic shapes, they're mm. amazing. I'm going to ask you to be as fast as you can if you've fallen in love with this. You know, Hyla Opal in any form is extremely expensive. Like I said, even if it's from, uh, you know, the Brazilian mine, even if it's from the Madagascan mine, but this is from that legendary Mexican deposit. We are apparently over allocated, Niri is saying, but just make sure you're checking out. Just make sure you are checking out today. Half a minute to do that. I'm taking hundreds and hundreds off the price. We're going to do something absolutely mm. remarkable. 10 carat collector's opportunity on Hyalite Opal. Only 20 of these in the world. All faceted, as you can see. All clean, as you can see. Uh, all natural. And, um, you know, certified Mexican and certified natural. And you can see the fluorescence that we're showing you, even in the studio, even with the big lights on. We have got so much interest in this gem. So, and you know what? We weren't able to launch it a few weeks ago. We've had so many people yeah. messaging in. When are you launching it? When are you launching it? So many people have obviously heard of it. And, and are aware it. of it. Are aware of yeah. it. Like I said, you can find information out there. You can see the prices out there. So I'm going to do for this one because so many of you have trusted us. And, and you obviously know we, we want to do an amazing deal for you. Take £400 clean off the price. You've got maybe eight seconds. Oh, my gosh. Maybe eight seconds. Ninety-nine pounds. Ninety-nine pounds. We're going to go double figures on this. Oh my god. We gosh. shouldn't. We shouldn't, but we're going to. That's amazing. Oh, huge. Susan, Caroline, Karen, Valerie, Maker, Look Claire, uh, Gloucestershire. Told you we'd have multi buyers. Amazing. Tracy, well done. You've multi bought on this. Uh, Maker and Kent, you've multi bought on this. Yeah, well done. This is amazing. There are so many still in baskets. Lots of people checking out. We're down literally to the last couple of opportunities. Well done, everybody. Um, loads and loads and loads of potential with a strand like this, and something which. So many people have wanted, so many people have requested uh, since we were going to launch it, then we, uh, yep. then we couldn't launch it. Um, and lots and lots of people very excited. Remember, about only 20 today. of these strands ever. So it could be in 50, 60 baskets. We are only taking confirmations this morning. We, we want you to own it. We've gone double figures. We're doing something absolutely amazing for this. Well done to everyone along the bottom of the screen. Um, well done to those of you that have had the opportunity to multi buy. Yes. This is one of those special moments for every single one of you. And do you know what? We're going to do something even crazier. Let's do a 30 second clock. We'll go again. We're already in double figures. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. It's in We've so got, like, many baskets. Six left. Valerie's got two. Jane, you're there. Oh Major my gosh. Kent, you've got two. Tracy's got two. Margaret, you're there. We're going to go crazy. Good luck. I don't even know if I've got any left. If I'll do you know what? And, 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 and do you know, it's a new gemstone, Dave. I get people are trying to make their minds up. People are yeah. putting oh, them in sure. the baskets because they want to see the other strand. They want to see the, the loose stones as well. You want to make your mind up. I get that. We don't have time for that. We're taking, we're taking confirmations only. We're not taking baskets. As, oh, amazing. Yes, it's gone. We are just taking confirmations on this. Oh, there you go. There are a few amazing highlight Deborah. Bead strands out there. 18 inch faceted, four to six mil, all natural, minimum 400 pounds approximately. Um, rare, so obviously expensive. Very, mm, says uh, Deborah. I, I, I don't know what the rest of it is. 79.99. Good luck. Absolutely brilliant. 79.99. We're going to do oh, this for you. Natural, fantastic. Mexican, fluorescent, highlight opal. 
Well done. That's pretty much sold out. We've got so many people there. This is absolutely brilliant. Well done. Go, 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 go. What an opportunity. Such a rare gem. Oh, no problem, Jane. You know, like yeah. I said, it's a massive team effort, um, but I'm, I'm absolutely thrilled that you're adding it to your collection, Jane, as is so many others. And unfortunately, so many of you are going to miss out on this particular mm -hmm. piece. We do have another strand coming up and then we move into those faceted, Gorgeous. incredible collector's gems. Now, this next strand is so beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's oh, it's that lovely kind of. But I've got to tell you, uh, you can probably imagine we've jumped up massively <gasps> carrot weight here. This is much larger than 10 carats. This is the one oh my we've God, got 40 of. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Okay, 30 second clock, and we'll bring the graphics in on this exquisite piece. But Look remember, at that. we are a much bigger carrot weight, super clean. You're right, Dave. You know, you were saying earlier on, these are pretty much loop clean, and they are, which. It, it, I have to keep reminding myself, this is opal. Yeah. These are opals. We've shown you the diagrams of how opals form and, and their molecular structure and why they are the way that they are so many times. These are, this is made up of silica balls, uh, yeah. which, have, um, which have turned to gel, which have filled... And then, but other... in this rare instance, you know, usually with other highlight opals, you'll get a, a combination of maybe iron and aluminium that enter that kind of unique structure. With yeah. this rare instance, what's happened is that you've got uranium entering into the mix, which is extraordinarily rare. I can't think of another gem that contains uranium. And uh, that's what's giving you that green blue fluorescence. So 40 of these available, much larger carrot weight. Yes. And I promise you, it's the last strand. We're going to do something crazy for you. You can afford it. You can get it. Good luck to every single one of you. We are, of course, waiting for the phone lines to catch up. Um, there's a lag, which means it's probably very busy. If you're multi-bought on the other one, make sure you're multi-buying on this one. Now, you're looking here at 50. 15 carats yeah. of highlight opal. You were saying earlier on how it's how unbelievably rare it is to get this gemstone in anything, which is kind of over a carat. And yeah. although the individual stones won't quite be a carat, I mean, these central ones are very, very sizable indeed. I would imagine it's, the central ones might be. Yeah, no, if it, I'm honest. I think you might be right. Because they're big, they're large. They're huge, yeah. Absolutely amazing. I know opal doesn't have the same specific gravity as maybe a diamond or whatever, but these are mm. big, big gems. 15 carats. Exquisite strand, oh, the wow. only other strand, and we have 40. Do you know where I'm going to start just to make this app? Just to let you know, I'll, I'll have a 30 second clock, Ollie. If you trust me, then at the start price, you're going to be happy. Because the start price is where uh, Neary, our, our producer, thinks I'm going to stop. That's where I'm going <laughs> to start. So to Valerie, to Kent, who's multi bought, to Caroline, you're there, Susanna in the Isle of Man, Susan in Lancashire, Michelle. Trust me, and anyone else who wants to own the final strand, the other one is completely sold out. The much larger carat weight here, unbelievably clean and paralleled in that kind of clarity. Yes. Um, I'm going to say good luck to all of you. And um, my start price for everyone is £99. I'm starting at 99 Oh, so wow. You imagine how crazy Bigger this carat weight. Bigger carat weight, bigger quantity, <laughs> bigger deal. So I'm telling you, we saw oh, how gosh. quick 20 went. By the way, I'm going again. I'm starting here. This is a logical price. This is where we should be finishing. Uh, yes, no Caroline, problem, it's Caroline. a huge amount of effort. These are the kind of months in the yeah, making strands like sure. this. For sure, absolutely. I mean, we talk, remember as well, we're talking about an 80% waste yeah, precisely. in producing That's 15 really carats good, yeah. of, of exquisite, transparent, top gem, incredible highlight opal with that fluorescence. My gosh. There's so many people there. Do you know what? We're about to celebrate our 13th birthday. And I've you know, been, from joy, a bit, a bit, been with Joy Maker from the start. Our first gemstones were black agate yep. and maybe amethyst. That was it. We didn't have access to the big four. We certainly didn't have access to tanzanite or opal or no. diamonds or any. This is, and look at where we are now, 13 years later. Absolutely. And, and we're going to be, we're nowhere near where we're going to finish. So I'm going to give oh you a minute clock God. right now. Give you a minute clock, only 40. We don't have 100. We don't have 200. We have oh. 40 of these available. We don't even have that anymore. If you're on the phone lines, well done. If you've already checked out, well done. If you're with it in your basket, it's time to check out. 52 seconds before you see where I'm going to go on a 15 carat 
collector's series of Highlight Opal. People starting to check out. I yeah. think they're the people who missed out on the last strand, perhaps. Uh, Tracy's already bought two. Kent's already bought two. People from all over the country, the Isle of Man to Greater London. It's absolutely, it's, it's so good to see you today. The quality you're getting here is just amazing. I can't get over this. The, the fluorescence of green is just so beautiful and, it, and it's representative of, what did you say, kind of that kind of top percent of... Yeah, 1%. Yeah. Doing 1% with that Look fluorescence, 1% with that transparency. Yeah, that is 17, 16 seconds, guys, for, for Beryl, Maker, Susanna, Alison, Tracy, you've multi-bought Susan, Valerie, Kent, you've multi-bought Carolina Greater Manchester, you're there, Sharon, Tracy, uh, Lancashire, Michelle, you're there, four seconds. This is our start price. Okay. You know what we're going to do, Neary? We're going to match the price of the smaller carat weight. Ooh. Give you that opportunity because so many of you missed out in the end on that, that first piece. We were very limited. Here we are up at 15 carats, much larger, larger carat weight. And just to give you this ultra rare, exquisite opportunity that none of us maybe ever thought we'd be able to get, I want to match the price for you. So if you, if you fall in love with this gem, this is the final strand of the show, the final strand of the collection. And I want you to get it. I want you to have it in your collection. Gorgeous. Well done. 79.99. We've got more people coming through. This is so good to see. Uh, the very first time we've ever had this gemstone on Jewelry Maker. This is a Gemporia group launch, if you like. It's never even been um, uh, entertained, you know, you know, you know, made into jewelry and, 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 and launched um, over on Gem TV. Right. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm only going to give you 30 seconds. If you trust me, I'd get on the phone. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. I'm going to go again. And I apologize to Neary. I what? want these all gone today. I want you to get your highlight open strand. I want you to see this with your own eyes. You know, when we're talking about the way that it interacts with the light, when we show you that top 1% oh and the way that it fluoresces, this is a one-off deal that I'm going to do for you right now. It's a live deal. And we've got no more of these on order. No. You can't get hold of this material. Like even our own collectors are messaging and it's extremely expensive. That's the reality. Yeah. We, we see it in the auction houses. We see it in mineral collections. And we're already at rock bottom right now. Fastest, maybe 20 of you can, can own this. Everyone who's already got it gets the final deal too. 50 quid. 49.99. Take oh it and gosh. run. That is your exquisite, unbelievable opportunity. Take it, just go for it, do it now, uh, because this, this, there's no more of this on order. You know, this is we we want to be able to bring you some of the rarest gemstones, and and and, and a bit like what Dave said the other day when we launched the um, people multi with you buying as well. three this of is, these. This is as much about us saying to our friends, uh, yeah, we've launched um, Trifolite, we've launched um, Highlight Opal. You know, you know, you know. What's bigger? What's better? What's rarer? We want to be a, we, we want to be at the forefront of that oh, and be able sure. to bring you some of the rarest gems on planet Earth. It's as much to put on our CV, bringing this to you as it is have it, you having this in your collection. It's so exciting to be Absolutely. able to bring this to you. And, and like I said, we've got Trace who's bought four of these. We've got Maker and Kent who's bought three of these. We've got yes. Valerie who's bought two of these, which is exactly what we should be doing. You've got the opportunity. We're down in the teens now in terms of the uh, available quantity. If you can do it, look, it's, it's a free phone number. Use your, check out your baskets. Use the app. Do whatever you can. We're yeah. literally at rock bottom 50 pounds right now for a 15 carat strand of legacy Mexican Highlight Opal with that ultra rare glow. Look, we've got 11 chances, 10 chances remaining. Baskets are absolutely rammed. Yep. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. You're doing such a wonderful job today. Um, 10 left, that's it. We're going to do, let's put a minute clock uh, countdown to, to the auction ending for you. Um, that's the best we can do. So we've got nine left. It might sell out in that time, but I'll try and give you, you know, 55 seconds right now for you to yep. get this into your collection. This, this literally is stock versus clock. Yeah, I like stock that. versus clock, as I thought it was. Which is, I, I thought it was a type of sausage, but it's not. It's stock versus clock. Well done. Eight opportunities remaining. We've got single figures remaining now. Um, uh, Ollie just said it looks like a mood ring as well. It, do you remember those mood rings you used to get in the kind of the uh, early nineties? It's exactly like that. It's that gorgeous kind of. Um, it's that beautiful, changeable colour that you get, that wonderful fluorescence. That Less than have. half a minute now, guys, before well this completely sells out. Yep. Seven chances remaining. You can still do it. I don't want you to think you've missed your opportunity or missed out. The first strand has completely, completely sold out. Completely gone. And this is the only one we've available. And not only is it a bigger carrot, we've gone lower in price. Yeah, gorgeous. Well done. Maker and Kent's bought four. Well done to you. God love you. Well done. Just fantastic. So, yeah. I believe we've got something really special coming up now. Yeah, so we've, we've spoken and spoken about how there's very few of these gems that even exist that are over a carat, that even reach a carat. We've got one right now for you, which is over a carat. In the whole show, it's a single gem over a carat. How many of these? A hundred. Oh, 
For how many? 52. That's amazing. Take a look at this. Oh. Do not miss out on this My gosh. I'm in love with that. I think, I think we all are. Um, I'm going to give you a 30 second clock to bring oh, this in for you. Wow. Um, it is the collector's gem. That's lovely. Of the year, I would say. 52 of these available, over a carrot, faceted to perfection. If you'll never see the likes of this again. It's an engagement ring. It's a significant ring. It's everything one could imagine. <gasps> Look at you. I'm telling you. We've got 52. You're going to multi-buy. That's like a Paraba yeah, kind of absolutely. Uh, glow. That even, is... even, even when we're out of the, the fluorescence and you see the way that, look at it, the way that it holds the light. It's a transparent, colourless opal. Oh, it's just... so rare. Well over a carrot as well. It's and a look, supreme gem. And look, I've, got, I've got diamonds in this ring here. Look how that stands up against yeah. the diamonds. I mean, if I knew what I knew now about gems when I, when I first, you know, when I got married, um, all those years ago, I would have, I would have uh, had, had, you know, instead of diamonds, I'd have had petalite. But now I see this, I think I'd rather have highlight opal. It's oh, just, I'm with it's you. It's just incredible. You know what I'm going to do, just to give you the confidence. So crisp. We've got 52 of these available. I'm going to start at 99 pounds. This is a collector's gem. Anywhere else, you know, you're talking into the high hundreds for something like this. You can do your own research. It's well over a carat. There's That's very amazing. few of these even on the market. The fact that we have 52 is an absolute miracle. And that's your start price. That's your start price, and we're going to go way lower. It's going to be an unmissable deal, I promise you that. Um, in fact, I'll let you know right now, it's going to be the lowest price you've seen so far. Oh, wow. In the end. That is absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. My goodness me. That quality. Look at that. That really is an engagement stone, isn't it, Neri? Yeah, it's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? It's so crisp. It's such a gorgeous look. Double figures already. Let's do a 30 second clock. Well done to everyone on the bottom of the screen. Got people multi buying. I've told you it's going to be the lowest price you've seen so far for Highlight Opal. We've already been down at 49.99. Oh my God. This is the big collector's gem. I mean, if this was set, if this was next door, it's going to be in gold. It's, it's going to be, you know, it's going to be expensive. That's the reality. We're not talking rondelles right now. We're not talking tumble gems. We're talking unique, exquisite, you know, oval, brilliant, faceted gem. Holding the light like no other gem I've ever seen. Massive. Massive for any gem, but massive for this gem. Okay, now we're going to go to 49.99, and I'm still going to tell you I'm not done. So I'm just letting you know, we only have 52 though. I know for some of the other pieces we have 100. There's 52 of these. What? Yeah. We're not done. We're not done. Oh my gosh, there are loads in baskets. Baskets are absolutely... Please do not leave... $49.99 for over a carat of highlight opal. This is a calibrated stone as well. It's nine by seven mil in size. So there will be semi-mounts on our website to kind of ready-made for this, as it were. Right, let's do, let's do a minute clock. Unbelievable. Good luck. This is the final price that's going to come in after this minute expires. Um, I'm, I'm going to say right now, get this whilst you can. You know, Neary's saying to me, don't devalue it. This is your moment. This is what you're going to get. How many do we have left? How many do we have left, Neri? 23. Right, make sure you're getting these. Make sure that you are owning this. 52 is all we had. This half is, the stock's gone. This is without the light on it, by yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is without the, the UV light on it. This is it with the UV light. It looks absolutely brilliant. Mm -hmm. That's it without. Yeah. It is... It, it is luminous, yeah. even without the light. It is just such a special, uh, such a special gem. Sue in Edinburgh has already bought two. This is so good to see. Well done. I can't believe forty nine ninety nine is not the price point today. This is utterly brilliant. Right. Come on, Dave. What are you going to do? I can't believe I'm going to do this. Nearly, I'm going to devalue it. But if you want the deal, be as fast as you can. Twenty nine ninety nine. Good luck. I mean, I don't know where else Have to go. Have you ever sold anything on one of your shows for twenty nine ninety nine? I don't believe so. And I've never sold Highlight Opal. Never, ever have I ever talked about Highlight Opal on, on a screen next door, here, wherever, gem collector. This is your moment to own one of the largest out there. You know, they literally say in all the literature, these stones don't get to a carrot. Very seldom do they reach a carrot. And right now, you've got your opportunity to get over a carrot. Natural, Mexican, fluorescent, Highlight oh Opal for 29 
You've been given a new name, by the way, uh, Dave. You're no longer the King of Jade or whatever name. Actually, he gave that to himself. I did. He's didn't. known as Devaluing Dave. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that just for this one moment, just for this morning. Join me. The day evaluator, yes. Yeah, I like That's that. The That's the one very to go good, for. Very good. Listen, our screens haven't caught up yet. Uh, we're having terrible issues um, over the last over the last week or so. There are loads of people that. Uh, there we go. Look, that screen jumping into action there. Um, three chances remaining. It is still 28 in baskets. It's absolutely flying. Well done. What a silly deal. Yeah. What a silly. What a silly boy. What a silly boy. I am. <laughs> it's going to get even sillier. So we have uh, a, a few other opportunities of the Highlight Opal. We have some big, big quantities coming your way. And oh. um, you're about to see a matched pair of these. My gosh. Yeah. Oh, my yeah. gosh. How many of these, Neary? Woo! Please say we've got loads. Oh, where are these big hundred quantities? Yeah, I know. That's 52. what you said. Well, which one do we have a hundred of? Like, oh, I don't know. Gee whiz. I feel like he's leading us up the garden path, to be fair, Dave. Right. No, we do know, I agree. When, we do know that when we're talking about any gemstone, faceted gem, when you get a matched pair. Hoo -hoo -hoo! Yeah, that's oh the best gosh. I've seen. That's the best I've seen. That's the best quality. Yeah, for sure. And when we talk about that matched pair, then the price goes up because you've got to find two of them. They've got to match in, oh my God. Beautiful. Yeah. Exceptional. You know what he's done, don't you? What? There are 52 opportunities, but he's added these two together, hasn't he? The match pair, he's added them together. So, ah. he's, he's, you know what I mean? He said, we've got 100 of something. This might be it. There's 100 52 opportunities. Gemstones, but only yes. 52 opportunities. Yeah. opportunities. He's found a loophole. He really has, hasn't he? Yeah. He's a big These are glowing, and you can see them there in the palm of the hand, even without that UV light. You see how they glow, the, the way they interact with the light. 52 opportunities, 30 second clock, we're going to get the graphics in for you. 30 I, I seconds. I just can't believe that. They're What's the carrot weight near it? It's got to be over a carrot here. One point. Okay, biggest carrot weight in the faceted gems of the whole show. Massive. 1.6 carats. So you're looking at roughly, what, 80 points per stone yeah. here. These Best are... part of a carrot <laughs> in each stone. <laughs> Amazing. Dave's probably not aware what a lot of that stuff that you've just written means, um, Neary. Neary kind of writes kind of shorthand little notes and things. He's like, like hip, isn't he? Yeah. He's yeah. Very yeah. Like hip. Youth speak. Yeah. That's what I speak. call it. I've got no idea what it means. Slang. No, I don't think he does. I don't think he does. Well I do. done. I do. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm being judged by Carol. He has no idea. He doesn't. He's a square. Exactly, and Neary, like, finding my corner, saying, no, he knows what it means. And Carol's like, he really doesn't. Okay. He really doesn't. Well, I wouldn't know. I just kind of, well, clearly you're a lot more hip-hop and happened. I'll take that. That's me. Right, only 52 of these, biggest carrot weight. This is going to go crazy. Let's start <laughs> at 99.99 again. Oh, dear. Yeah, let's do just... it. Let's go crazy. Multi-buy, if I'm you. Yeah, well Multi-buy, each of these is, is engagement ring size. Each of these is massive for this gem for this type, for the quality you're getting. And to get two of these, two huge gems, totaling 1.6 carats is remarkable. Oh, bidder in Florida coming through to get these. Well done, lovely dear, fantastic. 30 second clock, it's gonna be relentless right now and you're gonna to have to be super competitive. It's only 52 opportunities. Look, I know, I know, I know, you know, with the UV light, it's got all these incredible colors. That, you wouldn't even be able to, I wouldn't even expect to get a mystic topaz, which has been no, coated with titanium to give, uh, to give those kind of colors out. This does it so beautifully it's totally natural as well and it's an opal it's yeah. an opal it is two left of the tumbles by the way amazing uh, the, the other two have sold out yeah the, the, the first strand sold out obviously the big one carat piece sold out but this is 1.6 carats 1.6 49.99 and we're still not done even though even if if we say 29.99 for the one point for the one carat gem yeah we should be done here we oh definitely be done here but i'm not going to be you've seen how competitive it is. 30 second clock, Ollie. We're gonna do something unreal. And I want you to capitalize on it. I want you to multi-buy if you can. Yeah. Get yourself four gems. Oh, please do. Please do. Again, these are calibrated, so they're gonna sit uh, beautifully in one of our ready-made settings. Yeah. Eight by six millimeters in diameter. Um, they're absolutely gorgeous. I'm thinking an ombre 
a fire opal with this at the end, maybe a long line pendant. Yeah, Alison, I love the idea of fire for oranges and greens and blues. They're just gorgeous, gorgeous together. Absolutely beautiful. Jacqueline Valerie's got two. Gosh, these are going nuts. Are they going to? And, and the, the reason there's a clock on your screen is because we're about to give you another deal, another price. We're going lower on this, 1.6 carats. And I don't even know how many we have remaining right now because our screen is really struggling to keep up. Yeah. It is absolutely wild because obviously this is the biggest carat weight of We've the show. We've got 28 capacity. available. Amazing. Well, then make yourself, um, put yourself on the phone lines, put yourself ready to capitalise on this because we're going to go and match the price of the one carat piece. Look at that. We're going to go to 29.99. This is 29 for both? Yeah, for, for this, this whole parcel, for the match pair. Oh, my gosh. £15 a gem. Yeah. Fifteen pounds a gem. Oh my word! This is um, and this is by far and away the best quality. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that's crazy. I don't know if I like that. This actually. is this is the best quality that we've seen light. today. Woo. And and also there's two of them and they're huge. This is the best quality. Yeah. That we've got out of all of them. Yeah. I mean, without a doubt, and you've seen them up close, you've seen them under the UV light. You know, we couldn't say that if it wasn't true. You're seeing them as well. Yeah. You're seeing that fluorescence, you're seeing that clarity, and for, for sure we're seeing that huge size right now. Well done. At 29.99, we're looking at 15 pounds of stone. The sooner you can get involved, the better, just purely because our system is having real problems with keeping up over the last, over the last week or so, especially when we get we'll, really... We'll tell you what we'll do, because we have no idea what's going <clears> on right now with the system. I think Neri has a clear understanding. What we're going to do is give you a minute to close this out. Yep, let's give you a that. minute clock. Good luck. Take advantage. Huge congratulations. Well done, everybody. Just totally ethereal. Unlike anything else we've ever bought you before, it's an opal. Just, just incredible. Well done. 45 seconds. Maker in Cumbria, Jacqueline, Valerie, Alison, Susan, another Susan, Maker, Caroline, Jackie, uh, Channel Islands, East Sussex, Florida, Bridge End. We've got Margot in Fife. We've got Michelle. We've got Gail in the West Midlands. We've got Nottingham, Dorset. We've got Norfolk. We've got Oxfordshire. We've got Florida. Good luck. Exquisite. Beautiful already. Better than any petalite I've ever bought you. Better than any dambrite I've bought yeah. you. That is just unlike anything else. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Ollie. You know, this is a gemstone. If you want to make gem, uh, if you want to make jewelry for maybe a teenager, someone who's kind of difficult to please, this they're gonna they're gonna like dragon eyes. Oh, they are like dragon eyes. Oh, Alison dragon eyes. Yes, I can imagine that. Alison Tari using these with the oh, dragon eyes. Woo! Absolutely gorgeous. Good well luck. done. Now we move into the hundred quantities, and we're gonna give you the best deal of the whole show. Because bigger the deal, bigger the quantity, bigger the deal. We always say that, and we're gonna be true to that today so these is the the last few moments for you the last few auctions that we're going to be bringing to you right now again we're going to be dealing with a match pair um and we're going to see oh, a price no one uh, no one's expecting let's just say that sweet as um you know we bought you a lot of loose gemstones over the years seven by five mil is the size people go for for rings for earrings so hence that we've we've got more semi mounts yeah, made in um, look at that they are literally glowing in seven by five millimeter sizes than any oh else. wow oh they're stunning yeah so the graphics will be open in 15 seconds there's a hundred of these be on the phone lines early in this particular size as well it is like it's almost become more concentrated yes it is absolutely beautiful Okay. Again, we're at the 1.10, the, 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 the 1.1 carat mark, which was the first piece. I, I guess it's a matter of preference. Yeah. Silver, I think, is really going to complement it. Gold, I think, yeah, gold's going to be a nice contrast. I mean, Monica, I mean, you're, you're over there. You've been captivated by these, I can tell. They're gorgeous, aren't they? I think silver or gold would work, wouldn't it? Uh, absolutely. Even rose gold would look really Yeah, good. rose gold would look delicious with it. It really would. It's just such a, it's such an incredible um, optical property. I've never seen anything else like it. We've seen gemstones at Fluoresce, but not, not like this. No. Not like okay. this. Okay, let's start at 49.99. Okay, same carat wow. weight as the first piece we bought to you, the 1.10. This is a, maybe should be more expensive because they're a match pair. They're not going to be because we've got 100. 
pair of earrings, whatever it is you, you decide to do with these. And I'm going to give you a minute clock because I'm telling you we're nowhere near done. So you're going to see the lowest price so far today on this piece. We've got 100 of them. Make sure you are fast. Make sure you're reacting quick. Make sure you're multi-buying um, because this is going to be one of those deals that I think when we were first introduced to this stone this morning, none of us thought we might even be able to afford it. This is going to be insane. So Dawn, Karen, Jennifer, Wiltshire, Michelle, Margaret, Susan, uh, Dorset, Gabby, you're there. Another maker, multi-buyers, good luck. And just Half a to, minute. And just to let you know, these are selling out. Even if they don't sell out on the live auction, they are selling out afterwards with about 20 to 30 people missing out. Mm -hmm. And if Dave does what he's kind of implying he's it's going to, be the to do with price this, of the show. lowest price of the show, then we are in for a treat. And do you know what? This is going to be the most accessible deal of all of them. And it's only made possible by the fact that we're in the 100, the 100 quantity yeah. market. And remember, you're still dealing with over a carrot. That's okay. it. We're not let's, let's go to, let's match the lowest price, 29.99 on the first. Oh my gosh. 29.99. And then Ollie, when we see that, let's give everyone 30 seconds. And then I'm going to go again and give you the final deal. Okay. I want you to have the confidence. Everyone is multi-buying now. That's the way we should do it. So really, it's a 52 quantity auction again. Yes, precisely. Because everyone is multi-buying. Well, Maker and Kent's just bought five loads of these, so it's not going okay. to be 52 quantity. Yeah, that's right. Everyone is multi. This We're is going again, brilliant. and I can't even give you a minute because it is absolutely wild on the phone lines. 100 quantity is big. It is a big quantity. It's huge, it's yeah. Great. It's a great opportunity, but it also is... Extremely busy this morning, and a lot of us have been taken with this phenomenal gemstone. Dawn's got four loads. Do you know where we're going, Dave, or uh, have you not decided yet? I've not decided yet. Great. Good to know. Uh, good to know he's in control, isn't it? Yeah. Great to know. Ready? Uh, I was going to say twenty-nine ninety-nine, but we'll yeah. be there. Uh, <laughs> okay, nineteen pound ninety-nine pence. There you go. Good luck. Um, over a carrot. Well over a carrot. Um, match ten pair, pounds a which stone. Which we should pay a premium for. Exquisite. Ten pounds a stone. Yeah, when you say it like that, that is bad. Ten pounds for highlight opal. Mexican fluorescent natural highlight opal. Dawn bought four, she's now got five. Michelle bought one, she's now got three. Susan bought one, she's now bought two loads. Maker and Wiltshire's now bought two loads. We've got multi... Baskets have just literally gone nuts. You asked me earlier, Carol, you said, have I nuts. ever done a deal at 29.99? I can tell you I've never done one at 20 quid. 20 pounds. Um, no problem, Linda. Um, oh, there you go. Linda's um, been with us throughout. I've got the faceted strand that sold out first and the, the large cut oval, which is absolutely the one point, the, the, the same carrot weight as this, but yeah. the single oval. 1.1, one one. yeah. Oh my gosh. It's gone completely bonkers. Well done to everybody. Valerie's just bought three. Well Amanda, done, well done to Christine Joy. Well done to you, Leslie, uh, Alison, Chantal. Well done to you, Wendy and Pam. This is a tremendous deal. And make, do you know, this is what I love about being able to bring you gems like this. Incredibly rare, kind of specimen only, yes. really. In workable, faceted gemstones, drilled gemstones, loose gemstones. We, we are, and being able to bring them to you for I have prices, no idea how so we're accessible. doing because our, our phone lines are so... Uh, have such a lag at the moment. Yeah, what I'm going to give you a minute clock to close that because as Carol yeah. said, even though they don't sell out in the live, they're selling out online, they're selling out on the app. Yeah. We get, we've gone to the lowest ever deal. The, the, the phone lines are absolutely uh, full right now, Chocolate but we box. have no idea what's going on. So you've got, I'll, I'll leave this live on your screen for the next 45 seconds. Yeah, so Amanda's just come through to get another one as well. Barbara, most people who are multi, a lot of people buying on the app, a lot of people coming through on the website. Beryl's just come through on the phone line, so's Linda, but you know, this is, we are extremely busy. Well done, everybody. Lots and lots and lots of people coming through. This is just tremendous. Well done. 0800 644 655. Go, 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 go. What a fantastic deal. Mm -hmm. I, I can't. I can't even give you the number of baskets because they're just updating every yeah. 30 seconds or so. And we've got 20 more in baskets, 20 more in baskets. It's crazy. 61 in baskets. Well oh, done. my gosh. Well done. But obviously, we don't have 61 crazy. available. So no way. if you if you fall in love with these, the, the over a carrot, well over a carrot match pair, then make sure you're checking out. That's the clock over, but yep. it's still on the web and it's still on the app. So if, if there's any available, take it. And we run. think there's about 20 to Amazing. 22 available. But honestly, don't don't take that as gospel because it these are flying. Yvonne, oh, gosh, loads of you there. I don't, which one is it? I'm not sure I've got this next one. 
Uh, it's another matched pair. Is uh, it? Yeah. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Okay. We've got 100 quantity of these ones too. Oh, nice, yes. Okay, then I don't even, I'm just gonna tell you I'm gonna go to the lowest price of the show on this. Again, <sighs> gonna go even lower than we've just been. So I'm letting you know that again, I'll give you uh, a 30 second clock to graphics. Where well, you're still Good coming grief. through on the previous piece. Yeah, great size for um, stud earrings, I think. An accent stone, uh, two accent stones, and in the middle you could put a, I love the fire opal idea. Yeah. Another opal, yeah, you know, like whatever that might Ethiopian be. Yeah, Ethiopian opal in the center. Yeah. That would be special. Do you know what, as well, because of that color, I'd because uh, of that gorgeous fluorescence, look how much they're fluorescing there. With that gorgeous green fluorescence, I might go for like a chrysoprase in the middle oh, or something wow, like yeah. that. That would be nice. Okay, but graphics we've, alive. We've got loads and loads and loads of mounts. So you're gonna go to the lowest mounts. price you've seen. I'm committing to that right now. So let's start at 49 again. Let's just Brilliant. put that on your screen. There you go. Good luck. Oh, wow. Yeah, we've got loads of semi-mounts available on our website, which are, uh, which are six by fours. Yeah, look, you can do a ring with this one here. 9.99 for a tenner. 9.99 for a sterling silver ring mount. You can put one of those in there. That's wow. just incredible. I mean, that, I, I had no idea because I never do the mounts here and the thing, but yeah. I cannot believe they're For a sterling they're silver so ring cheap. mount. This is ridiculous. Yeah, four ninety nine for a, a, a Gosh, pendant mount. Four seventy nine for a rose gold plated silver six by four millimeter ring. Wow. Six ninety nine, four ninety nine, ten ninety nine. Yeah. Thirty second <laughs> clock, and I'm going to go again. Goodness me. Good luck. Remember, we've got a hundred of these, but it's going to be the lowest price you've seen so far. New low price on these. Okay, right, here we go. Lots of you there. Goodness me, oh gosh. There's gonna be a lot of web traffic now. People are going to get the semi-mounts as well. Gosh, look at the amount of multi yeah, it's twos, threes, fours, fives. I think that's just the way we should be doing this. Um, like I said, 29.99 straight away. The first, okay, so the first four people, one, two, three, no, first five people bought 15 packs between them. Over 10%. That's 10% of the stock, gone, boom, to five people. That tells you, that tells you, sorry, 15% of the stock, gone. That literally tells you everything you need to know about the popularity of these and how much people really, sure. really want them. Okay, let's do a, a 30 second clock, your final deal's coming in, I'm not even gonna hang around. Gonna go to the final deal, which is gonna be the lowest price you've seen. 100 of these available, or were available, sorry. Um, we, we lost about 20 already, and we look like we're just about to lose a lot more. This is gonna be an added to your order deal. So, I, I'd expect, I, I mean, you've got 15 seconds. I'd like to see you all on the front lines right now, but I don't even think you have time. 10 seconds before we go to the new lowest deal. Where's he gonna go? I don't even know. Oh, gosh. So. 15 quid, 14.99. Let's just do it. I've, I've backed myself into the corner. I said we're going to go to the lowest price of the whole show. There you yeah. go. Why can not you have said 17.99 or True. something? Or True. Uh, maybe I should have. Or 19.91. Yes. That would have been better. You don't do things like that, though, do no, you? No. Look, we, we always you know, want you to trust us, have the confidence to get on the phone lines, 100 opportunities, rock bottom prices. Love and that. Um, you know, you, you've been with us for, for this incredible showcase. We want you to be able to get these pieces too. And do you know what, it, it, you know, the, we can all bring gemstones to air. Before, you know, we bought gemstones to air before, which are incredibly rare yeah. and they're kind of out of everybody's price bracket. And, you know, that's, you know, that's, that's unfortunately something which, which, which you'd expect to happen sometimes. Yeah. But isn't it wonderful to be able to bring you something so rare, so unknown um, and, and, and at such an affordable price point? Just incredible. Yeah, giving, genuinely giving you the best access. Love that, absolutely love that. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done, everybody. So there you go. Um, Jane, what a great idea. She's been collecting different special six by four gems over however long you've been you're tuned in and you're gonna eventually make an incredible tennis bracelet. I'm so excited to see the finished results of that. That's gonna be amazing. That's gonna be so special, Jane. Thank you so much for that. And it's, you know, by way of us thanking you, you know, let's, um, you know, thank you so much for your continued support. You know, it's even more poignant as we head towards our 13th birthday. Oh, wow. And it's just so wonderful to be able to bring you, um, so just so wonderful to be able to bring you 
um, uh, gems like this, which are so rare, so unusual and so affordable. Absolutely. Well done, everybody. Go, go, go. Okay. 14 99 Amazing. We'll do a minute clock to close this one out. Um, again, we're struggling to keep up with the phone lines. Yeah. There's a lot of you there, so we'll give you a minute on the live deal, but it will be, if there's anything available, it'll be available on our web and our app. But I would, I would really, really like to say to you, if you can, I'd do this deal right now. I'd get it over the line right now because there's no guarantee it'll be available on the web and the app. Yeah, that's incredible. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Well done, everybody. Don't let this pass you by. This is something which, you know, to be able to bring you another showcase of this, you know, good luck. I, 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 I just can't see how that's ever going to happen. You know, such rarity. To be able to bring you quantities, which are, you know, quantities of 40, quantities of 50. You know, this is not something that we can bring you kind of huge, huge, huge amounts of. Well done, Carola, Yvonne, Jackie, Fiona, Carol, Susan, Barbara's got two, Margaret's got two. Well done, loads and loads and loads of you coming through. This is so good. And again, calibrated, ready to set into those semi-mounts. Comes to you in this beautiful little presentation box as well, which I, I love these little boxes, they're so cute. Gosh, that looks so good. Looks so good. Well done, everybody. Okay, we're going to leave that one on our web and our app if there's any available. We think there's about 20 left. Uh, we are going to move into the ultra rare Pareva Quartz now. Before we do that, we'll, we'll obviously go to a little break to let the phone lines clear because we've yeah. talked and talked about the lag and how busy it is. It's going to get a whole lot busier. Um, if you want to keep up to date with my social media, um, it's David Harry Jules, and uh, I'll show you how to do that. But when we come back, you have to see this Pareva Quartz. Good luck. Okay, well, this is it. Uh, a few opportunities now for something really, truly exquisite. We are, of course, talking about what, what they call Pareba Quartz. Um, and I don't want you to confuse this for other more readily available kind of what, what they call Pareba Quartz in Brazil. There's always a tendency with anything blue that forms in quartz to just refer to it as Pareba Quartz. Um, you can see here, uh, this is Dermatite Quartz, which you, you can, you can oh, get. Yeah. It's a little bit more available. And the, 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 the gemstone dealer essentially that we bought this from was keen to say this is not to be confused for other Brazilian Pareba quartzes like Dermatite quartz. These are much more abundant. He's on about the Dermatite and re relatively inexpensive. Now, what we're talking about is this. Oh. So this is the material that we're talking about right now. We had it certified, as I said. At the bottom there, it says blue color in this specimen is caused by lazulite inclusions, which is extraordinarily rare. And this takes it into a whole new realm. So I want you to understand, we bought this as standard Pareba Quartz, which would be Dermatite, which would be the reason you're going to get some incredible deals right now. Absolutely phenomenal deals. It's not treated at all. And when we had it certified, it came back as something that is far rarer and far more expensive. Usually when, when lazulite forms in Ooh. quartz in Brazil, 
um, and only in these specimens are extremely rare. When it's milky or opaque quartz like this, they will literally cut the lazulite from it. Those little tiny chips, right? They'll cut it from it um, because even one point of bright blue is extremely valuable. The yeah. best gems are the transparent specimens or the pieces that are fully color without the milkiness, without the white. Yeah. Parlor International has oh, one such wow. gem. And these guys, are, this is Bill Larson. These guys have a library of the finest gemstones in That's the amazing. world. And th they did a whole feature on it. They have one gem in their collection. They say this month we feature a blue lazulite from Brazil. Um, and they, even though that forms in quartz, because lazulite is quite soft, and when it forms in quartz, it's like, um, it's like a, a gem silica lazulite. Okay, so it's the best, best grade because it has the hardness then of quartz. Oh, So fantastic. that's the beauty of it. It's like strawberry quartz, but yeah, blue, Yeah, it? absolutely. Beautiful. And, and obviously 100% natural like strawberry quartz. Yes. And the way they talk about it is, you know, lazulite is extremely rare in large size faceted gems and usually is only found in small prismatic rough crystals associated with quartz veins and quartzite. This five carat piercing blue gem is reminiscent oh. of Hein, which is one of the rarest gemstones on the planet. Like I think there's only three stones that have crystallized oh that exist. God. Um, wow. Or a dark cobalt blue spinel. That's the bracket they put it in. Cobalt blue spinel is $20,000 a carat. Wayne doesn't even have a price. It's just, it is priceless. Um, and then they say it exhibits dramatic color with good translucency, as does ours. I saw you had the phone light on ours, uh, Carol, yes. a moment ago. And they call it a, a collector's stone, but the color will draw any curious eye for a closer look. A fine gem to add to your database of rare and exceptional min good. minerals found on our geologically diverse planet. That's the reality, and this is what I was talking about. Oh, wow. Uh, you remember they cut them from the milky quartz? Yes. And here you've got a natural lazulite. It's two, two points. It's two, two points. points. Yes. Yeah. 0 0.02. There's two points, and it's 92 pounds, so it's 100 pounds for like two points. The same gem from Brazil, incredible which makes it 4,600 so, pounds per carat. Pounds, so, not dollars. So just, so, so just to make it clear, point-wise, there are 100 points in a carat. carat. Yeah. That's how, points. that's the size we're talking. That's not 20 points, points not oh. almost a quarter of a carat. No, like 10% of that. And that's wow. 92 pounds, and, and which means that when you start to get, you know, to, to a carat, when you get to a carat, it's about five grand a carat, 4,600 pounds a carat. Me. This is why I don't want you to confuse it with lazurite, which sounds very similar, or dermatite, which can be found more abundantly, with quartz as well, in the same areas, in Bahia, in Brazil. This is certified as lazulite quartz. And I'm telling you, I didn't buy it as lazulite quartz, because it had, had that been discussed, we wouldn't have been able to afford it. Mm. We, we bought it as dermatite quartz in, in good faith. They called it, you know, just standard Paraba quartz is what dermatite uh, quartz is known as. And then we went and got it certified. With every gemstone, we do that. Even if we have the longest relationship with the vendor, we always have everything certified. And it came back as probably the holy grail from Brazil. You know, like I said, Parler International puts this material, when, when it's in quartz like this, when it has that crystallization in the same bracket as Huayin and cobalt blue spinel. And we've got some very exquisite opportunities for you today. And we are, I could just inflate the price. I could say we bought this as lazulite quartz. That would be in our best interest and, and maybe make them much smaller quantities. We're not. I'm just going to give it to you at the same kind of crazy closeout deals that we, we got. And I'm going to say just be as fast as you can. Let's start with the rounds. So you've got that exquisite blue. You've got it forming within the body of quartz. So it takes on the hardness oh and, and, and the, the performance of quartz. This is as good as it gets. Yeah, Paraba quartz. No, this is far rarer than Paraba. This is exceptional. You can see that translucency in the studio. Oh, it's beautiful. So it's rarer beautiful than, than your Paraba even from the same country. That is lazulite forming within quartz. And in this instance, it goes perfectly blue. It's obviously 100% natural. It shows you the gem certificate. I'll give you 30 seconds for you to jump on the phone lines to get this piece. Um, the, the translucency you're getting here oh. is, um, you can see those kind of moments. Yeah. Um, those faceted stones on Parler, Parler Gems are, are just, uh, they are but exquisite. They're, they're, you know, but you have even more lazulite in your quartz. Yeah, you really are. So you've got way more. There's, 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 there's like a sprinkling there. Here you can see that crystallization. Isn't that stunning? Of lazulite. You see that? Yeah. You get, it's it's like a it. grain. Almost. Yeah, of course. It's beautiful. This is exceptional, guys. Um, oh, wow. That's so good. 
right? 35 carats. 35 the ultimate. Carats. The ultimate. And I'm telling you, you're not even paying, you're not going to pay the market price for this material today because I didn't. I didn't pay it. So you've got this graduated incredible oh strength. God. How many do we have, Neri? A hundred. Right, I'm going to do something crazy. This, You've these... seen the certificate. It's the ultra rare lazy light forming in the quartz. And I, I'll just tell you right now, I'm going double figures. Uh, for oh for a gem gosh. that should be, for, in a strand particularly, had, had I even entertained the idea of buying lazy light forming in quartz, which is unbelievably rare. This is one of those moments in time. We'd be at four, five figures for something like this, quite possibly. Certainly into the hundreds. And now I'm going to tell you I'm going double figures on this. And I've Look, got we've got, we've got, um, the uh, 35 carats across 13 stones. Mm -hmm. So these gemstones are averaging over two carats yeah. a piece. Yes. We talked about 20 points. No, two points. Sorry, I beg your pardon. Two points. At, at 100 pound, 92 pound. At 92 pounds. Which, which makes it, you know, like I said, this is how rare this material wow. is. You know, they, they're very keen to say, it's do amazing. not confuse this for lazurite, azurite, any other blue gem. I love that. I absolutely love that. The, the, the translucency yeah. so is I'm, just amazing. I'm just going to put a price on your screen straight away. £99. And okay. then I'm going to let you know I'm nowhere near done. Like, I'm nowhere wow. near done. And, I, and we should be done many, many times above that. It is a magnificent mm -hmm. gemstone. So rare. Such a beautiful shade of blue. Such a gorgeous colour. It is that Paraba blue that right, let's give you Let's here. give you a 30-second clock. My I'm going to go far lower, guys. Far, far lower. Look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? You can see those grains of that grain like quality almost. It's just, it's just oh, electric, isn't it? Loving that translucency, absolutely loving it. Okay. We've got five seconds and we're dropping that price point. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely amazing. Loving this cut, loving this gorgeous neck. Yeah, who's ready for a crazy closeout? Yeah. Got this as, as Dumatite Quartz or a standard Praber Quartz. Oh. You're about to get Lazulite Quartz. Half the price. Be as fast as you can. We had 100. We're not going to have 100 now. 49.99. Should never happen. I promised it in double figures. I'm right now at 49.99. Dawn, Maker, Valerie, Multibuy, and Janice. Loads We've got Multibuyers in the West Midlands. We've got Dorset there. It is busy. We are struggling with the, with the phone lines today. Yeah. Be as quick as you possibly can. Lazulite forming within quartz. 100% natural from Brazil. Oh, wow. And I'm far lower than we should ever, ever be. Well done. The amount of multiples we've got in baskets. Maker, you've got three in your basket. Janice, you've got two in your basket. Uh, Dorset, Mary. Oh, my gosh. Well done. Maker in the West Midlands, you've got two in your basket as well. Check out as soon as you can. That is absolutely beautiful. It's like, um, uh, you know, the, uh, I, I don't know what to compare it to. There's nothing else out there You know, natural. you heard them comparing it to a Huayne, which is ultra rare, and, you know, blue spinel, natural blue spinel. Yes. And that's the kind of bracket that this exists in. That's oh, why it's wow. absolutely mesmerising that we have it, even have it for you today. But, and we have 100 opportunities. Well done to Lida. Well done to Dawn. Well done. Uh, Dawn's just taken two. Alison, Susan, well done to you as well. Somerset's got two, well done to you. London, Cambridgeshire, West Midlands, Dorset, well done. Absolutely gorgeous. Isn't that just beautiful? Well done. Again, I think this, I think this really works with the silver, Monica. I don't know what you think, but I think with the silver, it's just... It's just... It really does. I mean, it's such a beautiful blue. It's, it's, uh, it's almost like an blue. Like it, is a, it is like an angelite -like blue. It is, yeah. It's like an angelite -like blue, but it's got translucency. Right, I'm just, I'm, I'm prepared to do something absolutely wild right now. I'm going to go even lower. For, for anyone who wants to join in, we're going to do it. Right. But when, once we see this price, I'm going to let you know now. I'm only giving you like a minute to get it. So I'll give you a minute right now before I call the price to give you that warning. Then I'm going to go ridiculously low and we'll give a minute clock to close out. I've got 100 of them, ultra rare, unbelievable colour. 
be as fast as you can. In 50 seconds, I'm going to take a massive hit on this. Oh, my gosh. Amazing. Absolutely tremendous. And, you know, you think about, you think ahead to all those gorgeous uh, kind of craft fairs you're going to be doing, or maybe the Etsy shop, which you're looking to stock up. No one else out there is going to have a gemstone like this. You no. know, this is... Oh, that's a great uh, idea we'll from Dawn. Oh, says Dawn. Oh, yes. I'm, I'm, guys, I'm taking a massive whack off this price. Oh. There's a lot of multi-buyers already. This is not Dermatite Quartz. This is not Azurite. This is Lazulite Quartz, which is extremely rare. You can do your own research. You saw Parler International talking about it, comparing it to some of the rarest blue gemstones on the planet. Mm. And in 15 seconds, I'm about to do a price so, so ridiculous that I'm only going to give you a minute to check it out. Oh, my gosh. Go, 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 go. Well done, everybody. I love that graduated look. It's so nice, isn't it? Gorgeous jewelry, beautiful pieces. Here we go, everyone. Well done. Right, you ready, Neary? $29.99. And when we see this price, you're going to have a minute clock to close this out. So be as fast as you can. $29.99 for a gem, which it could be its first and only time yeah, it will on be. Jewelry Maker. At that um, price, it's going to go. Yeah. Um, there you go, $29.99. There's your minute clock. Go. We're going to give you a minute right now to check this out. It's a live deal. This one time only launching the legendary Pareba Quartz to you, or the Lazulite Quartz. Linda, Carol, Carola, we've got yeah, Maker, we've well got done. Mary, we've got multi buyers getting threes and fours. This is insane. 44 seconds. Do not miss this opportunity is all I can stress. Loving the look of this as well. Just over there, we've got a beautiful uh, Branca white onyx as well. I think that would look absolutely gorgeous with oh, that. I do too. Well done. Looks like a blue That's what you Yes, said, Carol. absolutely stellar. It really, really does, doesn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Well done. Loads of people there. It's taking a while for our screen to catch up, but huge congratulations to everyone coming through to get that. That is absolutely amazing. Do not well miss done. it. 18 seconds, and we're going to remove this deal. We're going to take it off. We've got um, this one-time opportunity for you today on this legacy, legacy, um, as you like quartz. Gorgeous. Well done. Absolutely amazing. Five seconds. We're taking the details away. Uh, gorgeous. Uh, just absolutely amazing. Seen. Well done. Oh, look, there we go. It's caught up now. Okay. Gee whiz. So, uh, we have, I think, 20 or, or 30 of these remaining. We yeah, have that's 100. It. Make sure you're checking this out. Make sure you're multi-buying at this deal particularly. Um, Heidi in Arizona. I met you, Heidi, when I was over in oh. Tucson. It's lovely to see you on the phone lines. Good luck. There she is. There she is. Well done, everyone. Well, I have some rondelles coming up for you now. Oh, Same this. material, Laszlo Quartz. I'm just going to let you know I have half the quantity available. This is the ridiculous. depth of colour here. I want to draw you to just look at this one here oh yeah look at this gemstone i mean they're all wonderful but this one here really drew me in sorry darling yeah there we go look at hang on i need i need to get it behind it look at this oh, oh i see it you see it i did then Woo there you go isn't yeah. that just stunning half the quantity of this one i'll give you a 30 second clock before we open the graphic wow look at the depth of color <gasps> Proper French blues in there. You've got the most incredible tones. Oh, wow. It's like a shabby chic kind of uh, antique furniture blue, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. It's slightly kind of, um, more, it's much more sleepy than your angel. I just love, I love this tone. It's beautiful. And in this particular strand, you've got such a variety of tone. The, yeah. the strand of rounds that we did, it's fairly consistent all the way through. This has got such lovely variety. I tell you what, Aquamarine's got absolutely nothing on this, has it? This is absolutely amazing. All right, all, all I'm going to say to any one of you right now is good luck. Phone lines are open, half the quantity Best available. Bet. You know we're going to do something crazy. We're up at 35 carats. It is the Pareba quartz, it's the Lazulite quartz, it's the translucent material, it's the deeper colours, deeper saturation, colour being king. We should be doing a crazy deal right now. Do you know what I'm going to start, Neri? I'm going to start at 49.99. Amazing. And I'm going lower. So good oh. luck. Um, like I said, we are extremely, extremely limited today. Yeah, very, very limited. Half the quantity that we bought you uh, in the last opportunity. So just best of luck. Get involved as soon as you can because we are having technical issues today. Uh, Valerie straight in and just bought two. That's so good to see. Well done, lovely. Caroline in Greater Manchester who loves her jade. Maybe she's going to be putting it with the jade. I mean, this mm. is great with, yeah, the Olmec, but yeah, absolutely beautiful. Or even with like the mutton fat, like the white and the, yes. blue, uh, the, white nice. and the, uh, the blue. Like that juxtaposition, I think, would be phenomenal. Remember, it usually forms in a white crystal quartz. Yeah, nice idea. Tracy, Dawn, Maker, Susan. Right, 30 second clock and we'll go again. 
you trust us. I know you do. You're on the phone lines. There's a lot of you on there. We, we are struggling to keep up. A lot of you are multi-buying. Linda, Dawn, Tracy, Alison, Valerie, Caroline, Julie, Susan, Beryl, Fiona, Tracy. Good luck. 20 seconds. Gorgeous, absolutely brilliant. Unlike any other blue gemstone out there. And just, you know, blue is the world's most popular color. Mm -hmm. You know, whatever shade it is, whatever depth it is, uh, it is it is the world's most popular color. Um, and it's and it's so unusual the way that blue is, is created. It's not really a color, is it? It's no. a mix of different absolutely. kind of tones, isn't it? This is such a wonderful quality. Right, thinking. let's do it, 29.99. Even though you've got that deep, deep color, even though you've Amazing. got the translucency that Carol showed you with the light yes. passing through it, best of luck to you. Gorgeous. Well done. This is Flying Beryl, Julie, Lida, well done to you, Dawn. Oh, absolutely fantastic. Yeah, totally unique. If somebody showed me this strand, I, I would not be able to guess what it was. No. At a push, I'd say maybe lapis, but, you know, it's not, it's not lapis. It's not aquamarine. It's, not, it, it's, it's none of those. It's a colour and a gem in its own right. Yeah. Beautiful quality. June, well done to you. I love people's comparison to this, to Strawberry Quartz. It, for me, it does yeah, it's the blue really version, remind me. Right, we'll give you a minute clock. Well done. We need to check on this. We've gone way too low, and I've only done that because Far I went so low, low on the previous piece. So good luck. There's going low and there's seconds. going low. There's going low with like a strand of, I don't know, smoky quartz. Yeah, something this you is... can get again. Yes. We might be able to get Prairie Quartz again, but it won't be Lazulite. It will be Dermatite. It will be... Do you, you think? Know, yeah, 100%. With this, we never even expected this to be Lazulite. Yeah, of course, yeah. So to get it and to have that certification, good luck. Do you know what? Just quickly, even while the clock's still going, go 24.99. <laughs> Just go crazy. Oh my gosh. This is a first. We've never yep. had this before. <laughs> Whilst the crash. still going. And you're still only going to have 26 seconds to check it out. But I've told you, 24.99. Ollie doesn't know what to do with himself in there. Dropping the price when there's only 20 seconds left before we take the details away. Yeah, remember, it will be available on the web and the app. We've seen a lot of you checking everything out yeah. on there and selling everything out. So well done. Well done. Look at all these people with this in baskets. This is absolutely bonkers. Go, go, go. Well done, everyone. From Alexis to Dawn to Karen to June. Check out your baskets, everybody. That's absolutely brilliant. Mary wants well to. Done. Oh, my gosh. Well done, everybody. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well, that was just brilliant. Crazy. Well done. <laughs> okay. Okay. Right. Right. Wants an incredible master carving of jadeite. Oh, have we got it? Um, we, we, I can get it. We can get this to you. But um, are we going to? Is that what we're going to do now? Yeah. Okay. Type A jadeite, master carving. How many do we have? Because we've been used to the big hundred quantities today. Oh okay. my Sorry. gosh! Yeah. So you got the traditional kind of uh, lucky coin at the very centre. You've got. This is all done by hand, by the way. Oh. This is sensational. Wow. Massive carat weight premium color and it's the double phoenix when they're facing one another oh. remember you don't quite this is usually only found in antiquity because when we go back through the, the different dynasties the, the phoenix as you know is, is called the feng hang and that's because it was a male and female you had the feng and the hang and, and over time it's become just one entity but right now you're witnessing good grief it. yeah floating flower jade eye. good grief look at that Oh, it's a heart shape at the top. Wow. That material is amazing. Yeah, this is extraordinarily rare. And you can see why there's only 40. This, um, I tell you what I love about this as well, Dave, that gorgeous kind of, like the traditional Chinese coins, those, that, that dappled. Yeah, and very difficult to do. And you know how quality. difficult it is to do because we've never seen it in any other of our carvings. No. That, that uniformed, dimpled. unbelievable art of carving. So oh. let's do a 30 second clock and um, bring the graphics in for this. 40 chances. Very unique, beautiful, mottled colours of jadeite. It is 100% natural. It is hand carved with the, the sign of antiquity of the male and the female phoenix. This is so tactile. It, it, it's unbelievable. Um, it's a double sided. I'm always so impressed when our carvings are double sided. It's not something you'd ever expect to get. We had one earlier on and, and Monica and I were talking about it and, and you were shocked that it was double-sided. You know, to apply this level of expertise yeah, to, to one sides. side is one thing. To do it to the other side is just... It, nearly 100 carats. And, and everything here just drives the value up. Of course it does. You know, the, the, the value of the material, that, the unique uh, mottling of the type A jade, yes. the, the veins of colour running through it, the high degree of polish, the translucency, 
the, the auspicious meaning behind the, 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 the wonderful peacocks. Everything about this drives up the value and we have 40 opportunities only. It's absolutely beautiful. We were talking about the Phoenix yesterday on the show and the kind of uh, how auspicious it is and what it's connected to. It's connected to kind of um, eternity, immortality. Um, and it's not just in the Eastern world, you know, all over the world, you know, the Phoenix represents different things for people, you know, the, the dragon on earth. Absolutely. Um, it's absolutely, this is such a different carving. So we, we did uh, a, a double-sided peacock carving Phoenix on our sister carving. channel, uh, Phoenix carving on our sister channel. Mm. And I'm going to tell you the price that we went to. It's 2 dollars Great price. And, yeah, absolutely amazing. And over 200 sold out. It's oh, brilliant. And you have the opportunity right now to get a double-sided. It's a different carving. Mm. It's a slightly different carat weight of a double-sided Taipei Jadeite Phoenix Master Carving. Gorgeous. And we're going to do an even better deal. So let's go to that deal first of all. Let's go to the deal that, you know, we have sold this material at. Um, mm. 299. 299 is that deal. And by the way, there's not 200 of these. There's 40. There's 40. Well, there was 40. There's not anymore. Amazing. Have a look at this. Okay. And now, uh, Ollie, we've got your interest free split payments as well. Yeah. I'm going to take hundreds off the price. So I'm going to give Beautiful. you a 30 second clock. Wildest deal you've seen all morning. Type A Jadeite. You know, we're talking 85 carats. The double peacock carving, translucent, in a very rare form of jadeite with the veining of color. A unique high degree of polish as well. Double side carving. Gorgeous quality. So many rooms as well. So many kind of apertures to be able to attach your jump rings to, your thread, your cord, whatever it might be. This is just gorgeous. I can imagine people just using this, in, you know, popping this in box frames though. It's got such a lovely, I think such so. a lovely piece as such a lovely kind of feel to it, such a lovely theme going through it. Neri, as, uh, as my final deal with you today, and oh we're going to give you some more incredible master carvings to do incredible deals with, I'm going to just do something special. I want to see all 40 of you make the most out of this incredible deal. So, what, you know, we could take 50 pounds off, go 249, and it'd be incredible. But I said hundreds is coming off and I mean it. So take 200 pounds off the price and be as fast. Oh as my you gosh. You should never be anywhere near that. Nearly 100 carats. And remember when we put the light through it, you saw that unique, you can see it there as, yeah. the, as the camera punches in. You can Absolutely. see that beautiful mottled formation of Jada. It's on split pay as well because it should be higher. There this is. is what we're talking about. Valerie, Janice, Denise, Patricia, well Rita, you're there. Sue, you're there. That is what we're talking about. That the double-sided phoenix. One of the most historic images that... If you're missing out on this, you, we might never, ever see this grade of jade again, this unique, wonderful coloration. That's exactly it. Absolutely. Well done. Uh, we've got, oh gosh, there's so many people. Camilla, we've got Moy, we've got Tina, Valerie. Wow. We've got multi-buyers. We've got uh, Greater London. We've got Greater Manchester. We've, we've got so many of you joining us, and we only had 40 of them, but whilst the opportunity is there, make sure you're checking out. And use your individual split payments. They're interest-free. We've got uh, less than 20 left. Well done. £33 on individual split payments there. Just gorgeous. Well done. So tactile, so beautiful, so yeah, it is, yeah. unique compared to anything else we've done before. This is just so special. Well done, everybody. 0800 644 655 for 85 carats. I mean, the carat weight. There you go. That's that colour, though, beautiful. as well. So we talked about a new, new type of, of carving that you're seeing here. Um, you're seeing everything together and then that colour as well just drives the value up. I'll give you a minute clock to close this auction out. Yeah, well done. Best of luck for anyone who wants to own it. Um, there's only 11 chances remaining. You know, what's that? That's it. Three quarters of the stock's already gone. Oh, Patricia's got two. That's so nice. So, so lovely. Well done. You can done, do it. Man. You can absolutely do it. Do not think you've missed out. Do not think that you've missed out on this opportunity. Um, even though we have multipliers, even though we've got collectors that have already checked out, there's still nine genuine chances. Yeah. And you can absolutely do it and take it for this incredible deal. We're in double figures and you've got your three split pays. Just be one of the eight that's on the phone lines right now. Gorgeous. Well done. I tell you what, that's been an absolutely brilliant showcase today, bringing so many different gems to air, giving you access to some of the world's rarest gems. Don't forget, half an hour's time, we've got the most amazing masterclass with Monica, the gorgeous Lucite Flowers, which is all about colour, texture, fun, and, uh, and, and just bringing you th these incredible kits at the most amazing prices. Dave, thank you so much no for problem. joining thank us you, today. No problem. Thank you, Carol. And... Um, Thank you to you guys as well for joining us as well. I'll see you again very, very soon. Yes. Do not miss out on the incredible Masterclass of Monica. And I know Carol's still got some unbelievable deals to come your way.
Gorgeous, awesome. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back literally in a couple of seconds with more incredible deals. Well, that was amazing. We've got, I don't, do you know what? Aniri is like a magician sometimes. Because I genuinely don't know where you get these kind of things from. I think he literally keeps them up his sleeve. <laughs> We've got these bad boys coming your way. Totally illegal. What is that? What is that? Yeah, that's what I thought. They, we should not have those. Eight to nine mil round, near round, eight to nine mil near round Akoya pearls. I'm just gonna show them to you because this might be the only time you get to see them because we might actually genuinely have these taken away from us. These are Akoya pearls, oh, Monica. Wow. <laughs> wow. Look at them, oh my goodness. We could literally sell these back into the market for two to three times the price point that we bought them for. Right. We're not even going to do that yet, though. This is such a lovely carving. This is a beautiful bird carving with a frame of bamboo-shaped jade. Oh. Talk about detail. These pieces, these faces, these blanks, these canvases of jade, these big disc canvases, they're no longer being carved anymore. They're no longer, you won't get a cutting house or, you know, the modern, I don't want to call them cutting houses because they're more than that, but, you know, the, the places where these incredible carvings are are created you don't get people studios thank you that's a much better word for it you do, these studios don't create i don't know a hundred of something and let's fingers cross somebody somebody buys it because that's not how it works anymore because of the lack of this material coming out of burma now because of the distinct lack of it coming out of that particular part of the world because you can't get anything out of burma at the minute because of the political unrest there and we can't verify, as it stands at the minute, this doesn't apply to anything that we bought before like this, but we can't verify at the minute if we were to buy gemstones from Burma, which would be incredibly unethical, we wouldn't be able to prove the traceability, okay? But here, 
you are getting a material which is no longer being cut um, and hopefully people will buy it. It's literally cut to order. We will go in and look at the canvases and say, right, we want 100 canvases and we want a bird with a bamboo frame. We want the bird sitting on a branch. We want flowers, we want branches, we want leaves, we want all the foliage and we want the frame to be bamboo shaped. I mean, this is, this is just incredible. And again, it's that floating flower quality. Can you see that? See the darker areas you've got here, the gorgeous powder greens up here. Start price. Have a look at this. Now, we, we quite often get into the situation where we start talking about, should these have carrot weights? Should we be advertising the fact that it's 90 carats? When you go to an art gallery, does it advertise the milliliters of paint that is used? <laughs> does it advertise the uh, how much pencil has been used? Does it advertise the thickness of the canvas? No, of course it doesn't, because it doesn't matter, because it's not about, it's not about how much of the material, it's about the art, it's about the art, it's about the piece, it's about the artist's impression, it's about the artist transferring their skills onto the canvas. That's what we should be focusing on. So 90 carats, yeah, I don't care about that. And I'm all for us stopping to advertise the carrot weight of these kind of pieces. I think it just, it, it doesn't do us any favors. It's distracting. What we should be focusing on is the fact that this is double-sided again. <laughs> it's literally a bird in a forest. A bird in a forest. Believe you or not, I've tried to draw a bird on paper. It looks awful. My, my kids have got a book called How to Draw Birds and, it's, and it, you can draw everything from a robin to a blue tit to a peacock, you know, whatever it might be. Mine look deranged. They just look awful. They look dreadful. To draw it, to sketch it on a piece of paper. To draw it sitting on a branch in a forest, I, 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 wouldn't, I would not want to put myself through that. To carve it into something harder than steel Incredible. We're at 299. We're not done. Monica, you're a very skilled jewellery maker, designer. You'll have a go at pretty much anything out there. Yeah, not drawing. If that's what you're going to ask. <laughs> no, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that to you, lovey. I wouldn't even know where to begin with carving something like this. And I'm reasonably creative. I've got, would you know? No, I mean, you, you must have the most amazing imagination to picture this in your head. Precisely. Uh, you know. And to apply it with such detail and for it to be so recognizable. It's a bird, you've got flowers, you've got branches. My birds look literally like, you know, a toaster. You know, it's just, it's just <laughs> dreadful. One, two, nine. Individual split payments of 32.25. My gosh, that's seriously good. And I always love the carvings that are, that are carved through, like this one and the previous yes. one had it as well, because if you think about it, it must be so much more difficult to carve these because you don't have a solid base totally. to work on. You know, yep. When you carve through, you know, one tiny slip of your hand and you've chopped a bit out of the middle. Absolutely. <laughs> and also, my, my kind of brain doesn't, I, I, I can't work this out either, carving onto a curved surface. Yes. I mean, that, for, that is just impossible. How is this possible? It's incredible, isn't it? And then when the one side is done, then you've got to turn it over. And, and do you've the got, same on the other side. Presumably, you've got the holes there already. Precisely. But then to do the reverse image. <laughs> Boom. Done. One, two, nine. It's a piece of art. Piece of art. As well. Who cares what the carrot weight is? It's well. irrelevant. It doesn't matter. The quality of the material, yes, that does matter. The quality of the carving, yes. It is 90% about the artistry, 10% about the material. It just so happens that this is your floating flower material, which is literally 
some of the finest in the world. We've got makers involved. I've got another maker involved. I've got another maker involved. I've got Bristol involved. £129, individual split payments of 32.25. Congratulations. Well done. Beautiful. Right. Now, a star buy and time for something completely different. What we've got here are some of the most expensive pearls in the world. All of them. All of them. Are you sure you want to start with this strand, Neary? Oh my gosh. Gee whiz, look at that recording. It's like silk. It's like liquid gold, isn't it? <laughs> wow. What is it? What is it that is making this recording so good? Well, obviously, it's just the incredible skill of our production team. But even they're not that good. This is, uh, this is predominantly to do with what you are getting. And it's only by understanding about what you've got that you can even begin to understand why it is so good. Kinga, would I be able to get a black ball, please, lovely? Just to, because it's just gonna be a little bit, I just, I don't wanna put this down flat on the desk. Thanks, love, cheers. Um, these are Akoya pearls. What are Akoya pearls? Akoya pearls are the very first freshwater pearl that was cultured and by cultured it means farmed it means grown before pearls were cultured by mikimoto pearls uh, people used to literally swim hold the breath <gasps> look on the seabed see an oyster dive down a lot of them would die in the process you know if they got the bends um which is when you get kind of oxygen is it when you get oxygen bubbles in your blood or whatever it is you come up too quickly whatever it is you get the bends and you dive down for an oyster you pick the oyster up you bring it back to the surface and you open it up and fingers crossed there's a pearl mikimoto revolutionized pearls because what he thought was, I'm going to culture pearls. So I'm going to collect these oysters, these uh, pink, uh, pink tata fucatas, which are these tiny little oysters about the size of a, of a makeup compact. They're tiny. They're one of the world's smallest pearl bearing oysters. And I'm going to keep them in, in beautiful conditions in Japan. There's only three locations, I believe, in Japan where you can actually get genuine Akoyas from and I'm going to farm them I'm going to grow them I'm going to look after the oysters and what I'm going to do is I'm going to introduce a little piece of irritant it can be a piece of tissue um, as in mollusk tissue it could be uh, a little bead nucleus I'm going to introduce it into the tiny little oyster and then over the course of years a pearl will develop now freshwater pearls on the whole what happens with them is they're much larger oysters They'll be about this size, about the size of your hand. And inside that oyster, it's gently open like that, gently kind of teased open like that. And then you get irritants put in there. And then the oyster is gently closed again. And when you open the oyster up after however many years, uh, you'll get 20 to 30 pearls in there. You get loads, loads and loads and loads. So the oyster is busily working on 20 to 30 different pearls. With the Akoya pearl, with the, with the pink tata fucata, it's one pearl per oyster. So all of its energy is put into one pearl. What that means is the result you get, the actual molecular structure of an Akoya pearl 
is tighter, it's more rigid, it's higher quality. And that results in a better looking pearl. It results in the finest luster of any pearl in the world. These are famous for, these are famous for having a mirror shine. And that is what is making that strand look so good. Yes, the decent uh, kind of golden tone that you're getting there, the beautiful golden hue, that's wonderful. That buttermilk color, that's gorgeous. But it's the luster that really separates this from any other pearl. And I include in that South Sea pearls, metallic pearls, nucleated pearls, flame ball pearls, any other pearl. I, I literally, these, this is the best luster you are ever going to get from a pearl ever. The Akoya pearl is head and shoulders above everything. Now, there is another thing about this particular strand which is very, very special, and it's the size of these Akoyas. Akoya pearls, because they um, come from the Pink Tada Fucata, which is pretty much the world's smallest pearl bearing oyster, Akoya pearls grow to the size of about six mil, maybe, occasionally seven mil. These are eight to nine. They are giants. They are gigantic Akoya pearls. Now, of course, the danger and the worry is, is when you're growing an Akoya pearl, when you're culturing an Akoya pearl, if you don't get to the mollusk in time, what will happen is the mollusk will just eject the pearl, lost forever. You'll never see it again. They'll eject it. So knowing, getting that timing right, getting to the mollusk just when it's literally at the very limit of the size of the pearl it's ever going to grow before it ejects the pearl. These are the finest freshwater pearls you will ever own. Akoya pearls are the best. Now, unfortunately, over the last few years, there's been a mystery virus which has attacked lots of the Akoya spratlings, uh, which are the little tiny little, I mean, they look nothing like oysters really, other than the fact that they kind of look a little bit like a shell. Death of the Akoya, uh, in Japan and what it means for you. So they, um, uh, of all the Akoya pearl farmers, um, they were all sent this questionnaire about, I can't remember what the percentage was who actually replied to the questionnaire, but it literally translates as millions of Akoyas have been lost. Now, because Akoya pearls, because the Akoya pearl gene pool is so narrow, because you can only really get it from three main locations in Japan, what that means is there will come a point where if this mystery virus keeps on going and going and going and going and going, any Akoya pearls which are left will become more and more and more and more and more and more valuable. And it will mean there are less about. Could it mean the end of Akoya pearls? I really hope not. I really hope not. But the gene pool is so narrow with your freshwater pearls to get your nucleated pearls, your metallic pearls, your Edison pearls. They're crossbred with all sorts of different oysters. And that's great because it gives you a really wonderful hybrid pearl, gives you a very strong gene pool. But because this is so narrow, it means that these are becoming rarer and more valuable. And 999 is not your price. Now, I genuinely could not believe this when we bought this to air about a month ago. The next price you're going to see is going to be your final price. And I can guarantee you, we cannot buy this strand of Akoya pearls back for the price point we're going to today. We cannot buy it back at the price point that we're, that we're giving this to you for today. Wow. £249. We could send this, we could sell this back into the industry for double, triple the price point where we are today. Two, four, nine is your deal. On the strand, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46. I think there's 45, 46 on the strand. 45, 46. Five pounds fifty a pearl. Wow. Five pounds fifty for an eight to nine millicoya pearl. Nowhere in the world is going to offer you that. Nowhere in the world. Please, 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 for everyone who comes through to get this, please, can you promise me something? Please promise me you'll get your authenticity certificate. 
Without your authenticity certificate, this is a strand of freshwater pearls. With your authenticity certificate, this is a strand of genuine Akoya pearls, not Akoya style pearls or Akoya flavored pearls. These are genuine Akoya pearls from Japan. You have to get this, Alexis, Sharon, Maker. You've got two in your basket. This is gonna sell out today. We only literally started with a couple of opportunities. 11 pounds for a pair of Akoya pearl earrings. You go to Mikimoto, see if you can find a pair of um, 11 pound um, uh, um, uh, Akoya pearl earrings. Oh, nine in baskets, did you say? How, how many do we have available, Libby? Six chances remaining. We've got 11 in baskets for the final six. Oh my gosh, congratulations. Well done, everybody. That is your deal today. Five chances remaining, well done. We're looking at about five pounds 50 a pearl. And when you consider Akoya pearls are the finest, are the finest freshwater pearls in the world, fact. You've got here such rarity, such beauty, and your Akoyas, um, your Akoya pearls, normally the, the maximum size you'll get is about seven mil. These are eight to nine. This is from not Mikimoto's website, but it's from a website called 150 Years of Wallace Allen. Uh, they're Mikimoto earrings, uh, yellow gold classic, seven and a half by eight mil earrings, uh, 1,200 quid. Well, the pearls you've got here, if you take two of them, that's 11 pounds. So you could sell them for 100 times the price that they are today. Absolutely. Baskets, Patricia, Rene, Deborah, Maker, Alexis, Sharon. Maker, you've got three in your basket. Check out. Sorrel's got two. Pauline Maker, Maker and Lancashire's got two. Well done to you. Valerie and Somerset, well done. Absolutely amazing. Just incredible. It's like silk. It's like satin. I hope we've addressed why these are so good. What is it that makes them so good? It's the fact that they're Akoyas. That little beautiful little oyster has only got one pearl to concentrate on. Amazing deals. They've said there's... A, uh, the luster is amazing. Yeah, it, it's crystal clear. It, it's um, it's um, mirror shine. That's what it's described as. It, it, there's no other pearl in the world that gives you this. Even South Seas, even Cortez pearls don't give you this mirror shine. This mirror shine is is unique to your Akoya because it's one pearl per oyster. It's a tiny little oyster who's literally working its oysters off uh, to give you this kind of quality. Five pounds 50 a pearl. You're not gonna get better than that. And even for freshwater culture pearls, but please, please, for the love of gemstones, spend the extra 25 pence and get your authenticity certificate. Because it will say, Akoya pearls from Japan. Anything else, if they're from China, they're not Akoyas. They can only come from Japan. There'll be Akoya style, maybe. Genuine Akoya pearls are only grown in Japan. That is it. Fact. Soraya, well unto you. Judith, Patricia, loads in baskets. Absolutely ridiculous. Well done. 0800 644 655. Amazing. Finest strand ever, that is, of Akoyas. Largest strand ever. I've got a slightly smaller strand. Now, this is much more of your classic Akoya strand. It's got more of a classic colour to it. So, a lot of the pearls that the Queen used to wear were Akoyas. Uh, if you look at the golden era of Hollywood with the screen sirens and their beautiful black and white headshots, and they wore pearls, very soft focus, they'd have been Akoyas as well. Uh, and, that's, and that's particularly because they were the first pearls to be cultured. So you're thinking about the kind of silent movies, we're talking 1920s. These are the kind of pearls that would have been, that would have been um, Akoyas. Faux pearls were around then, um, but real genuine pearls probably would have been Akoyas. They were the very first pearls to be, um, to be cultured. These, those pearls there were a, a surprise for everyone. They were big, they were golden. These are classic. These are the kind of pearls that you see in a jeweler's window for thousands of pounds. 
Note again that mirror shine, that mirror luster. These ones are smaller. I'd go as far to say though that they are rounder. My gosh. We can't really say perfect round. We can't say perfect round. I want to say perfect round, near round. Okay, I'm gonna take a, hang on, I've got a pen, I've got a pen here. These are, I've just tried to draw a circle. I, I literally, I, I'm just, I'm literally having to, to carve this in. I can't believe I've drawn twice today. I should be on Hobby Maker, shouldn't I? <laughs> Hang on. Is that, is that a perfect round? Is that a perfect round? It's a near round, isn't it? Don't shake your head, Michael. <laughs> okay. Is that a perfect round? It's a near round, yeah? It's a near round. Perfect. No, that's a near round. Oh, gosh. Hang on. No, that's a near round. Right. The point I'm trying to make is this, these are perfect rounds. I, I hate saying myself, I hate, I hate, I really hate myself for saying it. And I, and I'm actually, contractually, I don't think I can say that these are perfect rounds, but. It's as close as you're going to get. Are these perfect rounds that I've drawn here? No. Wow. Are these rounder? Are these closer to rounds? Absolutely. Yes. Okay. We're all educated human beings. I think I will just leave it to you to decide whether they're perfect rounds or not. We all know what a circle looks I mean, like. I mean, I don't know. Is there some kind of tool that they use to decide that they're not perfect rounds? I, um, I imagine all they will do. I mean, we've seen Akoya pearls being sorted before. They literally have a tub of them and yeah. you've got these rows and you use literally use chopsticks just to pick them up, put them down, pick them up, put them down. And if that one doesn't work, they, they take it away. They put it in another pot. These are literally better than any circle I could ever draw. Well, that's what I mean. Because I mean, if you're just looking at them with your, with the naked eye, you, you, you know. It's pretty incredible. Now, it says six to seven mil. Are they graduated? No, not really. I think, I think we are literally splitting hairs here. Don't expect to graduate a strand. That's not what these are. Does that look round? Better. You better. If that isn't round, I don't know what is. Why, am I, why are we laying so much on the fact that rounds, rounds, rounds? Because it's the hardest shape in the world to achieve but it's naturally um, formed by your pink tada fucata, one pearl at a time. Occasionally the oyster will have twins, um, not very often at all. One pearl at a time. I've bought you a koya kind of keshis, unusually shaped koyas before. I've bought you them before. I've bought you these before. Oh, sorry, I bought you uh, kind of the slightly misshapen ones before. But what you've got here is so rare, is so unusual. And I have to say, you know, you are gonna get people going, are those real pearls? Because they look so consistently Beautiful. So consistently beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. <sighs> Less than 30 seconds. We're going down. Enjoy the classic Akoya. The classic, the classic look, the classic pearl, the
the classic everlasting pearl. The pearl I think we never thought we'd ever be able to get. We had South Sea pearls and Tahitian pearls before we had Akoyas. That tells you everything you need to know. We had South Seas and Aco uh, sorry, South Seas and Tahitian before we had Akoya pearls. 199, that's your deal. That's ridiculous, that is just stupid. Split payments of 49.75. I mean, that is obscenely low. I have some shots of pearls from JM. They were described as near rounds. In real life, they're as near, they're as, near as damn it. Exactly. <laughs> they're extremely close. Deborah, I know, honestly, and I know I really am properly, like, laying it on thick with the round kind of thing, but I can't say they're perfect rounds. I'm not allowed to. Maureen Maker, Janet Maker, Maker. Oh, gosh, there's loads. Of, Maker and Lancashire's taken two. Well done. Now, if, if you are into kind of making a bit of money, get this. Not with it. Put a clasp on. Could you sell it for 10 times the amount? Could you sell it for £2,000? Have a go. Have a go. Put it through an auction house. Yeah, I'll count. I'll definitely count how many you're getting here. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14, 16, 18, 20. By the way, this is going to end really embarrassingly for us per price per pearl. 22, 24, 26. I'm not even halfway through yet. 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58. 60 pearls. 331 per Akoya pearl. Three pounds, Soraya, Maureen, Janet, 331. Seven pounds for a pair of earrings. <laughs> seven, seven pounds. pounds Gosh. For a pair of Akoya pearl earrings. What is going on today? What is, go oh, it's gone. Well done. Seven pounds for a pair of rings. I know. Yeah, those for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and ten. Uh, those for 1,230 pounds. They've just made that price up, haven't they? One, two, three, ah, zero. <laughs> Stick a zero on the end. Yeah. <laughs> one more. Uno más, por favor. Right, this is completely different. It's an absolute beauty. Right, ready? <laughs> this is gorgeous. Love, love, love. Oh. <laughs> Look at this. They're just doing their own thing. This is giving... A, do you know what? I love these. I love these non-round ones. Wow. Isn't that lovely? Oh my gosh, look at that. That's one of the most beautiful pearls I've ever seen. Is it perfect round? No, it's not actually. But that is like a lovely, the colour is like a silvery blue, isn't it? Yes, beautiful. Good grief. Oh, and this one, look. Look at that. What is that colour? That, that, that's exactly it, Ollie. Yeah, they've got like auras, halos. Can you see here, there's like pinks, baby pinks coming out of this one. Good grief. Wow. It's a lovely pearl, isn't it? Natural, naturally coloured, I should say. This is quite a fun strand because you can, you can pick out matching pairs and you, yeah. you can graduate this by size or by colour. Or... And I think that when you're picking out your pairs, please don't get too obsessive about finding an exact pair. First of all, you're going to be disappointed because there's no such thing as a perfect pair of pearls. They're, they're, they will have their differences. OK. But secondly, isn't that part of the beauty of pearls? Of course, of that they course, do yeah. have their differences. The word pearl means unique. So these are all unique beauties. <laughs> these two here, pair of earrings, do they match? Uh, yeah, kind of size-wise-ish. Size, um, shape wise, no, not really. Color wise, yeah, ish. Go for it. That looks great. I love these kind of ivory colors, don't you, um, 
Monica. Yes. Oh, there's a there's a dark one in there as well. Oh, there's lots of different tones in there. Yeah, lovely dark ones. Yeah. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, very nice. Good grief, look at that. 499, not your deal. Are these Akoyas? Yep, they're from Japan. They're from one of the three, I think it's three, is it three locations that they come from near Reno? I think it is. Look at this. Isn't that lovely? Oh, gee whiz. Those are three, four matched, five matched pairs. I was one, two, three, four, say, five. Are they, are they kind of matched up? If you fold the strand in half. Do you know, I don't know. I, I, those are those pretty much are. mirror matched. Yeah. Yeah? Oh, gosh, they are. Ah. Oh, my gosh, Monica, you're an absolute ledge. Look at this. Look. They are matched. They are mirror matched. Ah. Pairs, pairs, pairs. Yeah. yeah. Everywhere I see. Yeah. Until you and get a big pendant at big the bottom. Yeah. Oh, gosh, they really are, aren't they? Oh, well. <laughs> Well, that changes things slightly, doesn't it? One seven nine, forty four seventy five is your is your split payment. Taken the time to pick and choose the matching pairs. <laughs> wow, that really is impressive, isn't it? Gosh, that really is impressive. Thank you for pointing that out, Monica. Yeah, that really is impressive. When you pull it like that, you can see that they are all matched yeah. beautifully. One seven nine is your price point today. Well done. Very very different strand, but still a coil, still with that mirror shine, still with that gorgeous quality. My gosh, look at those natural colours. They're beautiful. <gasps> I can't actually decide what my favourite colours are because I love these darker ones with the pinks and the kind of cyans in them. Love those. But then I love these kind of slightly pinky ones. I love these ivory ones. They're all just incredible. 179, well done. Maker wants to check out my lovely. You can have them, but you, you need to check out now. Well done. Gorgeous. Right. After the break, we've got something completely and utterly... Valerie Maker in London, check out, check out, check out. Lucite. Every single time these have been to air, they've broken the phone lines. They <laughs> have, yes. Whether it's with Monica, whether it's with Hannah, they've broken the phone lines, okay? So, facts... Oh, I love that hair comb. I love the colours you've gone for there. I love the earrings next to them as well. Oh! Well, I think it just, well, personally, it just takes me back to why I got into jewellery making because it's so creative and so, and it's Absolutely. fun to do, you know? Yeah, defo. Yeah. Gorgeous, beautiful. Do not go anywhere. Coming up next, Lucite Flowers. This is going to be a fun hour. We've got loads coming up. Don't go anywhere. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. I would love uh, for each of you to be able to join me this weekend for an unprecedented collection. And I don't just mean unprecedented here at Jewelry Maker. Um, after speaking with many of uh, fellow collectors and people who are interested in Jadeite in the Far East, we genuinely believe this might be the first time ever a gallery exhibition like this has ever been offered firsthand in the Western world. Pieces like this do occasionally make their way into the hands of Western collectors, but it will come from 
possibly an auction house in Hong Kong to have the access to a master's studio, to be able to offer his unique artworks to our collectors, that each one has possibly been worked on for six months or longer, is a real privilege for me. And for those of you that are gonna be joining in, I've got some very special news to share with you. I want everyone to have the chance to be able to own something, something like this. I think it's very important. And I'd love for you to come and view these incredible pieces of art with me. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. We are literally, this is, no, this is, uh, honestly, this is, King is gonna hate me for this. <laughs> she didn't have a board big enough, I think. No, she didn't have boards <laughs> big enough. These kits are, Okay. Don't worry. Don't don't you look at me like that. Look at her little face. <laughs> She's gone very pale. Don't worry, King. I'll put them away. No, you're not going to help, Tom. Don't lie. If you're not going to help, then just don't. I will put them away, darling. Don't worry. These are amazing. <laughs> There's lots of giggling. I think Michael's had to go and give King a bit of a talking to, saying, "Right, don't lose it. Don't lose it. Come on, very close to the weekend now. Don't lose it." I love making a mess. Yeah, of course it is, filling over that. Look, this is it. This is the actual kit. I don't know whether we can, Ollie, I don't know whether we can get the old uh, camera to show it, but here we go. <laughs> King's going to Wales tomorrow. She's going camping. She doesn't care. She's makes, fine. Makes you want to make one of those, um, what do they call it? They're wearing Hawaii around the neck. Yeah, like the garlands. Oh, yeah. yes, absolutely. Now, I think that's quite a nice display, actually. I'm not going to count them, no. You can just, you can just forget that, mate. <laughs> right, so minute clock to graphics. Now, uh, we, we, we bought these to wear the other day. So do forgive me showing the same slide again, but I just think that these are so lovely, so useful, so pretty. So whether you're going to make your own um, garlands to put in a pagoda, maybe in your garden, whether you're going to be decorating a bedroom with these, whether you're going to be wrapping them around a four poster bed, whether you're going to be making your own artificial flower buttonholes or bouquets for your wedding, whether you're going to be popping, especially with these ones here, little fairy lights inside these as well, have them poking through, have them as like little festoon lights, whether you're going to be creating your own seasonal wreaths, whether you're going to be embellishing your own buttonholes, whether you're going to be Make it, decorating little hats and fascinators and brooches. Sorry for the kind of rather Easter related things. It was kind of just before Easter that we bought these to wear last time. Um, they are just, uh, artificial flowers are 
wonderful. Silk flowers, my gosh, they're expensive. Oh, yeah. Gee whiz. I'm not trying to say for one second that these are a contender for silk flowers because uh, they've obviously got that kind of waxy kind of finish to them. Uh, but if you want to get that big look, that, that gorgeous kind of colour. But, oh, look, look at that. It's so pretty, Monica. I love it. It is. I think my mom's going to snap all that one. Do you think? Are those her colours? <laughs> her colours, yeah. Really? They're gorgeous. It, I was, I was about to say exactly the same thing, Ollie. When you see all these colours together on this board, it's big, it's beautiful, very colourful. It's fun, isn't it? It's real festival chic and, you know, it, it's, it's just great. But when you start to take these colours and you start to go, ah... Right, I'm just going to do this and I'm going to get maybe some of that. Maybe yeah. yes, maybe yes, maybe no. All of a sudden it becomes a lot more sophisticated. That hair comb that you've made there, in fact, I'll probably take the green, uh, sorry, that and replace that with the green. Yeah, that's a better combination. That's a combination you've gone for, actually, isn't it? Yep. It looks so much more sophisticated. And that hair comb you've made there looks, it's really colourful and really beautiful, but it's really sophisticated it's not it's not it ceases to be kind of fun and frolicky it's just a really lovely high-end hair fascinator I can imagine um brides wearing these as well I mean yes. you've got some gorgeous colors here look you've got these gorgeous delicate pinks or bridesmaids if you're, especially if you have little girl bridesmaids yeah little flower girls how cute would that be that's, that's why I went for the hair the blue, for the hair slide as well because I think yeah. these look really beautiful in the hair as well it can look quite vintage as well yes Look, I've got that there. That, that, this is nice, I think. And you do have the blues there, but that's a really delicate combination. It's not too overpowering. It's really delicate. If you want to go for bright colours, here comes your lime greens. <laughs> you know, here come your reds and your bright pinks and your oranges. If you want to go for that full-on Hawaiian yeah. tropical kind of, yeah, then you can do that as well. Um, but if you want to go for something much more refined, much more delicate, much more um, but that's all the sophisticated and grown up. Yeah. And it looks great together. It now, we've got some photos here. Whose are all these, all, um, Neary? Oh, look at that. Oh, they're from... Oh, Kinga. Oh. Big up, Kinga. Big up to the Kinga. Kinga has found these gorgeous pieces on the... Um, Jewelry Maker Share Your Makes page. This is from Jeanette. Oh, some lovely pieces that I see. I love those oranges, oh, see, reds, those and pinks so together. Together as well. Yeah. Yeah, isn't it lovely the way that they yeah. all kind of <laughs> they kind of <laughs> tessellate together. They look gorgeous, don't they? It's beautiful the way they all kind of click together, isn't it? Yes. I'm guessing that's just on memory wire. Absolutely gorgeous. So sweet. Those colours work so nicely together. I assume that's on something like memory wire. That's just yeah. gorgeous. You put the seed beads on the memory wire. Can you see that? Isn't that lovely? Um, the phone lines are going nuts for these. Now, the, there is the th this thing about the Lucite flowers is that they're very large kits. The price for the, whether you are going to be making, oh, and by the way, you get all your shell pearl as well. You get your shell pearl and you get your silver plated copper wire as well, 10 meters in your 0.8 millimeter gauge. Cake toppers. If you make wedding cakes, birthday cakes, and you want to make a lovely topper, um, I don't know about I don't know about anybody else here, but um, if, if you have a cake topper made from sugar, um, made from icing, it will only last a little bit because then it'll just kind of disintegrate over the years. These will last forever, you know. So great for cake top. Make a plain white cake with plain white fondant icing, yeah. the most simple yeah. cake, and just decorate it with loads of lucite flowers. It's yeah. gonna look absolutely gorgeous. Gonna look. See those earrings there? They're so flower fairyish. They're so delicately coloured. They're not bright, overpowering. They're delicate. They're vintage, and I love the stamen you've added in as well with the head pins. Yeah, and this one. Yeah, look at these. Look at those stamens. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh, they're so lovely. Use the flowers to make uh, door, cur ah. door curtains. Door curtains. One of those with, the, with like the little oh, strands. The beaded cut. Oh, my gosh, that's yeah, so that's cool. That's a good idea. 
Oh, I love that idea. Oh, how lovely. Lovely from, uh, to uh, kind of introduce these maybe into little fairy gardens, yes. things like See, that. See, that one looks quite a bit like a fairy, that yellow one. That, yeah. That was on the screen a minute ago. It's like a lemon meringue kind of colour. But then there's a much brighter yellow here. Yeah. Um, so you've got different tones within all of these. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? I mean, even with your card making, you could make little fairies to go in cards. And you absolutely can, yeah. $39.99. Oh, yes. Go, 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 go. Well done. There's so many people uh, coming through to get these. Um, Neary, Neary, can you give me a, a rough idea of how many Lucite flowers you get in this, in this kit? In this kit, you get two strands of your shell pearl, 10 metres of your silver plated copper wire. You get one, two, three, four, five different sets of flowers with loads of different colours. And you get, yeah, I know, darling, it, it, it is, it, it, there's a lot of flowers. There's a lot of flowers. 485 wow. <laughs> of your lucite flowers. That's exciting. I feel like there's more as well. That explains why I didn't use them all. Do you think someone got bored counting them halfway through and just thought, <laughs> ah, stuff it, 400. Well, I don't know what I've made there. That's amazing. I don't actually know what I've created there. <laughs> no, but it's pretty. But I quite like that. Oh my gosh, little, and I bet if you oh, followed yeah. that all the way around, that would make a full circle. Oh my gosh, yeah, I'm sorry, Monica, you've lost me now. You could attach that to it like an Alice band. Just like that all the way. Oh, around. that's a gorgeous <laughs> idea. Right, okay, I'm off. Right, um, 39.99, great, isn't it? <clears throat> it's not your price. Nope, we're going lower. It's like when you try and hold loads of cups, isn't it? <laughs> pint, pint glasses, not that I would know, obviously, but when I've seen people carrying pint glasses, no, because I don't know. Okay, 39.99. <laughs> It's not your price point today. We are going to go even lower. I'm having the time of my life here. All the way down. Oh, look, I'm making a little rainbow thing. I like this. It's lovely. I like, I've done a jewellery. I've done a jewellery. <laughs> here we go. You can make lots of flower fairies. Yes, I know. How lovely. 29 99 There you go, everyone. Absolutely real. Go, 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 go. Loads of you coming through. It's, it's, it's absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Well done, everybody. What a tremendous deal. I think that's, that's part of the fun with this, is if you give this bundle to different people, 10 different people, they'll pick out 10 different colour combinations. I, I think I said that, actually, when we gave this to gorgeous Hannah Osborne. Love you, sweetheart. Um, we said you give this to 10 different guest designers and they'll all come up with something different. Yeah. And that's what's so great. I love what you've done there. I really love that. I think that's lovely. You've got an opportunity to ombre with this if you want to, Absolutely, haven't you? Yeah. You've got an opportunity to do all sorts of different things with this. I love the idea of seasonal wreaths. I love the idea of table centers. I love the idea of uh, little brooches of fascinators, hair slides. Um, it, it's just gorgeous, isn't it? Well done, everybody. Absolutely brilliant. Well done. Um, there are yeah, eight pieces that Monica Actually, made here. Actually, another five pair of earrings in my bag. <laughs> oh, did you? <laughs> I don't have any space to put the rest out. <laughs> literally, she's just literally got loose like flowers coming out of her coming out of her ears. Uh, well done, everybody. I just I'm just loving all of this. Um, Three seventy five, and she had and loads half, left. About half the. For each piece so. of jewellery. We're not done. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. All I'm going to say to you is, settle in, because this is going down. Oh, hello. What was that noise? And the thing with the Lucite flowers is uh, they are hard to find. And when you do find them elsewhere, they are expensive. Yeah, super expensive. Yeah. Yeah, they are not cheapy cheaps at all. They are absolutely gorgeous. I'm making a little village here. I don't know exactly what I'm doing, but I'm just having the absolute time of my life. They almost look like sort of fairy Christmas trees. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes, I love that idea. Or a really awesome pair of flares, maybe. Oh, I, yeah. I don't know. They're, oh, they're just got, I just love them. Um, yeah, Lucite Flares Hydrangea Necklace, £208. Oh, what? Hello. Hydrangeas, blah, blah, blah. They're Lucite, aren't they? How many have they used there? Like half a dozen. Look at these. You've got 480. Well, 24 .99. Well, that's the thing, because 
because I had this huge bundle of them, so it, it makes me want to use a lot of them in one piece, but you yeah. don't have to use a lot of them in one piece. You can no. make it like that necklace and use 10 or 12 pieces. Absolutely. In one. That's exactly it. I just, I just love, I'm loving, I know, I'm sorry. I know, I've just got to stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is amazing, isn't it? I just, oh, no, I've, I've, I've done a... There we go. That's that's what you want, isn't it? There you go. That's better. That's better. Well done, everybody. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through. Loads of people there. This is absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Gorgeous. Um, you've got so... Yeah, you've got so many options here. Baskets are rammed. Now, this is one of those kits which I'm so pleased to say we had a really decent quantity of, you know, huge quantities, um, which is absolutely brilliant. But... Um, there are lots of you coming through. So when you start layering these up as well and you're putting the la smaller ones inside the larger ones, that's when it really starts to yep. create something beautiful. Like you've done with those gorgeous red earrings, uh, you know, when you start to put the lighter ones inside the darker ones or vice versa. Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous? They're so lovely, aren't they? They're just gorgeous. And I also love the sort of the frosted effect that they have. They, they look almost like they're soft. Yes, they look like they're wax, don't they? Um, again, it's back to that kind of Lalique glasswork. They look a little bit like Lalique glasswork, don't they? With that lovely kind of frosted kind of uh, quality to them. If we can see 21 people on the phones. Ooh. By the way, I'm not trying to imply for one second that these aren't popular. Look how many people have checked out. But we started with over 200 of this kit. Oh, Ollie, by the way, Ollie, we've got these as well. Ten, ten pieces. Oh, okay, fair enough. Oh. Gorgeous. I love them with the crystals, don't you? Yeah. So cute. Oh, yeah. Love them with the crystals. Sorry, these are Hannah's. Oh, bless you, darling. Love these with the crystals. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, great for interior design. Great for kind of um, hot glue getting to, uh, to a picture frame. Napkin rings. Napkin yeah. rings. What a lovely idea. Oh my gosh, you could do these for maybe your wedding. Little table centers, yes. napkin rings, hair designs. Yeah, they're just gorgeous. Oh, they're beautiful. Yeah, great for little flower girls, as, um, as uh, Monica was saying. Yeah. Ready? 60 second clock, we're gonna go again. Mm. Oh yeah, well done everyone. Oh my gosh, absolutely brilliant, aren't they? Well done. I'd like to just extend our congratulations to absolutely everyone. These are so much fun. Whatever age you are, whether you're seven, whether you're 70, it doesn't matter. You know, anybody can use these. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? And you're gonna have so much fun, maybe over the summer holidays, over May half term, over the next few months, over the next few years, because you get so many of them. You get approximately 480 of these, plus you get two strands of your gorgeous shell pearl as well, and 10 meters of your wire as well. It's just gorgeous. Well done, everybody, just in just incredible well done how many have gone so far near new oh my gosh look at this isn't that lovely well you're guaranteed 480 i think you are getting more i think i think um ollie's right i think someone got bored counting these halfway through and decided ah, stop. i don't count them that's for sure you get a lot <laughs> You guess a lot. Ready, steady, 21 pounds and 99 pence. Absolutely amazing. It has gone nuts. Well done. Yeah. It literally look, it looks like those shell pearls are raining. It does. It, it does. looks like they're ca just cascading, dripping down. They're just beautiful, aren't they? Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. 0800 644 That's just gorgeous. Look at all these people. My gosh, can you understand why I can't give name checks to everyone? Please check out. And I really feel like the, with the Lucite flies, every time they come to air, they're very, very popular. They just fly. I don't think this is everybody's first rodeo with these. I think there's a lot of people who are reordering these for the second, maybe even the third or fourth time. What do you think, Monica? I think so, because once you start with them, you kind of can't stop. Hence why I made like 12 pairs of earrings. <laughs> totally addictive. <laughs> totally addictive. You're, you're literally, you know, people will start coming around your house and there'll be loose like flowers everywhere. We've had, uh, we've had people saying, you know, they've made door uh, curtains. That's so cool. There's the rest of my earrings if you want to see them. <laughs> oh, let's see. <laughs> oh, Monica. Oh, gosh, I haven't seen that colour before. That's... Oh, oh, gosh, that's lovely. I only found three in that colour, so I put one in the hair slide and then one for a pair of earrings. 
you could you could start a whole company and and just create and just create a um you could start a company and just make little flower garden jewelry um that's just a pair of it's a stud it's basically a head pin ah the butterfly on the back that is very clever this is so lovely because look they've all got little holes in yep Oh, yeah, yeah, go to your local garden centre and say, hey, can I sell my Lucite flower jewellery um, uh, in, you know, in your garden centre? Of course they're going to say yes. <laughs> How wonderful is that? Just gorgeous. Or go into your local florist and sell pieces in there, brooches. I was also um, thinking of making almost like a bouquet because with the wire, you could make flower stems well, and then hold them together well, as a bouquet. This is it, Monica. When I got married, I had fresh flowers in my bouquet. It's beautiful. It's dried. It's lovely. But it, literally one kind of touch and the whole thing will just yeah. disintegrate. Whereas these are going to last forever. Well done. So we're going to move on to a demo, yeah? No. no. <laughs> right. Hold on to something. Oh, no. <laughs> we have staggered the phone lines for this moment if you're one of the 125 people who've got this in your baskets please move it to the checkout part because this is about to go even lower this is crazy i think you all know where we're going are you sitting at home going no they no they're not no <laughs> don't be no don't be ridiculous they can't no yes yes <laughs> yes i tell you i tell it i tell you this for nothing this is the most amazing deal for any kit. Isn't that amazing? Akoya pearls before the break. Lucite flowers. Can you think of anything which is this good value for money? Can you think of anything where you get more bang for your buck? I seriously can't. Prom corsages, wedding bouquets, buttonholes, fascinators, Alice bands, festoon lighting, Fairy lights, decorate a bedroom, decorate a nursery, candles. decorate candles. your candles. 20 quid, 20 quid. Who cares what you decorate? <laughs> Gosh. 19. I mean, just for the shell 99. pearls and the wire, that's a good price for the shell pearls and the wire, isn't it? It's incredible. Absolutely amazing. 200 people on the phone lines. We did warn you. We did warn you. We were going to be doing it, you know, gentle kind of, uh, you know, uh, slow crashes, which is exactly what we've done to try and stagger those phone lines. It has gone completely and utterly nuts. I think one of my favourite things is you've got the opportunity to go, you know, to, for instance, delicate blue and pink, which is beautiful, or really bright, intense blue and pink. That's what's so cool. Yeah. It's about the variety that you're getting here. It's about... The, the areas which you can go into, delicacy or bright, bright, bright. Um, baskets. I'm going to give baskets a bit of a shove now. Marianne in Norfolk, Maker, Nancy in Leicestershire, Shirley in Somerset, Maker, Patricia in Shropshire, Chloe and Kent, you've got three in your basket, Judith in Surrey, Nicholas in Surrey, Kim in West Midlands, Janice in Manchester, Kerry in Bucking, uh, Berkshire, Fiona in Yorkshire, Jennifer in Surrey, Anne in Nottinghamshire, Marianne in Norfolk, Nancy in Leicestershire, Maker and a load more of you. Please check out. Well done, everybody. Go, 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 go. Even just to practice your colour combinations, you know, you can just sit down with all of these for, for hours and just pick hours, out colour combinations yeah. and experiment. And then when you, when you get a nice colour combination that you like, take a picture of it so that you, you, know, you remember for next time. Definitely. Um, yes, very unusual for Monica <laughs> to go for purples, isn't it? So unusual. Not. That unexpected then. Yes. <laughs> Well, you know, demo, what are you going to do, lovely? <laughs> well, I, show, uh, I thought I'd show you how to make the hair slide. Yes, this is such a nice uh, hair slide. I love it. Because that's a bit different to the, to the necklaces. So um, it's very grown up. Uh, I've used one of these hair slides, which we used to have in stock. We haven't got any at the moment. We, I don't know if we're going to get any more in. So you might have one of these in your stash, or if not, you can recycle one of your old, even a plastic one, you know, it doesn't matter. It's, it's, it's nice sometimes to recycle your old, older pieces. And then in the kit, you get a spool of 0.6 millimeter wire, which is actually probably the most useful uh, thickness of wire, I would think, because that's the perfect width for rosary linking. So mm. that was another idea I had. I just didn't have time to make it up, is to make a, a long line necklace, just rosary linking with some of the flowers and the, and mm -hmm. the pearls. So um, 
the way I've made the hair slide, if I bring it over so you can see what I'm talking about. Whoop. So I'll just put it over there. So it's basically similar to what we used to demonstrate a few times is the, um, uh, the tiara technique. But it's a simplified version, really. And because you've got thicker wire, the, the, the 0.6 wire, because usually for tiara technique, we use uh, a 0.4 uh, wire. This is a little bit thicker, so it kind of holds its shape a bit better. Mm. So all I did was I started with a comfortable length of wire. It doesn't have to be too long. So I'm just going to use probably half a meter here. So cut off a section of wire. And there you go. Now, this is quite organic, and it's quite easy to do. So even if you've never made anything like this before, and I'll be the first to admit that I'm not a wire working expert, so you don't need to be an expert to be able to do this. Um, all you need to do, you're going to start off by attaching your wire to your hair slide. Now, the only thing you've got to watch out for is, if you imagine, the curved piece is going to be against your head. So you don't want any of the pointy bits of your wire towards uh, your skin. So when you twist your wire around, just to anchor it in the beginning, just make sure that the cut bit is facing the top of the, um, of the hair slide. So cut off the end over there. So you see, and then you can squish it in a bit with your pliers. Uh, but don't squish it in so much that it's pointing inwards because you don't want it to scratch. Okay, so just wrap your wire around a couple of times just so that it's anchored. And then you're going to thread on your flowers. So the way I did this is I did sort of um, a double row of the large flowers in the back, mm, and then I added a lovely. few more smaller ones in the front. Okay, so I'm going to pick up one of my big flowers, and then I've put some of the smaller flowers underneath the big flowers so that it kind of covers up the hair slide. So just like that, and then a pearl. Now the holes in the pearls are plenty big enough for this wire. Yes. It's a matter of actually finding where the hole is. Did you get any, were there any blockages at all? Or were they all kind any? of, were any of the holes blocked at all? Or were they all fine? Um, there was one that was, one, one flower I found where the hole wasn't quite big enough to get the wire through twice. But the hole was still plenty big enough to Okay, to grill. Uh, except in this case, I'm going to go through it twice. So there was only one flower that I came across that was like that anyway. Um, right, then what you want to do is you want to hold the flowers in position, okay? But you want to bring the pearl out a little bit because if you push your pearl right in, and then I'm going to go back with the wire through the flowers again, but then you're going to have the wire pointing at the top. So can you see on these ones, I haven't got the wire at the top because I don't really want to see the wire, I want to see the pearl. So the way I did that was you want to pull the pearl out a little bit, okay? So maybe, well, basically as far as you can still hold the pearl, but it's not sitting right in. And then what you want to do is you want to kink the wire under the pearl just a little bit. Uh, so can you see now if I let it go, the pearl doesn't fall into the flower. Yeah. And the reason for that is because when you take your wire then and you thread it back through your flowers, go through both your flowers, and then you pull the wire. Now you want to make sure you don't kink the wire when you're pulling it. So pull, pull the two bits apart so they don't kink. So when you pull the wire, you've got to pull quite hard. But when you pull it, now this one's not doing it only because it's live on air. Oh, it's only because my flowers moved away from the bottom. So if your flower's positioned correctly and you pull it, can you see that the pearl's turned? So now the, the little bit of wire at the top is not at the top anymore. You can even use your pliers to pull if you want to pull a bit harder. Yeah. And it kind of turns the pearl on its side. Okay. Then you want to take your wire around your... And I did it quite randomly. I didn't... Um, count anything, you know, I didn't, um, I didn't really even plan it out, to be honest with you. I just did it randomly because obviously, because it's on a wire, you can sort of rearrange it afterwards and you can shift the flowers around to sit in a, in a way that looks pleasing. So all I, the only thing I sort of planned was to do the different colours. So like, for example, there I did a blue and a blue. So now I can do one of these purple flowers and I can do a pale blue. And again, a pearl. Gorgeous. Okay, and then again, I'll show you again. So you bring it down. You hold the flowers in position. And then you bring the pearl down, but not all the way into the flower. A little bit higher. 
sort of where you want it to sit, but a little bit. So basically don't let it drop into the flower, just pull it out a little bit and then kink it under the pearl. So behind the pearl there, so not here. It doesn't matter if it kinks a little bit there as well, but as long as it kinks underneath. Okay, and then you pull your wire back through your flowers again. And honestly, this whole hairpin took me probably a half an hour to make. Oh, that's awesome. Um, so it's not that time consuming because your flowers are quite big. So um, it kind of makes up quickly, you know. Now I have got a kink in my way here. So if you do get a kink like that, just straighten it out before you pull it through because you don't want to get a sort of a, a sharp kink in your wire because that's going to make it break, it's going to turn into knots and it's going to cause all sorts of trouble. So can you see how that pearl's pulled right into there? And you can't even see the wire anymore. And then again, just wrap around your frame only once, really. You don't need to wrap it around too many times. And then you can kind of just rearrange it so that it looks pretty. And then afterwards, when I've gone all the way along, then you can come back in between and you can wind your wire in between your flowers to come back again. So like, for example, uh, some, some of them, when I've finished all the flowers, because I have the large flowers underneath, not the large flowers, the small flowers under the large flower, but they're larger sort of that way. Um, there was a bit of gapping between the, the big flowers. So I went back and I added some flowers. Uh, I don't know if you can see one here, like this orange one here. I added just the big flower, so there's nothing underneath. Yeah. That one is just a big flower, just, just like that, with a pearl. And I squished it in between to fill up a gap. So you can do that. And then afterwards, I came along the bottom edge. So I came back to the beginning here. And then I started adding the leaves. So then you just add, it's the same thing again. You just add a leaf, and then you can add any of these sort of the medium-sized flowers. And then a pearl again. So it's exactly the same thing, just different, different flowers. There you go, and then you can sort of turn the, the leaf around so that it kind of covers your hair slide a little yeah. bit. And you do the same thing again. So you want to bring your pearl down almost to your flower, but not quite, and kink it underneath. And then bring your wire back through the flower, flowers. So the only thing that takes time really is just to, you want to just be careful with your wire so that it doesn't kink because also as soon as it kinks, then you can't pull it through anymore. And that's when you get all the, um, all the issues with it. So just try to keep your wire straight. So. Oh, I've just delivered a wedding commission with lucite flowers from a previous kit in the headpiece. The bride loves it. Oh, oh Fiona, that's gorgeous. Send us that's a photo. Cute. Send us a photo. Studio at jewelrymaker.com. We'd love to see that. Lots of people saying um, that they've taken the plunge. They've never had a go with lucite flowers before, but they're going to give it a go. And also, honestly, it's brilliant. Also, what's great with the lucite flowers is, I don't know if you saw just then, that I, I wasn't careful with it at all. I mean, I'm pu pulling it with the pliers and I'm holding onto yeah, the flowers. They're really they're super They're really strong. strong. I, I didn't break a single one while I was making this uh, headpiece and I was really fighting with the wire at some points, you yeah. know? <laughs> and then you just wind it around again and you move along to the next position where you want to add the next so flower. Organic. I love and that. you just keep going like that. And it's really simple and quick and quite quick to make. That's and so then lovely. again, when, you, when your wire gets finished, then just make sure that you wind it on so that the top, the pointy bit of your wire is at the top again before um, you cut off a little bit of from the end. You would have a little piece left, obviously, if your wire was finished. And then you start a new piece in the same way again. Um, and then when you've completely finished as well, it's the same again. Just make sure you keep cutting the wire on the top side instead of the bottom side so that it's not um, scratchy. Gorgeous. And that's it, really. That's so lovely. And literally, the world is your oyster. Whatever Absolutely. colours you want to go for, whatever patterns you want to go for. Lovely to get your kind of tips on how to kind of get that good base and how to fill in those kind of gaps as well. That's really useful to see. Thank you so much. I used to use Lucite Flowers to decorate real uh, horseshoes for weddings. Oh. They're lovely to work with. Glad I've got this set, says Kerry. Oh, what a lovely wow. idea for luck. That's just yeah. gorgeous. Look, um, there's still loads in baskets. Oh. Still loads in baskets. Please check out Heather, Jacqueline, Chloe, Judith. Um, Jacqueline, you've got three in your basket. Charlotte, Janice, Fiona, Jennifer, Hazel, Caroline, Julie, Susan, Kathy, Georgia, I mean, Gabby. Whatever Those kind more. of jewellery you make, I mean, I promise you're going to have fun with this kit. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> 
please check out as quickly as you can. Eleanor in baskets, look, we've got so many there. We're literally going to give you a minute to close and we're taking those details away. And then if you got any of the kits in the nine o'clock hour, the crystals would look amazing in the centre of the flowers as well that yeah. were in those kits. Absolutely. Well done, everybody. So many people still coming through. These are so addictive, these kits. You'll get them home and you'll be literally making flowers for every, every you know, for jewellery, for clothing, for interior designs, for gifts. You could make a um, nice spring gorgeous. wreath to go on your door. Well, I think, yeah, seasonal oh. wreaths, just so lovely. And, you know, they're going to be waterproof, you know, that you know, put them outside in your garden, make little flower garden, uh, sorry, little fairy gardens with oh. them. Um, you know, they're lovely. Put um, uh, um, LED fairy lights, make sure they're LED fairy lights, for goodness sake, LED fairy lights. Um... Oh, yeah, a little, oh, yeah, fairy jewellery, oh, yeah. you know, just so cute. It's going to be so, people are just going to love things like this. Those earrings are so cute. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? And they're just so delicate. You've got an entire business idea here, an Absolutely. entire collection you could, you could idea here. You could fill a whole market store just with this one kit. Totally. Turned it all totally. into jewellery. Yep, absolutely. Little garlands to put on your craft store, just to decorate your craft store. Well done. Gorgeous. Right. We've got elasticity uh -huh. because if you want to make elasticated bracelets or if you want to make anything kind of stretchy with a course for lucite flowers or anything that we bought you today, you're going to need elastic. Um, you would have thought elastic is elastic is elastic, isn't it? No. Elasticity. This has not been to air this year. This is your black elasticity. Um, it's made by Beadalon. Honestly, you think you've used elastic before in your jewellery? No. This is the best, the absolute best. Um, it's very, very stretchy. My advice to you is when you do use it in your jewellery, condition it first. So give it a really good stretch first and then it will take out some of that elasticated quality and that's what you want. And then the great thing about this is this is the 0.5. So this is one of the thinnest elastics that we do, but it is very, very strong. Normally your elasticated cords are much, much thicker. Because this is 0.5, you can use it with a lot of pearls, yes. which is great, or, or gemstones or beads with slightly finer drill holes. So it's absolutely brilliant. Um, great for use with your darker, uh, darker gems, darker beads, or if you want to see the threading material, sometimes you really want to see the threading material. It's great stuff, this. And you can really rely on it. Uh, it's gorgeous quality. Your deal today, Denise, Vivian, Jackie, make it. This has got birthday written all over it. It really does. Talking about seeing the threading material, I would like to try to make a stretchy bracelet using that black elasticity with pearls, but knotted. Oh, gosh, that's a nice idea. So knotted pearl bracelet that's stretchy. Also, now, yeah. these were big during the kind of the, the 90s. Do you remember those lovely kind of chokers? And, and they've kind of come back into fashion, those lovely kind of uh, yeah. woven chokers that you'd wear. You need to make them the correct kind of width, obviously. You don't want them too tight, obviously. Uh, but you can make lovely little kind of chokers with these as well. Yeah. It's really high quality material, this is. Gorgeous kind of shine to it. Really beautiful kind of little woven or knotted. I like the idea of knotting with it. I think that's great. Yes. Well done. Six ninety ninety deal today. Absolutely brilliant. Let's do a minute to close, shall we? Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Great, great deal for you. So gives, even gives you a little tutorial on how to tie a knot into elastic, oh. uh, which is a butcher's knot, basically. Um, so, yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Now, we've got time for, I believe, one more thing after this. Um, and it is a strand of emerald. Mm -hmm. It's not just any strand of emerald. It literally is the best one of the best strands of emerald we have ever had on Jewelry Maker. The clarity and quality is absolutely superb. So um, uh, just amazing. So your elasticity, um, beadle on black, 0.5 millimeter gauge elastic, yours today for six pounds, 99 pence. Well done, everyone. Um, could you use it on your loom? I would say so, yes. To make a stretchy loom. I reckon, I mean, you use it, well, you use your and you use your loom bands with your loom. With your, you? Yeah, and that's mm. stretchy. Mind you, it's a band though. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Um, I don't see why not. Depends on it. Depends on the, depends on the design, I guess. Anyway, yeah. food for thought. Right. Star by Exceptional Emerald. Let's go.
Oh, I'm a bit of an emerald nut. Um, I, I love it. It's my birthstone. It's May's. It's a birthstone of May. Emerald is a, a, a variety of beryl where inclusions are almost encouraged. They're known as jardins inside emerald. Quite often you miss them because quite often the clarity in emerald isn't, isn't that great. It's a very, very delicate stone in the way that it forms. It forms in kind of um, shards. But the thing with emerald is because it's a member of the beryl family, you get quite a delicate gemstone, which is normally littered with so many inclusions. And that's OK. It's kind of encouraged in a lot of emeralds. But when you get emerald, which has got clarity, it literally it is like next level. And that is what we've got for you today. This is this can only be from one location in the world. Actually, no, it could be from one of two locations. It could be from Ethiopia. I've never bought you a strand of Ethiopian emerald or it could be from Zambia. These are from Zambia. <coughs> For the very first time ever, when this gemstone was discovered, I can't remember when it was. I want to say 1976, but I, I, that might be a lie. But the. Oh, commercially mined in the 1970s. There we go. Um, so this incredible gemstone, when it was first discovered in Zambia, it totally turned the emerald world on its head, upside down, back to front and sideways. Because up until that point, emerald was a beautiful gemstone which was never known to have clarity, never known to have moments like this. Zambian emerald changed it forever. It is from a very thin, Ba uh, belt of land in um, the north of Zambia. And you've got a gemstone, an emerald, which for the first time ever exhibits clarity. Moments of clarity. Now, when you get your emerald, um, from Zambia, you can expect a couple of different things. You can expect a much higher iron content than its um, Brazilian counterpart. So it gets more of a glow and chrome, sorry, I beg your pardon, chromium content, which gives it a better glow. It's got vanadium in it, which gives it its incredible color as well. But you can expect to get over a hundred different shades of green. Uh, Zambian emeralds, particularly from Gemfield's mine, is, is famous for having you know, over a hundred different shades of emerald. It is incredibly hard to get decent carat weights of this gemstone because of the very nature of how it forms. You're looking at something here which formed over 500 million wow. years ago. Now, the clarity, the colour, the saturation you are getting here is like off the scale, off the scale. You do not get emerald like this from Colombia, not even from Brazil. I think you'd be hard pushed to get this kind of quality from Ethiopia. We're at 99 99. We're nowhere near done. 30 second clock. Cheshire, Essex, Hampshire, South, uh, North Yorkshire's got two. Kent, well done. Now, I will say to you, it has become the world's most famous emerald because of its clarity, because of its glow, because of its quality. It's not known for its low price points because of all of those incredible features with this, which this incredible gemstone has. For today only, we're about to take this to the lowest ever price. Are you ready? Enjoy. Have a look at this. Airship, you're there. You're there. There's so many people there. Well done. £29.99 pence for world class emeralds. Emeralds, oh my gosh. One of the big, and this is it. 
It's emerald. emerald. It's not like we're talking about some weird and wonderful gems that no one's ever heard of. It's not like we're talking about Gesundheit. You know, this is <laughs> one of the big five gems. We're talking emerald, sapphire, diamonds, tanzanite, ruby. We're talking about the big five gems. And this is it. This is the most instantly recognizable green gemstone in the world. And there's so many other gemstones, like your Russian diopside, like your beautiful, um, oh, what else was it? Russian diopside, Davrite garnet that we say, million dollar emeralds, they look like million dollar emeralds. I wish emerald looked like this. Well, today it does. Today it actually does look like it. And it's 20 quid, <laughs> just take it. Go, 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 go. It's, it's, it's stupid, it is a stupid oh, price. God. It's a ridiculous price. How many do we have, Neri? A hundred chances. Oh my gosh. I, I'm going to make you a promise here. If there's any left, I'm having them. I think Monica might be having them too. I think I might. Because <laughs> that is literally obscene. 1999. You go anywhere in the world and try and find genuine, natural Zambian emerald. Oh, by the way, the O in brackets just means it's been oiled. All that means is it's just literally had an oil put on the outside just to help seal the gem because it's a very uh, naturally porous gemstone. So it, it's just incredible. We're going to leave it with you. We want to get the Branca uh, bundle in. 22 left, just go for it, go, go, go. One final deal, and then we're all gonna go and have a lie down. <laughs> I love these, I love these. It's like a Coca-Cola color, I love it. Yeah. Branca, Onyx, three, no, it's not three. Is it three strands? It's three strands, four, six, and eight mil rounds. It's a go, 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 Ghost Onyx, 199. Look at that with the emerald. What? Oh, wow. Bad boy, bad boy, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna put you with the gorgeous emerald. Oh. Tell you what I'm also going to do. Oh, very ethereal, isn't it? Isn't that nice? Lovely. Isn't that lovely? Ethereal. Very yes, good. I love it. The glow, the glow, the beautiful glow. Branca Onyx. There you go. Well done. Not your deal today. Make it all win. Well done to you. Greater Manchester coming through. So good to see you all today. Congratulations. Well done. Beautiful wonderful bright white gem. Very few other bright white gemstones out there with your incredible um, glowing translucency. 69 pounds. Oh my gosh, that's good. That's for all three. That's for all three. Wow. Six, uh, four, six and eight mil rounds. Absolutely incredible for 69 pounds. Well done, Anne and Merseyside. We've got more makers coming through. This is utterly brilliant. Well done. What an opportunity with your 30 day money back guarantee. And please don't forget as well, you've also got, um, you, you're also only paying 3.95 p and per order. An absolutely awesome opportunity for you today. Well done. And use that with your black um, elasticity. Yes. That's really gonna shine through, isn't it? Yes, that, oh, that would be nice. That'd be nice. Mm -hmm. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Loads of you coming through, well done. Monica, it's been an absolute pleasure. You're with oh. us over our birthday celebration. Yes, on the 8th. So on the second Monday. Oh, fantastic. Oh, that'll be lovely. Thank you so much. Today. You've been wonderful today, Monica. Oh, yeah, it's been really fun today. I'm still going to get you to draw a circle next time you're on. <laughs> she was giggling at me. I'll just draw around the wire. Oh, no, that's cheating. <laughs> that's so cheating. Thank you so much for joining us today. It's been a brilliant, brilliant uh, morning with you on uh, Jewelry Maker. You've got the most amazing, amazing uh, show this afternoon on Hobby Maker with Zena and the gang. It's going to be loads and loads of fun. Don't go anywhere. We will see you at the other side of this for a fantastic afternoon. Don't go anywhere. Go to our website. Check everything out that you can. Uh, Zena and the gang will see you after this. See you in a sec. <laughs>